Hey, 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 everybody. Damn, that's a little loud. Put this shit down. <laughs> hey, everybody. I'm your host, Doug Grande Gato, also known as the Big Cat. My cool cat, but What's up? If you're rocking with the Big Cat, glad you guys are back for another evening show. Where the fun doesn't ever end on this show. All right, we're going to talk about the Carolina Panthers 2021 stat prediction for the players. All right, we're going to break down who gets what, how it all plays out. Who makes the Pro Bowl? Who doesn't? We're going to get into it, all right? So stay back, sit back, get your beer, get you some chips, enjoy the show. Let me get everything set up. Um, set the thumbnail, play some music. I'll be right with you guys.
All right, all right. Let's have a good show tonight. Good show tonight. Oh, yeah, I'm feeling the vibe. Shout out to my dog, Chazilla. As always, banging out the beats. Have a good show tonight. Salute, cheers. Oh yeah, been a while, been a while. We back though. Shout out to Chazil, I'm vibing. I'm, I'm in my mood. Yeah. I tell you that. I tell you what, right here, man. I tell you what. Shout out to Chazilla, man. I mean, there's nothing that man can do. The, the best beat maker I know. Personally, I mean, when you listen to one of his tracks, you just lose yourself. You're not something you guys have to get high. <laughs> get high with the right sequence of notes and stuff. Hey, everybody, I'm your host, Grand Gato, also known as the Big Cat. I'm going to put the balls up if you're rocking with the Big Cat. No, long time no see, but we're bike, baby. Got a few announcements we're, we're going to do here in just a second. Uh, but first, uh, let me show you guys some love in the chat. I don't know what was going on with the YouTube stream tonight. Something happened when I was trying to enter in my key. And um, shit, I don't know. But hey, whoever's here, whoever's here, that's who's going to get a good show. That's what we're going to do. So again, uh, shout out to everybody that's here. And uh, prayers up for everybody that's not. All right, let's show you guys some love. And then we'll get into uh, our routine and our announcements. Shout out to Antoine Lynch. Shout out to Jerome Shit Talking Pruitt. This mic is too fucking loud. Testing one, two. Testing one, two. Shout out to Jerome Shit Talking Pruitt, three point guy for the rent. Trade Daddy. Hey, Trade Daddy. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Trade Daddy. Happy birthday, Trade Daddy. Happy birthday, dear Trade Daddy. Happy birthday, Trade Daddy. Paul's up and many more. Happy birthday to you, Trade Daddy. Yeah, I know who you are, by the way. Shout out to your sweet thing. <laughs> she know who she is. Shout out to Trey Daddy. Hunter Wolf. What's up, Hunter Wolf? Timmy Stakes. Patrick Lockler. I see you, my brother. Uh, Lorenzo Pickett. I see you, Rocket 81. D Wade. Antonio Drain. Um, Todd Parker. I see you. 74 Chat. Paul's up. Yes, sir. Repping the home team. I see you, repping the home team. Kendall Francis. Paul's up. Yes, sir. Tony Smith. Brandon Maroney. What's up, Brandon Maroney? Paul's up. Ty Monkman. Yes, sir. Been a while, but we bike. We bike. Shout out to D-Wade, I see ya. Yeah, Chazilla killed those beats as usually. Shout out to my dog, Chazilla. Make sure you head over to Chazilla Beats on Instagram at Chazilla Beats with the Z on the end. Shout out to him. D-Cash, I see D-Cash. Cosmotron, what's up, Cosmotron? The King, down with the King. Ding, ding, ding. Shout out to the King. Robert Foxworthy, I see you, my brother. Big Cat, what's up, I see you. Vash, what's up, Vash? And shout out to PD Quick. Yes, sir. PD Quick. Don't want to be quick in the bedroom. Shout out to old man underscore 803. Charles Well, I see you, man. Live from the Bahamas. Yeah, man. Drink me a mango lime and a tikiki. Shout out to each and every one of you guys. I got one quick question. Seriously, you got to bring it down a little bit. I got one quick question for you guys. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's a little sensitive, but let's do it. Do you love the Carolina Panthers like I love the Carolina Panthers? Yes. No, maybe. Do you love the Carolina Panthers like Panthers? If you love the Carolina Panthers like I love the Carolina Panthers, uh, put your paws up because we got one more month left before it's time to get back on the field. It's time to go to work. Oh, yes. Carolina on top forever. All right. Shout out to all the sponsors. Seek it smart with your buy. If you guys are looking to buy any kind of tickets, and everything you can use the promo code Keep Pounding TV. One word on Seek it. Say you guys so, say you got some money. Be sure to check out Patreon. Keep Pounding TV Patreon for exclusive access, content, live streams, and as we go into the uh, 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 the regular season, you're gonna have film breakdown and all that stuff. So you don't want to bail out just yet. It's coming around the corner. Use the uh, log in to uh, Patreon. Keep Pounding TV. A um, couple announcements here. I want to say shout out to each and everybody that's been. Um, Riding with me on the gaming channel. Yeah, but that's right. Big Cat Gaming on Twitch. The real Big Cat on Twitch. Big Cat Gaming on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. We've been having fun doing the streams and stuff over there. So make sure if you could go over there real quick. Show your boys some love. Um, oh, Fantasy Football. I think we're all full, y'all. We got we got one more league left, all right? Nobody wants to get in that league. That's the $100 league. <laughs> winner takes all. Last year, we had a winner take. 
uh, what's in there? Kevin Brown. Kevin Brown took over eight hundred dollars home. So yes, I mean it's not a it's not a facade. I mean you paid, you get in. But uh, yeah, so the only league that we got available now is the twelve hundred dollar league, where it's a hundred dollars an entry, twelve spots. So winner take off. If you interested, please cash at me. Let me know. Shout out to each and every one of you guys that cash at me throughout the week. Um, uh, I know y'all been checking on me, man. So I appreciate that. I, hey, I just been busy keeping myself busy doing stuff. Just wait for more topics to come up. But thank you for your love and support there. Now, I wanted to get into tonight's topic about um, the Carolina Panthers um, stat prediction. You know, I love football, you know. I love it. I mean, this is what I do, man. I had admirations of becoming a football player in the NFL. You know, it wasn't God's plan. So, hey, no need to cry with spilled milk. But I, I say that to say this. Every time I get a chance to watch film, to look at stats, to, to, to review it, I mean, it just – it's never tedious with it. I mean, it's it's always for the love. You know what I mean? So that inspired me to kind of go over some of our key player stats today. And um, I'm not going to go over everybody's stats. I'm going to knock out a, a regular video for that. It'll probably be like a 20-minute video. But I just want to knock out some key players here and why I chose to give them the stat that they got. All right? A lot of you guys have been looking at – Um, I've been watching you guys. I, I wasn't going to say nothing. I wasn't going to say nothing. A lot of you guys – Oh, boy, you guys are some critics. <laughs> a lot of you guys are – I mean, I love you, man, but a lot of you guys, like, okay, so the numbers that I came up with are based off of a lot of different things, you know what I mean? It's not me pulling numbers out of my ass, you know what I mean? But, like, a lot of people, when when, when I when I give them a chance to critique my uh, assessment – they say it's wrong or this wrong and this is way low or this is way high without even knowing what I factored in. I don't just, you know, scroll through fucking the internet and say, oh, that's a good number. <laughs> you know what I mean? I, I look at different things. I look at who we play in the division. I look at the person's talent. I look at how they're trending. I look at um, a, a player comparison versus somebody like, like somebody who who they're compared to and how they was coming in their second. I, I look at a lot of different things. So. I want to bring you guys clarity into what I saw, okay? Doesn't mean that I'm right. Doesn't mean that I'm wrong. It just means just just take a little time, y'all, and you do your own research. Let's start with uh, our quarterback here, Sam Darnold. <clears throat> I predicted for the 2021 season, uh -uh, 3,200 passing, y'all. That's that's <laughs> let's stay right there. Let me let me take it slow. I want to take it slow because I'm repping my quarterback. Hold on, y'all. Let me do him right. Hold on. Do it to your right, baby. Let me let me do it to your right real quick. Oh, give me a second. Let me pull up stats. Because a lot of you guys are, I think you're going to eat crow when it comes to Sam Darnold here. All right. Now, and we're gonna, let me take it slow. Just so bear with me, y'all. I chose 3,200 passing yards because that will be the most in his career. Sam Darnold in 2019 threw for 3,024 yards, which was, at the time was the most in his career. The lowest he's ever thrown for in his career was 2,200, which was last year. I factor in a, a fresh change of underwear when it comes to the Carolina Panthers system. I feel like, and a lot of you guys, I'm not ready to give Joe Brady his credit just yet. Um, We've seen Joe Brady struggle in the red zone when it comes to tight end usage. Um. I don't know, man, and I, and I get it, and I understand that you know he 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 led to one of the most powerful uh, all-time college offenses and all the other shit that does, it has nothing to do with nothing. But realistically, we have not seen the best of Joe Brady. You know, I mean, the fact that he pretty much got an interview all this offseason was based off of college. I mean, what what has he done this past year that made you just sit here and say, "Wow"? I mean, this guy's going to be phenomenal. You know what I mean? So with that being said, I still the verdict is still out on Joe Brady. I feel like Sam Donald's going to be in the system. And uh, I think it was Petey Quick. Sh shout out to Petey Quick, man. I got to give you your flowers, brother. Petey Quick said our offense is not the offense that comes out and looks to just daggers down the field, daggers down the field. That's not our offense. Nor has Joe Brady showed you that. 
If he showed you that, you you show me on tape where where consistently that's what our offense is day in and day out, Sunday and next Sunday and the Sunday after that and the Thursday night and the Monday. You show me where you seen that out of Joe Brady. So shout out to PD Quick. PD Quick. I think Sam Darnold is going to get um, an offense where he's going to pick and choose. You know what I mean? And I said this earlier, and, and I, of course I know a lot of Cam fans got up, got pissed off. But I sincerely wasn't taking a shot. I know it sounded like I was taking a shot, but I wasn't. I said, you know, and I really mean this, and I hope you guys see it this way. I don't need my quarterback to be Superman. I need my quarterback to be efficient, and I need him to be consistent. No shade. No shade. Not only do I not need my quarterback to be Superman, I don't need him to be Lamar Jackson. I don't need him to be Mahomes. I don't need him to be God. I don't need him to be Muhammad. I don't need him to be nobody but efficient and consistent. So, like I said, I wasn't taking a shot when, when I said that here. And that's what Sam Darn, this offense is. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be set up for him to pick and choose, you know. I don't see him really coming out here dominating this offense. Therefore, that's why I said 3,200 yards passing is the right fit for him. Um... And not to mention, you know, I think they're going to lean heavy on C-Mac on the ground if they're smart. That's the recipe the Tennessee Titans follow with Ryan Tannehill. Ryan Tannehill ain't came out here blazed nobody up. Ryan Tannehill leaned on that big boy, Derrick Henry, and he takes his shots. So if it's not broke, why try to fix it? So use the same recipe, Christian McCaffrey. I think that was, I think that's what's going to happen here. All right, Sam Darnold, he's going to be efficient. I mean, when when turnovers, when the defense get turnovers, you got a short field, I need you to be efficient. Make that turnover count. I need you to be consistent. I need you to do over and over again. If it's third down and 12, I don't need you to be Superman and try to get third down and four, a, a, a 40-yard bomb. I don't need that. I don't need that. A lot of you guys are so caught up in the holla. I told you that. Third down and 12, get you six yards, get off the field. I need you to be consistent and efficient. Save the highlights for the big, big other team that that's that's not gonna make the fucking. Are they gonna make the playoffs and then and then be at uh, one and done? Save that for them. Be efficient, Sam. Be consistent, Sam. And I don't care who likes it or who feelings got hurt behind it. I said what I said there. Thirty-two hundred yards. Let's continue here. Oh yeah, we cooking with grease tonight. Twenty-three touchdowns for Sam Darnold. Now again, this would be the high for Sam Darnold. I feel like, you know, the, the, the previous high was in 2019, along with his yardage. He had 19 total touchdowns. Excuse me, he had 19 passing touchdowns, which was, at the time, the highest. He don't know higher than 19. So, tw uh, 23 touchdowns, not bad. It's not bad at all. I need to give my man his credit right there. Again, I think Joe Brady, uh, Joe Brady's system is built on picking and choosing Taking it, you know what I mean? We have that, like I told you, we have that kind of sneaky, we counter you offense. You know what I mean? We don't, we don't have a, we don't have a, how can you put it? How can I put it? We don't have like on the attack offense. You know what I mean? You know how like, you know how like some offense, like, like, and, I, and I hate to be on these guys nuts, but like Kansas City, for example. Kansas City's offense is, they're coming out, they're punching you in your mouth. And they're going to put your ass on roller skates and you better find out how to stop it or you're going to be down 30 to nothing. That's not our, <laughs> that's not our offense. <laughs> that's not our, our offense is we're going to come out we're going to use our strategy. We're going to use our scheme. We're going to walk you down the field. We're going to eat up clock. We're going to take our shots. We're gonna, and then eventually we're going to counter you when you do the wrong thing. When you feel like you got us figured out, when you bring that extra man in the box, when you bring that extra man in the box, when you back a guy off of coverage, that's when we counter you at the right time. You know what I mean? So I think we, I think that bodes well for him when it comes to touchdown. I think there's going to be a lot of high percentages where he's going to be, all he's going to have to do is make the right read. A lot of his touchdowns going to come from not him being a hero, not him having to force it between two guys. A lot of his touchdowns this year when it comes to passing is making the right fucking read. If he makes the right read, <laughs> fuck it. If he makes the right read in the Carolina system, uh, I don't know. Let's say, um, if he makes the right read, fucking 85 percent of the time, you know what I mean? He's he's gonna be all right. You know what I mean? He's gonna have a little. It's gonna be a little percentage where he's gonna have to come out and, you know, just gonna have to try to do that hero shit. But that 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 doesn't win you Super Bowls. All right. Trust me, hero ball doesn't win you. Team ball win you Super Bowl, but hero ball does. All right. 
All right, so 3,200 yards, 23 touchdowns. Let's continue. I got four rushing touchdowns. I think you guys uh, drastically uh, underestimate how well and how athletic Sam Darnold is. Sam Darnold is very athletic here, and I expect for him to come out and show you guys, especially around the red zone. Okay? So around the red zone, look for him to take off a couple times. You know, everybody's locked up. He got it. I mean, I don't I'm not telling you he's Mike Vick. I mean, that's not what I'm telling you. I'm not, he's not Lamar Jackson. I'm not going to tell you that either. But I mean, for me to sit up here and lie to you and say that he doesn't have he doesn't have athleticism, I would, that would be a clear lie. So I'm not going to lie to you. I think he will make some plays with his feet, and I think he'll end up to four touchdowns. And now the part that all the Sam Darnold haters want to talk about. Ah oh, man, I'm gonna say twelve interceptions. Y'all. <laughs> twelve interceptions here. Listen, man. Let me let me pull it up for you guys. Hold on, y'all. Sorry, I'm doing too too much, too much, too much, too much. Come on, got to. All right, here we go. All right, so his previous high interception was 15. When he first came into the league, he threw 15 interceptions. 2019, he threw 13 interceptions, and last year he threw 11 interceptions. So I'm gonna give him one more interception going into 2021. Sam Darnold, um, he 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 definitely has arm talent. Okay, I mean. I mean, the tape doesn't lie. He, he definitely can whip that thing around. But at time, he lacks judgment. You know what I mean? And that's why I say, like, if, if Sam Darnold fails, I can't I can't be mad at Sam Darnold, you know? I mean, Matt Rule's the guy that's, that says he can fix something. He loves the fact that he's a leader and all this. So, like, like, a lot of you guys probably, oh, I'm going to clown you when uh, if, if uh, Sam Darnold fails. You can't clown me. You, I mean, you're gonna have to get, you're gonna have to take that up with Matt Rule. You know what I mean? Because I believe that Matt Rule brought him here. He's seen him some here, but the main thing that Rule has to figure out with Sam Darnold is how to slow the game down. That's the number one thing, Matty. If you can find a way to slow this thing down and, and, and take some of that pressure off him mentally, I think Sam Darnold's gonna be a good quarterback. I, matter of fact, I know he's gonna be a good quarterback if that can happen. See, at times, the game gets to moving real fast, and Sam uses his instinct. Sounds familiar, huh? <laughs> game gets to moving fast, shit starts breaking down. And instead of you, you using your instinct, I mean, instead of you using what you've been training and your techniques and learning to just to take a sack or learn to throw away, he tries to force it in there. You know, more times than not, it doesn't work. So if he can slow the game down, which I don't know, man. I, I don't know if you can consider for, for him. I'm not talking about for anybody else, but for him, I don't know if you consider 12 interceptions for him, just for him. Is that, I don't know. I mean, is that really, really bad? I mean, I, I don't know. For him, I mean, you're talking about it for goodness sake, a guy who had 19 interceptions two years ago. I guess for him it's not that bad, but we got to find a way to slow things down. And I, I think he's, I think he struggles in that department just a little bit here. Um, So, yeah, I'm going to say 12 interceptions there. All right. All right, let's move on to the next guy here. Brian Spider-Man. Spider-Man, nobody do it, Spider-Can. Brian Burns, 2021 prediction. Here, let me pull up his stats. A guy who, um, like I said, y'all, he's, he's he's making it real tough for me, y'all. He's making it real tough for me, man. I told you, uh, Christian's my favorite player, man. But, man, God, you know, God darn it, man. He's, he's, he's making it tough. I'll tell you that right there. Brian Burns, I got him at 13 and a half sacks um, when it comes to the 2021 outlook. Let's stay there for a second. Um, Brian Burns has the capability of having a 20-plus sack season. That's no cap. That's no smoke. I can look at you eye to eye and tell you. Brian Burns has the ability to have a 20-plus season sack. And if you want to go one step further, I want to be surprised if he got over 15. I want to be surprised if he got over 15 sacks fairly easy. But I factored in, and then this is the reason why I didn't go 15. I factored in the fact that 13 and a half sacks, first of all, for him is, is great coming off, um, let's see. Was just coming off a nine sack season, you know what I mean? Then a seven sack season before. That's fantastic. Something to build on there. Let's not laugh at that, by the way. Okay. 
But I feel like every year there's something that goes on. And a lot of you guys don't understand. When you're dominant, when you're as dominant as Brian Burns, you're crazy if teams are not watching film on guys like Brian Burns and, and, and him as well and what he does well with, with that speed. So you got to account for the fact that if Brian Burns gets on a tear, there's going to be so many games where they're going to double him. Let me tell you how you do. Let me tell you how you deal with a guy like Brian Burns. <laughs> I love him, man. Listen, man, I ain't trying. To, let me tell you something. Let me let me tell you something. You you cannot. Okay, I love you, Brian. Listen, baby, I love you, but I gotta tell him how to stop you. This is how you deal with a guy like Brian Burns. All right. You can't stop him. You can only slow him down. But what you do is you chip at him. You you throw bodies at him. You make him go around when he tries to get to the quarterback. You want to make him go around the Walmart parking lot before he gets to the quarterback. <laughs> I want fullback nipping at him. I want tackles nipping at him. I want tight end chipping at him. I want my guard pulling. You throw so many fucking bodies <laughs> to where that speed. Hey, once he gets around another guy, he runs into another guy. That's how you deal with him. So I think you guys got to understand, and I'm not. You know, like I said, you got to understand that at, at some point teams are going to start doing that here. Um, and even then, I think he's still he's still so so uh, he's so explosive, so quick. I mean, it's only a matter of time before, you know, he pops one on you. You know what I mean? Um, 13 and a half sacks is where I'm going to stay. I think that's safe. Um, I think that's uh, I think that's good. You know, I think that's good. Something to build on here. But I do think teams are going to try to challenge him more especially he, if he gets off to a hot start. Um, I'll tell you this right here, though. I'll tell you this right here. I honestly feel, though, that Brian Burns is in for a three to five game sack party. Uh, you heard what I said. You heard what I said. You want me to tell you against who? Brian Burns is going to have anywhere between three to five sacks in a game. That's a that's a okay. In case you didn't know, that was a hot note right there. Okay, I think the New Orleans Saints. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna be at home. Now, now, mind you, listen. If you don't think I know what I'm talking about, now, mind you, I put out a video the week before we played Atlanta. Okay, I said Brian Burns will have a forced fumble in that game. You know what happened that game? He did exactly what I thought. So, <laughs> listen. I don't know if it's going to be at home. I don't know if it's going to be on the road. But Jameis Winston is, is, is going to be due. I mean, it's, he's going to have anywhere between a three to five sack game. Mark my word here, man. I think he's going to eat there. So 13 and a half sacks, but I, no surprise if he goes over 15. Um, no surprise if he puts together 20. I think he have a total of 43 solo tackles. And I give him four forced fumbles here. Um, let's see. Let me see his four, first force fumbles last year. He had three force fumbles last year. I'm giving him one more this year. I feel like, again, you know, all those things that I just said on how to stop him as far as chipping him and, you know, throwing extra bodies at him and, you know what I mean, that's how, that's how you get to a guy like that. I mean, you, you can't match up with him one-on-one. -on -one. There's no way in hell to match up one-on-one-on-one, -on -one, you know what I mean? But uh, you throw bodies at his ass. And just All you can do is slow him down, all right? So with that being said, I think he's going to have times where he, he's not going to be able to get there and actually make the, the, the tackle, but he's going to be out there nipping at the ball. You know what I mean? I think our defense, as far as uh, Christian Miller, you got a Perryman, you got Riddick, I think they're going to force these quarterbacks outside the pockets, and you're going to see Brian Burns get a lot of his a lot of his sacks on the prowl, him on the chase. It, it's not going to be guys sitting back there in the pocket. See, that that's the thing, too. See, when, when you're playing with a, a unit – that can force pressure on the outside. I mean, now the people up front, the Derrick Browns, the Daquan Jones, the Brady and the Roy, now you got to collapse it from the inside. Or you're going to have that quarterback try to leave out the back door. Okay? So, it, 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 okay, so, God damn it. So if I'm bringing pressure from the outside, now your quarterback wants to step up. But if they're, clo if they're closing down from the front side and they're bringing pressure from the outside, now you got quarterbacks that's going to try to leave out the back door. And no matter if you got two or three bodies out there blocking Brian Burns, if you if you give him that if you give him that angle, if you give him that advantage, I think he's gonna make plays. 
that's where you're going to see a lot of his sacks too right there. All right, so 4-4 fumble, 13 and a half sacks, and one interception, yeah. I, I give him one interception this year, man. Don't know how, don't know when, but he's going to get an interception. It's, it's coming, y'all. Nice stats there, man. Um, I didn't want to go too crazy. want to be realistic. I, like I said, I factor in the double teams and, you know, and all the other good shit there, all right? Uh, I don't have him being the defensive player of the year. No, I don't I don't think they're giving the defensive player of the year. But I do think he makes the Pro Bowl. 13 and a half sacks is good enough for a Pro Bowl appearance for his first time. So I'm excited for that. All right, let's go on to the next stat. Sorry, y'all moving a little slow here. All right, this guy right here, man. Go, DJ. That's my DJ. Go, DJ. DJ Mo. 2021 stat prediction. Let's pull it up. DJ, DJ Moore. Let me say, uh, let me let me tell y'all a quick little story here. Shout out to DJ Moore, by the way. Um, this, what was it, yesterday? Was it yesterday or the day before yesterday? I think it was yesterday. DJ Moore was signing autographs, man. And um, if you go look at the video, in between autographs, he was checking his phone. So, <laughs> I actually, I tagged him. I tagged him while I was watching him sign autographs while he was on the phone. And I seen him look down and I told him, man, thank you for doing this, man. And he responded, man, I appreciate it. Let me, let me tell you something. And this is just my personal. How could you not love this guy? DJ is such a, such a cool guy, man. I mean, he's, when I, when I met him in person, man, he, he's, he's so like, just laid back, loose. You know what I mean? He, if, if I could say how you should live life, you should live it like a DJ Moore, man, because he just real bubbly, man, just kind of laid back, take it as it is. So shout out to DJ Moore. Definitely a cool-ass guy, man. I, I'll tell you that for real. All right, let's get back to enough of that. <laughs> let's get back to the uh, stats here. I got him having 62 receptions here. All right, 62 receptions. A lot of you guys were wondering, man, like, why do you got him so low when it comes to receptions? Now, mind you, last year, Robbie Anderson had 95 re receiving yards. I mean, he had 95 receptions with his homeboy, Teddy. The scary thing about it is he only had 60-plus-something receptions. Uh, DJ Moore only had 60-something-plus receptions last year, had 1,100 yards off of that. That's scary. Robbie Anderson had 95 and, and cracked 1,000. So it just shows you how special he is. Um, I do believe that the fact that Robbie Anderson has chemistry with um, uh, uh, Sam Darnold, I would like to say that kind of gives him an edge. Uh, again, like I said, Robbie, uh, Robbie and Teddy were they had chemistry. You know what I mean? Working out and shit. So, um, I would like to say that gives him an edge, but realistically, it has nothing with do to do with that. I think it's more so we're going to spread the ball around. Come on, y'all! We brought in weapons and Christians back healthy. So I don't see him getting no more than sixty. I don't. I don't. I would be surprised if DJ Moore had more than sixty plus receptions here. All right, I got him having thirteen hundred receiving yards here. Um, I think DJ's gonna do his thing. If you guys don't know, thirteen hundred uh, receiving yards um, it equals up to over seventy seven yards a game for seventeen games. Did I do my math? I think it was seventy seventy seven yards. So averaging seventy seven yards or better. So. <laughs> I mean, this guy's ready to blow. He's ready to blow. I mean, come on, man. I think he reached 1,300 yards here. He's definitely uh, the best receiver on the team, especially when it comes to yards at the catch. Uh, and I definitely st I think he's going to make the most of his opportunity. The only reason, like I said, I gave him 62 receptions. I mean, there's one ball. A lot of you guys in the Instagram, when I was posting this stuff, oh, that's too loud. That's too – there's one ball. <laughs> there's one ball. You got Christian McCaffrey, you got Robbie Anderson, you got Dan Arnold, Tommy Trimble, Sha Smith, Terrace Marshall, David Moore. There's one ball. Everybody can have 95 receptions. <laughs> what the fuck are you? Uh, hey, some of you guys just, just lay off the powder, all right? So, again, man, so 62 receptions, that's fairly nice there. I think he can make the most of it. 1,300 yards, I'm with it. Now, here we go, y'all. Here's the controversial part here that a lot of you guys, you've been talking shit to me. Big cat, you, you let, let me tell you something. I love DJ. Good guy here. But uh, I said earlier in this offseason, I said DJ Moore needs to have at least 10 touchdowns for the national media to take him as a 
legit threat, a legit, you know, Pro Bowl receiver. When you look at the guys like D-Hop, and when you look at uh, Stephon Diggs, when you look at Jefferson, when you look at all these other big names, Mike Evans, when you look at these Michael Thomas, when you look at these big name receivers, they usually have either some kind of monster stat line when it comes to yardage, 1,500 yards, or they either have a balanced stat line with like a 1,000-something plus double-digit touchdowns. DJ Moore has yet to have double-digit touchdowns in his career. The highest he has ever had was six back in 2019. And I think that streak continues. Ah, did I hurt you? Yeah, man. I, I think DJ has eight. Yeah. He has eight. But for you guys out there who, it's not hating, man. It's not hating, man. Like I said, there's only one ball. I do think he makes the Pro Bowl. I think he is 1,300 yards, eight touchdowns. I think that's enough, y'all. I'm praying it's enough. I think it's enough. Um. There's only one ball to go around, and I don't think DJ Moore is the primary focus in the red zone. I think the primary focus in the red zone still will be those tight ends, Dan Arnold. I think Christian, you know, he's a matchup nightmare. The fact that, you see, Christian doesn't have to sit here and do like Derrick Henry and just mow you down in the red zone. Christian can line up against your linebacker in the red zone. He can, he can leak out in the flat. I mean, so many different things you can do with him. And because of that, I think... DJ Moore gets his, but I don't think he cracks 10 touchdowns. I think he had eight touchdowns, 1,300 yards, 62 receptions, and hopefully a Pro Bowl, all right? All right, so let's move on. Now, speaking of that guy, Christian McCaffrey. A lot of people saying the comeback player of the year for the NFL. Let's, let's talk about his number. My favorite player on the team for now. <laughs> My favorite player on the team for now, all right? I looked at his numbers, y'all. I looked at what, what, what Matt Rule has said. I looked at what they're doing, bringing Schubert Hubert. I looked at the receivers they brought in. I looked at everything, and I, and I looked at, and I try to find some balance and how this thing is going to be spread around. The best thing you do for Sam Darnold is to establish the run. If, if, the, if Joe Brady, if Matt Rule comes out here, and expect for Joe, I mean, expect for Sam Donor to come out here and just guns a blazing. We're gonna be a four and four and thirteen team or so. We can't do that. Establish the run. I think this year the Panthers focus heavily on the run with Christian McCaffrey. You know, obviously he can do what he could do out of the backfield catching, but I think it's more of a run thing. I think he's gonna have over two hundred and forty seven rushing attempts. That's right. Two hundred and forty seven rushing attempts. I think you have over 1370 on the ground. Again, I, like I, I can't, I can't make sense of it more than what I just said. If you don't believe me, look at what, look at, and, and I have to go back to Tannehill. And even though the Titans don't have the the same kind of running back we have, the philosophy doesn't change. Establish the run. If you establish the run, it opens up the pass. It makes it easier to pass. And even though Christian can catch up the backfield, and I think they will throw it to him out of the backfield, it's so, so important about them establishing the run to help out a young stud in Sam Darnold. I mean, you got to help him out here. You can't just, you know, go out there and win us the game and, you know, fuck all that shit. You got you to get established the run here. And I think this year they're going to focus on that 1,300 yards. Not bad. I think he has 10 rushing touchdowns. In case you guys don't know, Christian McCaffrey, when it came to rushing, the most he has ever had in his career was uh, 15 rushing touchdowns. That was the year when he uh, went for 1,000 for 1,000 on the uh, ground and in the air. Prior to that, prior to him having that 1,000 for 1,000 year, 15 touchdown, the highest he has ever had was 7. I look for that to come down to 10. 10 rushing touchdowns. Christian is the focal point of the offense on the ground. I think, remember I was telling you guys, we don't, we don't, man, I got, damn it, man. We don't run an offense that's going to just come out the gate. We don't run that. So that's why I say some, we don't run a, you know, like when you play Kansas City, you might, the first play, you might be going on a 90-yard chase. That's not us. No. We establish shit, and then we, 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 we allow you to react to what we're doing. Okay? Then we say, okay, look, Joe. All right, they're creeping up. You know, Christian just had a couple 10-yard back-to-back runs. Okay, look. Look, they're starting to creep up. All right, it's in, all right, it's in the corner. All right, so look, 
on this next play. That's running to the opposite side. If they creep up, all right, hit them with the play. That's the kind of shit we, we don't, we're not coming out tag. We're not, we don't bring the fight to you. You bring the fight to us and then we counter your ass. And the only way that's going to work this year is because of the run. And I think Christian has 1,300 yards, 10 touchdowns. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm preaching today. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. We preach it tonight. And I think uh, he has 10 touchdowns on the ground, 1,300 yards, rushing, 247 attempts. And I think he has 553 receiving yards, in case you guys don't know. Um, prior, uh, excuse me, prior to Christian having that 1,000 yards in the air, the most he has ever had was 867 and then followed by 651. I think that comes down a little bit. Okay. I think that comes down a little bit. I see Christian. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if he hits the 600 mark, uh, 600 yard receiver mark. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be surprised if he hit that 600 yard receiver mark. But I'm gonna say it's 553 right now. I, I I'll, I'll come down a little bit. Uh, 40, 47 yards, 47 yards, something like that. And the reason why, and the reason why I say that is, we got weapons. You know. I, I, I don't know how to explain this to you guys. A lot of you guys, you still don't fucking get it. I'm looking in the chat right now. You you guys don't get it. A team doesn't win championship with one player. It doesn't. I mean, if the Carolina Panthers want to be a legit threat on offense, everybody has to play their part. You can't just... I mean, we can't sit here and say Christian's going to carry us to the mountaintop and then when he gets hurt... I mean, I think he has to be the cornerstone. I think he has to be the engine. Like I told you guys, I think he has to be the engine, but I think Sam Darnold has to be the steering wheel. Okay? So with that being said here, I think they're going to reduce some of his receiving yards. I think they're going to focus on him on the ground. And you got other weapons out there. Look for the emergence of Shy Smith. Look for the emergence of Terrence Marshall. Hell, I mean, all. The, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. And this is from my perspective here. I don't know about any of, any of you guys, but... If, if we went up here and drafted Terrace Marshall in the second round, a quote-unquote first-round receiving talent, if we went up here and draft this motherfucker in the second round and they choose not to use him this year, I'm going to be on Matt Rule ass like a motherfucking... Like a... Mo what can I say that's racist? Uh, <laughs> racist? Listen, man, I'm going to be on Matt Rule's ass, man. No homo. Listen, man. I mean, so my, my point is that Christian's not going to have to do it all. He's not going to have to do it all this year. So I think it's spread around 553 yards pass. I mean, 553 yards receiving. And I think he has six touchdowns. Um, the highest touchdowns receiving he has ever had in his career have been, let's see, six. Actually, yeah, 2018. The highest uh, receiving touchdowns Christian had in his career. 2018, a year before he broke that record, he had six total touchdowns. So I think he matches his career high and six receiving touchdowns. All right, so real quick, let me go over this again. So, yeah, I, I like these numbers. 1,300 yards, 247 attempts, rushing, uh, 10 rushing yards, uh, 10 rush to the 553 yards, receiving six touchdowns, and a Pro Bowl visit, all right? All right, I'm going to hurry up, y'all. I know a lot of you want to get in here. Um, all right, let's do this right here. J, uh, J.C. Horn. J.C. Horn. Mm. Let me tell you something. If you guys have not seen on July 2nd where – um. J.C. Horn was matched up against the Miami Dolphins receiver. I mean, he just literally just, uh, he, he blanketed him, man. It's on YouTube. It's on Instagram. Go check it out. He blanketed the dude. More and more, I'm believing this guy is going to be, he has, he has a favorable game to Jalen Ramsey. So one of the things I wanted to do was I wanted to, See, what did Jalen Ramsey's stat line look like when he was a rookie? And, you know, obviously he's not Jalen Ramsey, but he has a similar skill set to Jalen Ramsey. So I kind of looked at it and I said, you know what, let me, let me do some tweaking here. I think J.C. Horner had about 62 tackles. I think they're going to try his ass. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm hyped up, and I think he can hold his own. I'm pretty sure he can hold his own. But I think Tom Brady will try his ass. I still think Matt Ryan will try his ass. I'm not worried about Jameis Winston. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just – when you say Jameis Winston, I, I'm sorry. But I think they're going to try his ass out, and I think um, there's going to be some rough days, but I think there's going to be some good nights too. 
Not to mention that, you know, if remember I told you, if you if you play cornerback or if you play anywhere in this secondary for the Carolina Panthers, and I ain't talking about just in 2020. If you look at the history of the Carolina Panthers, go look at the history through the years, through the years, through the years. If you're going to play secondary on this team, you better come up and play against the run. You goddamn right you better. That goes for everybody. So I expect for him to have some tackles there, 62 tackles there uh, for J.C. Horn coming out the gate. One forced fumble here. I definitely think his high energy, his good hands there, his athleticism is going to lead to a forced fumble. Now, I have him with four interceptions this year, man. Four interceptions this year, three of them against Jameis Winston. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't believe in that motherfucker, man. Why, why I'm joking? Hey, why I'm joking? Why I'm joking? It could be for real, though. He could. I think he's gonna have four interceptions here. And um, if you look at Dante, I think Dante had three. His coming out his rookie year. So I think four interceptions is fair. I think um, I think teams are gonna learn pretty early not to throw at him. I think I think they're gonna take their shots at him. About midway through the year, I think it's gonna be a hard lesson to crack. You know what I mean? So eh, four four interceptions, not bad there. All right. Um, let's see. Again, 14 pass defenses, all right? I think he's going to knock down 14 balls there. Again, his athleticism, his quickness, it's going to put him in good position to defend. That speed is going to put him in good good position to defend. I'm telling you, man, he's like a blanket, man. He's hard to shake, man. He's hard to shake there. Um, not really not really worried. I know a lot of – one of the things they were saying about him coming out the draft – he needs to be a, a better form tackler, wrapping up and shit. But I'm not right worried about that there. I think he's going to make some plays for us. And um, let's see. All right. So is he the defensive player of the year or defensive rookie of the year? I, I don't I don't say. I don't think so. It has nothing to do with him because his stat line says otherwise. I think he's going to be a good player. But, uh, you know, I think they're going to screw us out of that. All right. Will he make the Pro Bowl? I don't think that either, man. Can I say that? I just think they're going to screw us. I think there's going to be a couple people on this team that are going to get screwed out of their just dudes, and I think he's one of them. But I think he's going to have a hell of a stat line going into his sophomore year. All right? All right, so let's move on here. Let's see. Got a few more of y'all in them over the phone lines. Talk about Robbie Anderson, 2020 stat line, 2021 stat line here. Now, this was the one that that really pissed me off because a lot of you got, uh, that, that's too low. Okay, hold on. Let me bring up a stat line, y'all. A lot of you guys don't understand, man. There's only one ball to go around. And again, I I looked at the chemistry that him and um him and um Sam Darnold had. All right, you gonna you gonna pull up here? Give me a second, y'all. My computer's acting like an asshole. All right, hold on, hold on. All right, so yeah, I went and looked at the chemistry him and Sam Darnold had. And he played with him from 2018 to 2019. He had 50 receptions, 52 receptions. He had a 752 yards one year, 779 yards one year. He had five touchdowns one year. He had six touchdowns one year. And these were both with Sam Darnold. With that being said, with DJ Moore doing his thing, with the extra weapons we have, with Christian being healthy, I think Robbie Anderson drops down to 51 receptions. Yeah, yeah. I think he drops down to 51 receptions there, which is a little low, man. But again, I'm looking at the history between these guys. And I'm looking at the weapons that we got. And then, listen, I hate to do this. I don't want to make it too political here, but who knows what... Okay, so so if... So if if Rob uh, if we sign Taylor Moten, I don't know. This is a big if, but if we sign Taylor Moten, that pretty much for sure that Robbie Anderson is gone. So you know what I mean? I mean, you get you get where I'm going here? Yes, no. I don't I don't I don't want to do that, man. But you you know, 51 receptions here based off the chemistry that they had, and I think Robbie I think DJ Moore beats this out along with other guys as well. Uh, let's see. 735 yards receiving. 
Again, with Sam Donner in um, New York, he has 779 yards one year, 752 yards of the year. I think he has 735 yards this year. He had five touchdowns um, this year to go along with those 51 yards, uh, 51 receptions, 735 yards, five touchdowns. Again, with Sam Donald in New York, he had five touchdowns and six touchdowns. And last but not least, that's it, man. Um, I just think Robbie, man, I, I think he's going to have his opportunity, man, but – I just can't. I just. I think DJ Moore, like what I say, DJ Moore is gonna have 62. He has 51. I see this offense finally being balanced here. This offense finally being balanced. You heard Matt Rule in the offseason talking about we're finally on one page. You know, okay, well we yet to be seen. We'll see how that turns out here. But I think this ball is gonna be spread around. And it's gonna be coated nice and good here. You know what I mean? And um, I think uh, Robbie Anderson is gonna be. You know, I think he still do his thing. You know what I mean? 735 yards. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know here. But I, I think that's what that's what we're looking at here. All right? All right. Um, last but not least. And, and, again, there's some other stats that I want to talk about. We'll do that later on. Let's talk about Derek Brown here. <clears throat> Derek Brown. Senior running back to the ground. <laughs> Let me pull the stats up. Hold on. All right. Derek Brown. Stats. All right, so Derrick Brown had a, a total of uh, 34 combined tackles last year, 13 assists, two sacks, uh, four passes uh, defense, and he had a total of what was this? He had a total of eight tackles for loss. All right, eight tackles for loss, not bad here. When I look at it, I say Derrick Brown's going to have four sacks. A lot of those sacks that he had last year, they came late in the year. Um, I feel like with the pressure that we're going to be bringing uh, from the edge and from the linebacker unit, again, like I told you, it's when you when you close the pocket down from the outside, you better push it up in the middle and, and shut it down from the inside. It's going to be real easy. I see a lot of one on ones. Unfortunately, for for the uh, uh, for the offense, you can't double everybody. <laughs> you're gonna let you're gonna leave Hassan Riddick one on one. You're gonna leave Brian Burns one on one. I just told you guys that if you want to stop Brian Burns, you throw a tight end, you throw a fullback, you throw a H back, you run a pulling guard. You got to do all that shit to stop him. So because of that, and because of Hassan Riddick and guys like uh, Christian Miller, who I believe was going to be a bounce back player of the year, when you got guys like that, it's going to make it so much easier for Derrick Brown to get off one on one blocks, including Daquan Jones. Uh, I would like for us to go pick up Geno Askins, uh, another veteran, go dog sick him. But because of that, I, I still don't, like I said, Derrick Brown has never been a sack artist. If you follow him back into Auburn, he never was a sack guru there. So I think these four sacks pretty much come from him reaping the benefits of the defensive package there. All right? So four sacks for him, which is not bad. I think he has 28 solo tackles, 14 assists, giving him a total of 42 tackles on a year. Not bad. 28 solo, 14 assists. Um, I'm giving him seven uh, tackle for losses. He had eight this year. I think he comes down one, gets seven tackle for losses. I think he has five uh, passes defense. He had four last year. Give him one more when it comes to passes deflected. Uh, and I give him two forced fumbles. Yeah. Again, y'all, Derek Brown is a big man. He's a violent man, powerful, strong man. And I think you're going to see that on display again for us. All right. Uh, phone line is open 762-223-0584. Give me your stat prediction. doesn't have to be on the same guys that I gave. Um, I'm going to do a complete breakdown tomorrow. So there are some key pieces that I, I do want to talk about. But if you call in tonight, make sure you give me your opinion on who and what their stat line looks like and why it looks like that. That's, that's speaking complete sentences. <laughs> Don't say, uh, he make tackle, he, he do, you know, come on, y'all. We got to do better than that. And, and, and there's nothing wrong with that. If, if, if you can't explain or articulate yourself, I, I'll help you, man. There's, there's nothing wrong with that, all right? Um, one person I will say while we're waiting on the phone line to click over, um, one person I will say that has to have a great showing is Shaq Thompson. And I'm going to do a breakdown. A couple of you guys want to do a breakdown of his numbers, and that's coming tomorrow, like I said. But uh, Shaq has to have a great year. There's no, there's no if, there is no buts, there is no doubt about it. There's a lot going on here, um, and I think there's a lot of opportunity. I mean, uh, Carolina fans have been dying for 
a, another Pro Bowl linebacker, you know what I mean, to, to really stand up. I mean, we haven't had one since uh, Luke and, and, and TD, man, I mean. But with all these opportunities here, man, there should be no reason why Shaq shouldn't be leading that damn unit in, in tackles for loss. Linebacker, he shouldn't be. He should be back there. He should be playing on the other side of scrimmage. I mean, there's too many damn people to keep your eye. And I'm not no disrespect to 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 Shaq Thompson, but there's too many other people that I'll be worried about. No disrespect. No disrespect. When you look at that linebacker and you look at those edge rushers, I'm thinking. I'm thinking Burns. I'm thinking Riddick. I'm looking. I'm trying to find out where Perryman is. Perryman's gonna take your fucking chin off. And then I'm looking at Shaq. <laughs> no disrespect, man. I love the guy, man. Good, good dude here. But that's a good thing. That's a great thing here. I mean, you got four guys that that we're worried the uh, the office is gonna be worried about before they get to you. So, I mean, you got to step your game up here, man. Um, I mean, especially when it comes to being a coverage linebacker, we already know you could be a hell of a run stuffer. We've seen that throughout the years. Him knocking people down. I mean, hell of a hell of a run stuffer, man. But and a nice guy too, man. But he definitely has to step his game up, or that could be the end of him. You know what I mean? In that situation, phone lines open. Damn. Seven six two, two three three zero five eight four. Call in tonight, man. Just tell me who you guys are looking forward to going off here. And uh, while we waiting, I mean, if you got any questions in the comment section, I'll read those as well, man. Um, you know, rush tonight. Just kind of taking it easy. Yes, we do definitely need to resign Taylor Moten. And if we do resign Taylor Moten, I think that's the end of Robbie Anderson. That's why I was kind of hinting at, you know what I mean? I was kind of hinting at, like, you know, if if uh, we if we resign Taylor Moten, then do we do we try to trade Robbie Anderson? Do we try to trade him before the deadline? I remember last year we, we missed out. We missed out when... Uh, Curtis Samuel, man. Curtis Samuel got up out of here. Hold tight, y'all. See who this is. Call from. To accept, press one. To send a. <clears throat> when you call in, state your name. The same um. The same blind date show. State your name. And if you don't state your name, I'm gonna read your whole number out loud. Don't make me read your whole number out loud. All right. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't know. I just don't know, man. I don't. I don't know if uh, if we trade him. Real last year, Curtis Samuel got off the hook, man. There's no way in hell why Curtis Samuel. We we shouldn't have got some kind of compensation back. Should got some kind of compensation back for him, man. And yeah, Sam Donald's gonna be all right. He's gonna be all right. I don't expect him to come out here and have monster numbers. Panther fans are obsessed with. Highlights. <laughs> what what the fuck is that about? <laughs> I mean there's a there's a listen, there's a small percentage of Panther fans that I talk to on a regular. And it's like, you know, and I'm not clowning on, you know, because I understand not everybody has, you know, the ability to understand the game, you know what I mean? And, and how to run and the offense and and how, how to design So not everybody has that understanding. But when I talk to certain Panthers fans, it's like, oh, you gotta have four thousand yards to be good. You gotta have, you gotta have fifty touchdowns. It's like, hey, what are you, where are you, where are you getting this shit from? The book of bullshit. Where, where are you getting this from? You know, like people don't believe that a quarterback can be an average quarterback and be efficient. You're looking at a guy by the name of Ryan Tannehill who's nothing special. Ryan Tannehill is not fucking special. He went to the AFC Championship game because there was a method to that offense. It was a method to the offense. The ball, the offense goes through the running back. That allows for my quarterback to make the easy read. Now, what you're, what you're going to get out of Sam Darnold this year is you're going to see if Sam Darnold can, can, can make those reads. I mean, when Christian's, when he's breaking out 10-yard and 15-yard runs and guys are stepping up and they, they're coming in the box to step that, now you're going to see Ken Sammy. <laughs> now, 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 listen, now, listen, now, listen. Now you can talk shit. Now, listen, 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 listen. Now you can talk shit if, now, if, 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 if Christian is tearing off on the ass 
and they start they stepping up the box to block him. I mean, stopping they stopping up the box to to, to, to stop him, and, and and Sam doesn't make the read. Now you can start tearing off on his ass. What I'm saying is he in in, in New York he didn't have the time to make no read. He was too busy looking up at the sky. <laughs> he didn't have the time to make the read. So that's why I tell Panthers fan, calm down. I don't. We don't have to have an offense, nor do we have to have a quarterback to come out here. You know, a lot of you guys, that, that's why, you know, the worst thing they could have done for you guys was to put Madden in your eyes, okay? A lot of you guys be playing Madden and think that every quarterback, if he doesn't have a 90 speed and, and a 95 arm, <laughs> he ain't shit. It's going to be all right. Any questions in there? Phone lines open, by the way, 762. Two three three zero five eight four. If you want to call in, yeah, I'm gonna talk about uh, Hassan Riddick too tomorrow. Somebody said they want a breakdown of Hassan Riddick. Mhm. Mm I, I think we need to get Geno Atkinson. What do you guys think about that? What do you guys think about Geno Atkinson? I mean, I like Daquan Jones, and I definitely love Brabian Roy. Definitely, definitely underrated. Definitely underrated. But, uh, you know, let me tell you this. And this is no – damn, y'all keep putting me in these positions. This is no disrespect to uh, – um, to uh, – God damn it. I forgot his name. Oh, here we go. No disrespect to K1 Short, man. But uh, Geno Smith ain't no damn K1 Short. You know what I mean? At least in his prime he wasn't, you know? I think there's something still left in him. Go dogs, by the way. Oh, yeah, I'll get him for the low. Get him for the low. Why not? And I want to do Jeremy Chin's number as well. Mm-hmm. Well, listen, I, I don't know if Jeremy Chin's going to... um. See, you guys got to pay attention during these interviews, man. When Matt Rule was saying that Jeremy Chen playing safety, pretty much, he was saying it, it's like a trial basis. He said that if you go back and look when they were having a practice out there on the practice field, there was, he was saying pretty much how do we haven't seen no game field of, of him at, at safety on our team and how comfortable he looks. It's pretty much a, a hearsay. You know, they got to wait to see how he looks in the preseason and shit. So who knows? I mean, if, if, if Chen struggles in the preseason at safety, they can move him around, man. Move him back in the box. Yeah. No, I don't think we signed Ha Ha Clinton Dix yet. No. Mm hmm. No, I don't think we signed him. What do you say? We will. Y'all stop entertaining that Jets fan out there. He's delusional. I think he got gang green or some shit. Leave that man alone. He he, he out of his fucking mind. Jets fan in the chat. Why why are you here? <laughs> Shouldn't you be on suicide hotline? <laughs> why are you here, Jets fan? The number to the suicide hotline is one eight eight hundred five 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 triple six triple six. All you need to know, Jets fan, is we're going to wax y'all asses to come the first game. And shout out to uh, Zach Taylor. Then he throw for like five interceptions in practice. <laughs> if he, if Zach Taylor, or his name Zach Wilson, if Zach Wilson out here throwing five interceptions in practice, <laughs> wait till you get a pack of niggas behind them. Oh, boy. And they're really fast niggas, too. <laughs> wait, till you get a, wait till you get a posse full of really fast niggas behind them. Oh, you ain't in BYU no more, Zach Wilson. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Y'all don't want to call in tonight? 762233, whatever that number is. Well, I'll answer questions. You got questions? Oh, yeah, they really fast and... <laughs> they really fast and strong. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fuck you doing in my chat? You a Jets fan? Any Panthers questions? Any Panthers questions? Got time tonight. Had a good day today, man. I'm okay. <clears throat> any any questions tonight? Any Panthers questions? Fuck a Jet question. I ain't got no. I ain't got no question. 
But yeah, Jess Gang, if you want to call in tonight, I, I, I got time to entertain you. Call in tonight. The number on the, the number's right there on the screen if you don't know what you want to dial. Right there. Please be a Brooklyn nigga. <laughs> Jets fan. Jets gang. Call in. The number's right there. I can tell you how, how bad your team is. Uh, shout out to Mr. Clean. Hold on. Let's see who this is. Hey, who's this? Call from Robert Foxwood. To accept. Hey, Mr. Foxwood. How you doing, bro? Big Cat. What's up, my man? Man, I'm doing all right, man. I'm living life. How you doing? Man, I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm doing the same thing, man. Being a family man, man. Doing what I do. I hear you. Come close to the mic man, here. So... Hold on. I got a... Uh... Uh, it's all right. Take your time there. Tonight, that better? Yeah, that's better. There, you at work? No, 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 no. I'm home. I'm home. I'm in my cave. Okay. In my path of cave. That's yeah. what's up. That's what's up, nigga. <clears throat> you know it. So, what you want to talk yeah, about man, tonight? Um, man, speaking on some of these. Speaking on some of these players, man, believe it or not, man, I think we're going to have a couple of players going to have breakout years this year. And I think Sam Donald going to be one of them. I really do. I feel like I feel like he going he gonna to give people exactly what they've been looking for since everybody's been dogging him since he went to Jets. And I feel like he's going to have a big resurgence in Carolina because he got the weapons, man. And I feel like, I feel like he's going to make better decisions and he's going to have – more touchdowns and more passing yards than people think, and less interceptions than people think. Now, what, what I think he's gonna show up. Now, what gives you that assumption that he'll do that? Well, I, I mean, I'm just looking at you know, what I'm saying, I'm just thinking about you know everything that happened while he was with the Jets, and seeing as though he really didn't, he didn't have any players around him. Like, I mean, I know you see some film on him, bro. A lot of times he was running for his life. No wonder he was seeing ghosts out there. Facts. <laughs> Facts. So, you know what I mean? With a with a you know what I'm saying, with a decent offensive line, you know what I'm saying? And 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 the weapons, I mean, bro, he's got a plethora of weapons. Like, he can he can literally do anything. Mm -hmm. Like he can do anything. He ain't gotta like basically he ain't gotta be the player to to make something happen. You know what I'm saying? He could talk to the one of his playmakers instead of him, you know what I'm saying, being the one scrambling for 10, 15, you know what I'm saying, whatever, whatever, spinning around and trying to pull off some, some Lamar Jackson or Patrick Mahomes <laughs> type you know yeah, what I'm saying? You know, you know, niggas like a good show. They want to they wanna run it back. They want a quarterback that can run 50 yards and throw it over their head and make a touchdown. And then they be 12, right. 4 and, and 12 and, and, and shit. And, and you know what's and you, what's crazy, because when you, you know what I'm saying, when you were sitting there saying that, you know what I'm saying, you don't want a quarterback that can do it, I'm the same way, bro. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, you know what, I ain't going to even go to that one. I ain't going to even go to that oh, one, yeah. because that's past that's, tense. But yeah, yeah, yeah you're, right, you're right. Yeah, I, I ain't going to even, I, you can't compare apples to oranges. But Oh, there's going to be a lot of motherfuckers I crying think, if you start doing that. <laughs> yeah, right, right, right. So that's why I say I'm going I'm to go ahead and leave it where it's at. <laughs> But yeah, man, I think if I think if Sam, I think if he, you know, what I'm saying, just like take his time and look at what he got instead of trying to force stuff, man, I, I think he'll be, I think he'll be pretty damn good, man. Well, well, help me out, help me out here, because I, I need your opinion here now. Now, help me out. Petey Quick pointed this out, um, I think two live streams ago, but he said our offense is not built to come out here like with the first strike, you know, strike hard, strike fast, you know, what's that, the Cobra Kai shit. Our offense is more of a counter you offense. We run our scheme and then we counter you. So am I right there? Am I reaching or what? Tell me in your eyes, what is our offense to you? Man, that's facts, man. That's facts because we ain't built for that. We don't have the receivers for that. I mean, we got fast receivers, but we don't have fast receivers. We don't have Tyreek Hill, you know what I'm saying, type receivers that can blow the, you know what I'm saying, that can like really blow the top off. I mean, DJ Moore, he's fast, but he ain't got Tyreek Hill speed. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like, we shouldn't we shouldn't have to do that to be a good team. You know what I'm saying? Just be consistent, yeah. Be steady and take care of the ball. That's it. It's it's so funny. It's so funny, Robert. Man, I mean, it's like you know for 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 the for the average fan. I'm not talking about the people who actually like really watch it, but 
for the average fan, in their mind, an offense can't be ran unless you got a, a superstar quarterback. <laughs> which which this you got to think about too, man. And yeah. when you know what, and when you got fans like that, them the ones that them the ones that never played or watched football Facts. until the Carolina Panthers became a franchise. Facts. Those Facts. are the ones. Those are the ones because anybody know you can have. You can have I ain't gonna say a piece of shit quarterback, but you can have a quarterback that's that's not better than the next one and he'll go out there and, and tear that quarterback team ass up because he's consistent. Right. You know what I mean? He ain't trying to blow, he ain't trying to go for a big play every down. You know what I'm saying? He's consistent. You know what I'm saying? It's like the rabbit it's like the rabbit and the turtle. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Slow and steady wins the race. And and I'll tell you this, my brother, I'll tell you this right here. If you give me a second, I I can go through the goddamn NFL schedule last year and show you what quarterback had no business being up there with another quarterback, and they whipped that team ass. I promise you I can show you that. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. And then you got to think about – and then I'm thinking about – I'm thinking about the Kansas City game last year. Mm -hmm. Bro, they won by two points. Yep. They won by two points. That's right. And we didn't – you know what I'm saying? We didn't have, a, we didn't have a, an explosive offense. You know what I'm saying? We were slow and steady. The only thing was that that other no name nigga couldn't he could only go from, from fucking twenty to twenty, but he couldn't, you know what I'm saying, he couldn't go in the end zone. So let's just say if we had Sam Donner on those possessions, bro, I think we win I think we win at least six of those eight last games. Facts. I ain't gonna say six. I say I say five. I'll meet well, you I at five. Say six, but I say I say I say half at least. I okay. say half. Okay, four. We can meet at four. I like four. Yeah. Yeah, I say I say half, but still, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, bro, for, for for that to happen, that's man, that don't make no sense, man. And then, you know what I mean? Like, bro, but you being a quarterback, being in the league as long as you have been, you should know how to improvise. You know what I mean? Yeah. So and which was another reason why I feel like he wasn't, you know what I'm saying, that 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 no name player wasn't fit for the team because you don't you know what I'm saying, you got a, a leader knows how to improvise. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Right, so, well, yeah. Well, just to kind of put a little icing on the cake that we were talking about here, let's look at the 2020 playoff. Let's, let's see who made the 2020 playoff. Now, mind you, Robert, there's a lot of people out there, and there's some in the comment section, you got to have a superstar to make the playoff. Okay, let's see. Washington football team. <laughs> nope, no superstar there at the quarterback position. To Tennessee Titans. Nope. No superstar there at the quarterback position. Uh, let's see. Nope, but he's consistent. Oh yeah, Chicago Bears uh, last year made the playoff. Definitely not. So wait Definitely a minute. Not. But wait a minute <laughs> though. What happened to the superstar way. shit that everybody, the Panther Nation, swear to God that we gotta have a superstar? I just listed three out of the fucking teams that we had in the uh, three out of the teams that we had in the playoff. What are they doing there? What shit for brand quarterbacks? Right. Right. Yeah. It's coaching, it's coaching, it's coaching, and and you know what I'm saying executing plays, man. That's that's what get it. Thank you, thank you. That's what get it, and not turn it, and not turn the ball over. You got to take care of the ball. You have to. Yeah, yeah. It's it's more so about coaching. That that's all it's about. Can if 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 Sam Darnold fails in Carolina, it has. I mean, it's everything. It's not necessarily on him, because a lot of you guys been saying he ain't shit, but. You know, I mean, from the stat line prior to him coming to Carolina, he he hasn't lived up to the hype. But that's why Matt Rule believes he can coach him. You know, he said he likes right. his leadership and all that shit. So if he fails, it's on Matt Rule. It's not on him. Because according to right. some of you guys, you say he ain't shit anyway. Right, and see, that's one thing I always believe. Like my my coach, like when I played football in high school. My coach always told me coaching and execution go hand in hand. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So nobody nobody can really take the blame you know what i'm saying because if if i'm the coach and i'm showing you a certain type of play you as a player and a team should be able to go out and execute that play you know what i'm saying oh, yeah. and i understand things happen sometimes but you know what i mean if you if you doing cuz i mean you know you have some times where you know what i'm saying you sitting there watching the game and and a receiver and a quarterback went on the same page or a running back or something like that like Execution has a lot to do with that. Mm -hmm. A lot. Like you can sit there and coach a person all day, but if they if they can't execute, then it don't it don't make no difference. Facts. Do you believe he can execute? Well, um, do you, well, well, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Let, let, let me ask that question. 
Uh, Joe Brady here, man. A lot of people um, are believing that Joe Brady's going to have his offense clicking like that, but uh, J Joe Brady hasn't proven shit to me, and I, and I still believe that uh, that shit you seen out of Joe Burrow in college. I mean, first of all, he was a third down passing coordinator, if I'm not mistaken. He he wasn't even an offensive coordinator, but I'm I'm gonna say Joe Brady. The offense is is not really explosive. I know last year he came out and said it's gonna be explosive. It's not explosive. It's more methodical and pick and choose. Pick and choose when you're going to throw and where you're going to throw. So do you believe in Joe That's Brady? Exactly and, what and, and, and what impact can Joe Brady have as far as his system on, on Sam Darnold? I mean, he can he can have a lot of he can have a lot of impact. He really can, but you know what I'm saying, at the same time, he's got to be willing to teach, Darnold's got to be willing to learn. So like I say, they they go hand in hand, you know what I mean? And like with a lot of the um, a lot of the times when Darnold was playing with the Jets, you seen, you know what I'm saying, some of the stuff that he was doing. He was going out there trying to make stuff happen. And I, I feel like I feel like Joe Brady going to stay the way he is. I feel like he's going to be a methodical coordinator. Facts. I mean, I, I really do. I don't think he's going to do nothing to where, you know what I'm saying, we blow the top off of defense. I feel like he's going he to play for the first down. Like, I really do. But, I mean, if he got an opening – where you can take something deep, then you take your shot, but don't just go out there and start getting crazy. Mm. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with your offense. You just need a better quarterback. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. I mean, I honestly feel like, I honestly feel like even if he ran the same offensive plays he ran last year, we'd have more more wins this year than we had last year with mm -hmm. Sam Donald. I really do believe that. Now, I, I said, like I said, I mean, for one, he, huh? No, go ahead, go ahead. I'm sorry, go ahead. Oh, yeah, because, I mean, for one, he's got, you know what I'm saying, he's got the arm talent, and he's got plenty of weapons around him. He's got weapons at his disposal. Like, wide receivers, running backs. I mean, bro, just crazy. Tight ends. We could do, we might actually be able to run a two tight end set. You know what I'm saying? If, if we do that. But, I mean, I ain't never known us to run a two tight end set. I mean... Maybe except for a couple of times with Greg Olson and, and Dan Hurts or whatever, but I mean, other than that, it's been very far and few in between. So, I mean, if you get to a point where we can use, you know, some two tight end sets or whatever, I mean, that'd be good because that'd give the defense a look they really haven't seen from us. So, that'd be something different. Well, no, we, we, we've been running two tight end sets. I mean, just. It's just heavy blocking. I mean, we never had – like, I tell, I tell you this right here. When we do go two tight end sets, we barely run any routes out of it. We usually have those guys in there blocking. So, this year, hopefully – Well, see, that's what I'm saying. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm talking about I'm talking about two tight end sets with, you know what I'm saying, tight ends running routes. Okay. Like, you know what I mean? Because, mm -hmm. I mean – it's, it'll be something different. So I, I'm looking forward to the season, though, man. I really am. Like I don't went and got me, I don't went and got me a Christian McCaffrey jersey. I bought me a Carolina <laughs> Panthers draft day hat. I got me a Carolina Panthers Zippo. Yeah. For like thirty five dollars. My like, nigga, dude, I'm I'm crazy in here. My nigga, that's what I'm talking about. Get you the old good old gold. That's what I'm talking about. Let me ask you this right here, yeah, though, man. man. Huh? Let me ask you this right here. Geno Atkins, yep. you, you think we can bring him in? Does that make any difference? Yes, sir. I think we should. Tell me about I that. I think we should. Man, that'll put our defense over the top. That'll put our defense over the top, man, hands down. Yeah. Hassan Reddick, Brian Burns, um, Derek Brown, and him. Oh, my God. Man, look. You talking about damn near an all-star uh, all front seven right there. Well, well real quick. Man, can going I, crazy. Can I, can I hear you say go dogs? Go dogs. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Another Georgia Bulldog product right there. You know what I mean? Bring them on in, man. I'm with it. I don't know, man. Um, yeah. I, yeah. They, I, man, look, yeah. I, I think they should. If they can pull the trigger on him, get him because he's a monster. He's a monster. Shout out to James Gordon for the cash app Panther Nation. Yes, sir. Hashtag Panther Nation. Let me, let me, let me do this with you real quick. When it comes to uh, – hold on, y'all. Let me take this call. Hold on. Stay right there. Stay right there. Uh, it was this. Call from – What's up, boy? What it do, though? Shit, nigga, how to get your credit, man? You, you be on it, G. Let me let me let you up in here. <clears throat> Got 
Got my dog PD Quick up here. We got my man Robert Foxworth. What's going on, fella? What a dude. Mm -hmm. What's going on, partner? Ain't nothing much, man. Just getting off. That's what's up. That's what's up. Facts. Oh, was a PA yeah. loan expert. Well, no, let me. Let me hey, I, I, go, ahead, go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, I've been listening to you since you, uh, you know, from the beginning, from the 15 minutes, then when you started, man. But, uh, yeah, I, I agree totally with you, uh, Big Cat, about, you know, about the offense. You know, like I said last uh, last time you had the show, you know, we we are not that offense. You know what I'm saying? That explosive offense that everybody thinks we are. Facts. Um, granted, um, as far as Joe Brady is concerned, um, I feel like how we draft our players is, you know what I'm saying, like how you – how you you draft though based off your 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 playing scheme? You know what I'm saying right. that the head coach or office coordinator, you will select those who are best fit for your system. You know what I'm saying? So as we people known for years before now, uh, we were a running team. I mean, we're still a running team. We just been, we was like right. power runners. You know? We was power runners. You know what I'm saying? Smash your ass and, and run your ass over type run. You know what I'm saying? Run first. Now we're trying to incorporate that pass now. You know what I'm saying? We had it then because if the running wasn't work back in the day, shit, we're going to throw it. And we got somebody who's going to be, who's going to go deep, who's, who's very physical. We ain't going to be that big, but a motherfucker physical. We had tall wide receivers at one point, you know what I'm saying? And, and still try to incorporate that and that didn't fall through. But as of right now, we got some speed on our team. We got a young, speedy uh, offense now with an offensive coordinator who, um, you know, I'm known for his college, you know, Stats, if you will. Um, he he, and I, and I agree with you too as well too. When you said that uh, he ain't showed me shit, because he definitely ain't showed me shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like, <laughs> like that was like yeah. a free trial. Yeah. You know what I'm saying that was a free trial. Uh, like let's see what you got, type shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. Now luckily this pandemic, I'm gonna give him, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him an excuse for the pandemic, and I'm only being nice. Oh. Oh yeah, that was his. That was his freebie right there. That was his freebie. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta show up now, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. Be nice to yeah, his I'm ass. Being nice. I'm only gonna be nice right now. Now, when season start. That's when. It, that's when he'll he have have to show me something. Shit, man. I take that back. Around the fucking uh, the preseason. That's when he got to show me something. I need to see something. Well, I mean, you... I, I I can't afford to see. He was he he was he didn't know how to use his fucking tight ends, and literally, no, man, it wasn't doesn't. until we had an episode we had an episode on here during the season where we were just screaming at the top of our, <laughs> top of our fucking right. please hey, the tight hey, end. Hey, yeah, I remember that. You remember that episode? Hey, big kid. Yeah. You remember, <laughs> if you remember, we was also screaming for the two tight end set when we first got Ian Thomas. Yep. Facts. Remember See? what we just talk, we just talked about that. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, we were just screaming for that. You know what I'm saying? When we got Ian Thompson, we had Greg Olson. We was hoping they was going to use that scheme, and they never did it. Facts. It they, like you said, you used it for, for blocking. Facts. Yeah, don't, Joe Brown. I don't know, bro. Ian, Ian Thompson, though, I, don't, I really don't think he's worthy of being a, a, a tight end, though, man, because he – I don't know. He just ain't, he just ain't proven that to me, man. Like, I really thought he was going to break out, man, but – I don't know what the hell he got going on, man. Maybe he think about I, food I, or something. I don't know what the hell he got I, going I, on. I could tell you, I could tell you what's happening with Ian Thomas. Um, and this is just based off of my uh, observation of watching some of the games. I feel like they didn't right. really use him a lot, so he kind of like felt like shit. I'm just gonna run these routes, and that's all I'm gonna do. Because I mean, I ain't gonna really get the ball. I'm gonna be just used for like for blocking for Christian. You know what I'm saying? But when he got hurt, they tried to. He ain't take advantage. Of his, uh, he take advantage of the of, of his uh, of the you know the chances that he had to make plays. He ain't take he ain't take advantage of it, so he kind of like looks shitty now. You know what I'm saying? He, he ain't take advantage, so he looks shitty. So I mean, he he didn't have that. He didn't give a fuck attitude. Pretty much, he had. I don't, I don't give a fuck. Like I ain't gonna get the ball. Shit. Yeah. He's gonna run it anyway. Like, oh, <laughs> well, Petey, what you think about you these numbers for? Uh... For Sam Donald that I quoted, 30, 3,200 passing yards, 23 passing touchdowns, four rushing touchdowns, 12 interceptions. What do you think about those numbers that I got uh, Sam Donald down for? I feel like it's a, it's a stretch, but I mean. Um, Hold on, nigga. What, what part is a stretch? <laughs> you know, I'm, bro, I'm not going to lie to you, uh, Big Cat. You, you know how I feel, and I don't know if you remember, but 
I ain't really a, a Sam Darnold fan, uh-huh. uh, but I feel like, like oh, I said, it's a stretch. Come on, man. My opinion. my opinion now, my opinion. Yeah, facts, facts. It's a stretch, facts. but it's fair. Wait a minute, what's a stretch? Because 3,200 ain't shit. I wouldn't even give him that high, bro. Wow. <laughs> bro, you know is this, hey, look, is this is this because you're not a Sam Darnold fan? It is. This is, this is exactly why. You mean to tell oh, me? Come on, man. 3,200 3, <laughs> yards is bro, too high? I'm going to be honest, I'm being honest, bro. Like, I'm not even going to shoot cold shit. Like, for real. That's what I mean. I'm just not a fan of him. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel like he is talented. You know, he's worthy of being in the league. But as far as starting with us, I mean, and you made some valid points as well. We don't need a, uh, a fucking MVP. Not MVP, but we, <laughs> we don't need a fucking uh, prime time quarterback, if you will, yeah. you know what I'm saying, to Facts. win games. Facts. However, you do need him to win big games in like Super Bowl. Right. <clears throat> well, so, yeah, those are the things that really, really matter. You know, however they do them job, like the backup, they do their job. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm Man, saying. Man, I think Sam gonna have close to four thousand yards passing, bro. Yeah, I'm not gonna say that shit either, bro. I hope, I hope you guys. What I'm gonna say, I hope you guys are right. That's all I'm saying. I'm gonna hope you guys are right. Because if you don't, we're gonna have to put, we're gonna have to put uh, Big Cat back in that clown suit again. Man, I'm trying to stay away from that <laughs> shit. <laughs> Hey man, I don't even want to think about no more clown makeup, but I'll do it if I, you know, if this nigga, bro, I'll be in Party City. Can I get the number four? Can I get the number four makeup kit? I'm, I'm you, 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 you best believe, man. I'm gonna be in that motherfucker. Nah, big cat, man. Not the, not the clown suit, man. Not the clown suit, bro. I'm holding. Nah, I'm holding. Yeah. I'm holding big cat accountable. I ain't holding accountable last man. year. Facts. I'm all in, though, man. Listen, uh, I, was, I was rolling. I was rolling when I seen that video, dude. I was weak. <laughs> I'm, I'm all in, man. But he, see, he had his own self. He, he, he had his own self responsible. Facts. Facts. What, what the hell he said? You know what I'm saying? He had to stand on it. Yeah. And I, and I felt him. I felt him for that. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, that's man, man right there. <laughs> yeah, hey, hey. I owned it, man. That's I, man right there. If anybody else, man, hell no, I ain't doing this shit, man. You got me fucked up, cuz I ain't doing this shit. Do, do you know somebody, hey, bro, on, I, I, somebody on Twitter huh? made a gif out of that shit? They made a gif out of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that shit had me rolling, man. Hey, hey nah, I'm, I'm, I, do, I, do, I do disagree with you when uh, I think you said something about... Uh, Something about you know I'm gonna hold him accountable. Mm-hmm. Uh, Sam Donald accountable. Yeah, yeah tell me about it. To. They held they held um, Teddy Bridgewater accountable uh, of one season. You know what I'm saying? They he said what? Well, you gotta understand. Oh, hold on, let me read this. Cash. Shout out to Brother Leo. Brother Leo says Sam Donald will have more passing yards than Lamar Jackson. That's not hard. <laughs> Thank you for the cash. <laughs> Come on, man. He smoked something, bro. You don't crack, Brother Leo. Brother Leo bro. <laughs> Man, that's Leo, ain't it? That's my brother right there, brother Leo. Leo. Crack, that's crap, bro. Man, Leo needs to sit in there and down for that. But, but listen, Petey, Petey, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about right here. The reason why I say you can't blame Sam Darnold if he fails is because a lot of people, like, like even you just said, you said he ain't shit. So, I mean, you, you're pretty much, I mean, who you going to, are you going to blame Pinocchio for making himself or being clumsy or are you going to blame Geppetto? You gonna blame Geppetto for for making that motherfucker? I mean, you know what I mean? Exactly. You, hey, yeah, you gonna, hey, yeah, you gonna blame Geppetto for the motherfucking name? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> so that's why I say matter. It's matter. It's on mad rule. If this nigga struggle, I mean, a lot of you gonna say, "Well, I told you he wasn't shit. I wasn't was shit." But I'm looking at mad rule. Like, wait a minute, nigga, you don't want to come in here talking about he's a good leader and all this other shit. You know what I mean? Right. So, you co-sign him. Right. So you co-sign him, man. You better you better be the first one in the front fucking podium saying, "I, I, exactly. I lied. I lied." You know what I mean? You better dance, bro. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. See, I don't do no shit like that. I don't do no shit like that. That's bullshit. I mean, my thing is, then, once you once you speak on something, man, stand by that shit right or wrong. Facts. Facts. Oh, no. I'm, I'm going to be a realist, though. I'm going to be a realist, though. It depends on it depends with the quarterback, um, like if, if it's his fault or not. Like, I'm, I'm, I'll be fair to him. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to give him a chance. I, mean, I don't have a choice but to give him a chance. You know what I'm saying? Now, I don't own the team. You know what I'm saying? They pick whatever they want to pick. So, we don't have a choice. So, I mean, by all means, I'm going to give him a chance, you know what I'm saying, as a fan. Um, and I'll make my my uh, <laughs> I'll make my decisions. But, you know, what goes on, you know, when I see certain, you know, events when we playing. But, however. Um, you mean you're going to buy a jersey and shit, man? <laughs> yeah. I, I, 
I'm, I'm, I'm being trying to be optimistic, man, because I'm, I'm nervous this season because I'm tired of this losing shit, bro. Right. I'm tired of this trial and error bullshit, bro. This is like it's just, yeah, I feel you. Yeah, this is bro. I'm with you, man. I'm with you. I mean, how many it's times you gonna give a nigga a chance? Yeah, it definitely does. I tell you what, man. I'm, I'm about one more. Kind shit, kind shit don't work. Kind shit, kind shit won't work. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a one more clown makeup away from goddamn saying fuck these motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> but one clown makeup away. Hey, brother Leo says Lamar Jackson only had 2,700 year, 100 yards last year. Fuck him. Fact. Shout out to brother Leo. Yeah, that's true. I think you have more yards than. He probably, he probably read his stats next these days, huh? <laughs> okay, well, shit. That's last year. What about the year before that? That's only one year. That's only he one year. Went to that, bro. He went to go look that up for sure. I'm proud of him. That's, that's progress. But 26 TDs and nine picks, though. That's, I mean, shit. Fuck the fact that he threw for 2,700 yards. He only threw nine picks. I mean, shit, and then he can run. He's a fucking, he's a fucking running back in the goddamn with a fucking football in the goddamn hand, tossing that bitch. Well, that's a good word, running back. There, you used a good word. Back to the Carolina Panthers here, man. Back to the Carolina Panthers here. You know what else pissed me off, though? Yeah, what pissed you off? The fact that they, they held Cam, they held Cam uh, accountable. Majority of losses, they said, oh, he said he overthrew the ball. He overthrew the ball. But for the real life, some of them, some of them games. The wide receiver failed to catch that. They came and he was spot on. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? He tried to catch it to him with his speed when we had burners on, on our team, like Ted Ginn and uh, who else? Uh, Phillips. These fast ass wide receivers that we had. Trying to catch it to him. Some of them motherfuckers, there, Antonio, well, it, what's what it is? Ace Smith from the Eagles when he came to our squad. Shit, he was dropping passes. <laughs> Huh? You talking about Tory Smith? Yeah, Tory Smith. Tory Smith. Tory Smith. That's what okay. I'm talking about. Okay, Tory Smith. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, hey, hey, yeah. But on, on, you know what, though? On the flip side, though, on the flip side, though, it was very seldom. That that happened when he threw the ball spot on in the motherfucker caught that shit. <laughs> it was very seldom, bro. Very seldom. I like Cam. I like Cam, man. But bro, it was very seldom when that shit happened. If he did, if he did throw it spot on and somebody dropped, he's like, oh man, damn, why you drop that? Like, and then Cam go back to the same bullshit, overthrowing, underthrowing, trying to do some Superman shit. He got four people around him. He gonna instead of him throwing the shit away. Like any other quarterback would be, he gonna try to spin out the shit and run and jump in the air and then somebody hit his ass in the mouth, get up, hold his damn, yeah, get up like somebody did his ass wrong, looking at the referee like motherfucker, you was a runner at that point, he's not a quarterback. That's, that's, and that's mainly because he kept trying to force the ball downfield versus checking down. Most of the, the, the right. balls that he had that was actually open was the check down uh, passes. Somebody was always open downfield, you know, not downfield, but you know. On uh, check, check down, you know what I'm saying. Now he he keeps trying to force it deep, and you can't when you got your, your wide receiver either getting triple or double coverage. And that was that that was the goofy ass Superman persona he had. He always felt like he had to try to make shit happen when he really didn't need to. Facts. You know what? And, and I know people ain't gonna like to hear this, but I really believe that's why Matt Rule didn't want to want him here because Matt Rule knew the offense that he was trying to run is more so about taking the right read and shit. He didn't want to, you know, he wasn't trying to go out here for deep shot. I mean, you take the deep shot when it's available, but you don't, you know what I mean? You don't sit here and try to force it and shit, you know. You know what I mean? It just, I, I felt like he felt like he can have a more efficient offense with Teddy, but he was wrong about that. You think so, Big Cat? I think so. I mean, it makes I think sense. So. It makes sense on top of that. I mean, and then on top of that, like, Cam, he definitely wasn't, you know what I'm saying, who he was when he first came in, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, he had a lot of injuries and stuff, too, so that would have put us in another position, too. Like, let's just say he got hurt again. You know what I'm saying? But we picked up up Teddy. 
Yeah, exactly. And well, hell, that, that wasn't a good one either. Well, that's what I was like, yeah. don't we think about that? <laughs> well, Teddy was a liar and a nigger. Yeah, look. That's why. That wasn't a good movie. I was mad as hell when I was seeing that shit. I'm like, dude, three years, six, man, bro, this a duct tape. And I was saying that shit from the beginning, bro. He's a duct tape quarterback. That wasn't a good movie. I was mad as hell when I was seeing that shit. Oh, yeah. as, far, as far as bringing Geno in, uh, I'm with it, man. I, I don't feel like we had the money to pay him, though. Get that motherfucking nigga on the cheap. Get him on the cheap, right. bro. Get that nigga on the cheap, bro. Cause they can give him, they can give him a deal. They can give him a deal for like one or two mil, and then like put some incentives in there. You know what I'm saying? To kind of boost that. So you know what I'm saying? Deal. Like for for the one year. You know what I'm saying? And then see how he play out, and then shit. You no, know, we got we got. I mean, Hey, brother. Hello? Hey, what's up, brother? Hey, brother. How you been, man? I said, I read them, them them links you sent me, man. Beautiful pieces there, man. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that, that was very um informative, you know, based on reality and not people's emotion. Yes, sir. Man, happy 4th of July to you, brother. Celebrate hey, yeah, America. man. Thank you, brother. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. I had, I, I had a good time. I just chilled out and... Try to stay out of Negroes' way, you know. Yeah, yeah, you know they're always gonna be in your way. We're gonna yeah. talk about that New Jersey shit later on. I'm gonna get your topic on. I'm gonna get your thought on that shit. New Jersey? Mm-hmm. Oh shit! I don't know what happened. I'll, I'll just live up there too. You remember when the white man was fucking with that African and um? Oh, okay, yeah. Um, I'm South Jersey, uh, Lamont Law, New Jersey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know about that part. That's stay... South Jersey. Yeah, yeah, okay, gonna... then whenever you ready, brother. Oh yeah, we're gonna stay there for a little bit later on. But we're gonna have a good time tonight. <laughs> Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, let me let you in here. I appreciate <clears throat> We got Brother Leo uh, on the line. What's up, Brother Leo? Hey, hey. Uh, peace peace and yeah. salutations. Peace, peace, brother. Peace, peace. Let's let's talk about it. Let's 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 give Sam a chance. Let's stop hating on Sam. Mm -hmm. You know, you know, Sam ain't had no wide receiver. His wide receiver, you know, was it Jameson Crowder? That was that was the number one wide receiver. You know, he just got a he just got an offensive lineman last year. You know, so I mean, hey, I know he beat the Rams in L.A. last year. I know that. Um, they would have had they had the Raiders on the ropes, but a coach, you know, the defensive coordinator, he made a bad call and he got fired that same day. Um, I mean, you know, you got to get Sam a no, chance. I mean, I understand. I understand. I understand. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I mean, it's nothing. It's nothing. No wide receivers. I mean, so so so. Y'all making excuses for us for um asking. I can't throw outside the number Jackson, but I mean, you know, I mean, what's up? Y'all got excuses for them Negroes. Let's give Sam an excuse. Wait, who made it? Lamar. Lamar. I can't throw outside the numbers Jackson. He's a fucking running back, playing quarterback. I mean, it's easy to win. We all do is fucking run. You know, hey, yeah. All this dude do is run. He's a liability yeah, on, on the offensive that. side of the ball. He's a liability. Double threat. Double threat. Man, no double threat. You're a double threat if you're effective. You're not effective. So stop playing. Well, shit. well, it's nothing. He's a vision space, so he makes it to the playoffs about every year. But who, made, made, but who made it? Who made it cute for him? though? I'm still trying to. You said we made. I mean, if it, if, to, if, if it don't apply, let it fly. You know. If it don't apply to that fire, let's get Sam right. a chance. Y'all don't want him. Y'all, we we had Scam Newton. Y'all was running with him, you know, even though he was a liability oh, no, on I offense. Already I already said I think Sam Donald going to throw for like 4,000 yards. I already said okay. that. Oh, uh, yeah. Because. I, I do. But you know what? Let's think about it. Big Cat, I disagree with you, brother. The other day you made a, you made a video no. about Sam and running the ball. Uh -huh. Fuck all that running shit, man. All the wide receivers we got. It's four three or better, you know. We got CMC running four five, and we got Chuba right there four three. Let's 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 throw the football down the fucking field. We ain't got no power backs. The only reason Tannehill was successful is because they kept handing the ball off to uh, my man. He was getting one fifty a game. That was slowing the game down. But you know, when it's when it's winning time, when they win against Kansas City, what happened? You gotta score the fucking ball. Fine. You can't just get a ball to the running back. He can't. He ain't getting no four touchdowns. So wait a minute. So, are you telling me Christian can't run in between the tackles? Is that what you telling me? No, sir. Not successfully. Not no twenty times a game. <laughs> Christian a little bit. He a little bigger than me. 
I'm 200. He's smoking, bro. I mean, it just, he can not because he, he got fucking hurt. What you mean? He cool. He, he, was, he, he played <laughs> he one game last year. He played three games last year. What you talking about? He got hurt in the end zone, dumbass. No, he didn't. He got hurt before he even ran to the end zone. Dumbass. Dumbass. He, he fucked his ankle up before he went to the end zone. Dumbass. He went. He fucked his ankle up before he... It, no, it wasn't. It was a motherfucking pitch, and he twisted his fucking ankle the first time. He stayed. So that, that was, and that was the line, and that was the tackle spot. If if no 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 no, no. if no, no he ain't nobody said it was about his fault. You motherfucking niggas always got a fucking false narrative. Niggas always got a fucking oh. false narrative. I said I said I said he hurt his fucking foot when, on, on a on a on a pitch from fucking under the bridge water. And he fucking twists his ankle. They use him too much. He too small to be giving the ball thirty times. You can't run him up the middle like that. Why they draft a running back then? Tennessee, ain't, Tennessee, Tennessee ain't drafting a running back. I, I wouldn't do it. Not up the middle. I wouldn't. I wouldn't run him thirty times up there in the middle. He too small. He too small. That's the only thing you really have a point on. They did out. They did run him too much. Everybody they did. Running. That's what I'm saying. So they, all they, that giving him the ball. They ain't saying that he can't run between the tackles though. That's Bro, he not, he not a power back. He not a power back. He not a workhorse back. Yo, he's a speed he's a, back. He, he he's a speed. Outside. Yeah, get him he's the ball outside or get him the ball in space. That's like Chuba. Give him the gonna, ball in space. But if you are gonna pay him all that money, they figure like, hey, we are gonna run your ass to the motherfucking field. No, that's not it. That's not intelligent. They gonna use him as a wide out and a running back. We only had one option. Scam was trash, so we had to get the ball to him all the fucking time. Now you, now you, now you smoking. Stop man, you keep track. saying smoking, but you keep saying that, but that's not that's not a, that's that's not a logical response. You keep track. saying that that's some that's some elementary school shit. That's like, oh, uh, uh, fuck your mother. Come on, man. We talking about fruit scam, scam new, and was I ain't gonna talk about it anymore. I ain't gonna talk about. It. But look here, we got weapons, big cat. We can't all that running the ball shit. Fuck it. We so run the ball. Minute. We throw the ball. We throw the ball more than we run. We got to win the fucking game. We got to score at least 25 to 30 points a game. Question, Leo. Let me ask you a question. What kind of yes, team sir. are we? Are we a throwing or a running team? We got to be a throwing team. What our team are have we been known for? Because we had an in that quarterback. No, I asked you a question. I need you to answer the question. What type of team were we? We were primarily play action running back, running team, because we had a quarterback that was – and that, that throwing the ball, it wasn't because we had the team. DeLone wasn't no Brett Favre. DeLone, he was a play action quarterback. We had to run the ball and play around defense. So what? So what are we? So what? Are, what is our plan to do? Doing what is our scheme? Run first, right? Play action. We don't even. We're gonna run first, right? Run first. I I I don't think that's. I don't. I, no, no, I disagree. We don't need to do that. That's what we've been doing. We ain't went. We ain't went shit with it. Need to do. I'm saying what we are. That's what I'm. No, saying. no, no. We. I, I'm telling. I'm telling you. I disagree. That's not what we are. We have two number one wide receivers, prospectively. We got two number one wide receivers capable of getting a thousand yards a season. You well, don't fucking well, run well, the well, ball Let me, all let me the ask time you this, Let me ask you this. I, I want you to give yes, me an honest sir. answer. How many times a game are you okay with Sam Donald throwing it? As many, at, at least a minimum of 20 times. A minimum of 20 times. Sam has the, a minimum of 20 times, brother. In order for us to be effective, Sam Donald has the talent and the ability. I mean, he could still do that without running the ball, though. No, no, no. Hold on. Before y'all before y'all continue, let me ask you this, Leo. Based off what? Based off his ability to pass the ball. He has the arm strength. <laughs> He has a he has the timing, and he has the ability. We 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 can't we can't just sit back and say we got a running team. We don't. We don't Look, have no. He can still do it without being a running team. He can still pass the ball twenty times a game. But that's why I said a minimum. But I'm saying that. a minimum. But we. Well, yeah, I understand that. But I'm saying he can still do that. You know, what I'm yeah, saying? he can still do that. Yeah, yeah, you could win with that. You you could be like Lamar Jackson and throw the ball five times and run the ball fucking eighty times. I mean, you could win with that, but I mean, that ain't gonna win you no motherfucking championship. The game, right? But then, but then, but, well, but no, you ain't gonna beat you ain't gonna beat Josh Allen. You ain't gonna no, beat Sam, Sam Donald's not, not a scrambler. He he's not a scrambler. Well, he, that's because you because you he's don't not. know what you're talking about. What, what he did when he played with the Jets. What he do? What he did when he ran against Denver. 
What he did when he went in his temple? That's what he did. He ran for his fucking life. Like, but he was running, though. When you're on the pressure, I'm saying he's not, he, I'm, what I'm saying is, I'm not saying he can't run the ball. Yes, he can run the ball. He got fucking legs. He can run the ball. But I'm saying he's not a scrambler, is what we, I'm saying. He's we not don't, a scrambler. We he don't need to run out of pocket. He 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 do to get ball. That's scramble. what I'm saying. We don't need nigga football. Nigga football don't win. Who we don't talking, need bro, that. What are you talking about? I'm on Nick, the same page with you. I'm saying he's not a scrambler. What are you talking about? You said you wanted him to Minimum can, 20 times a game. He, I said we could still do that running the ball. We are a running team. We are. What we, I'm saying. Dude, I, don't know I, you, this, I don't know what you got going on right now. I hear what you're saying, bro, but I'm telling you, we had a weapons where we don't necessarily need to be no running team and C Mac not a fucking power back. He don't have to he be a power back. Man. So let me ask you this, Leo. Who, who does the offense need to go through this year? DJ and Robbie. Uh uh-uh, uh. Uh-uh. Push the ball oh, down okay, the field. Go, go the That's it. Push the ball down the field. When the Rams was running we, Marshall Falk, how many wide receivers they had out there? That. We're not known for that, bro. We're not known for that. We're not bro, known because we had a sorry ass bro. fucking we had, quarterback. Bro, we had fucking four more wide receivers. And we don't. You, <laughs> that's not our team, bro. And we, we don't. don't have an no, you see. see no. You so you, y'all so used to being mediocre with sorry ass fucking quarterbacks. We 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 bro, we got to push the ball down the field. You're talking like you Sam Darnold is like a number a uh, fucking number one quarterback or some shit. He got he was, more. He, was, bro, bro. he has more he passing ability than Cam Newton and Jake Delone. He has more arm talent than. That's a lie. Well, I mean, that's. I mean, well, I mean, hey, we he gonna see. Better, he ain't even better than Hot Damn or Deshaun Watson. Bro, nobody, nobody. Well, I'm not debating that. that. You want to talk numbers? I'm not debating that. What I'm sticking to is the fact that you said Sam Donald, minimum, you want him to pass for 20 times a game. I said we could do that being a running team. Tristan McCaffrey don't have to be a power back for us to do that. When you say running team, what you mean running uh, 30, 40 times a game? What you, what you I mean, mean running yeah. 20, 25 so, times? McC- yeah, but so we're going we, we to get a ball to him 25 times? At, at the most. We're going to get the ball to him. Bro, that's oh, we're going to give him the ball 25 you times. Other running back, bro. You don't just run one damn running back the whole fucking game. That's why okay. you have other running backs. Okay, and they okay. did that last year, which was some dumb shit. They, they did it last year. It was stupid. I thought it was dumb as fuck. Like, bro, y'all going to run him to the point the way he's going to fucking hurt himself. Now, and I feel like with them talking about they're going to do the same thing this year. It's going to put him in another position to hurt himself again because, like him, he don't know, you know what I'm saying, he don't know when the season is done. He's not a control of it. Why? Why did they do that last year? Why did they do that last year? I tell you why they did it. I tell you why they did it. You don't know. I mean, I know. I'm pretty sure you already you caught wind, but at the same time, this is why they did it. They did it because the motherfucking quarterback got hurt. At the end of the day, who's your your go-to guy? Who's who gonna carry that team? It's gonna be McCaffrey. So shit, they had to yeah, depend he, on. He had he had to carry the team. Yeah, now, Greg, I, mean, I agree with it. No, I don't agree with it. But at the same time, hey, we paying you all this bread, bro. You better do something. It's not about that. It's not about that. Hey, everybody gets paid in the NFL, whether you're a producer or not. Yeah. It's about yeah. them yeah. using. It's, it's about the using. We had to use McCaffrey because Scam got hurt. We had no other options. We, the game is the name of the game is to win the game. Play with us last year. We're talking about Teddy Bridges when he didn't play with us. Cam didn't play with us last year. Teddy played last year. Dumbass. Cam didn't play with us last year. You said so. <laughs> I'm talking about the year before last. I'm talking about the year before last. I'm talking about the year before last. Last year, CMC only played three games. So that that, that throws your argument out the bro. window. You 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 talking about stuff that don't we'll mean nothing because he only played three games last year. So what is he talking about? I'm talking about when we played in '19, when when Scam got hurt, so we had we to keep relying on him. Bro, we on two separate years. We talking about last year. Last year they ran them. Um, how many times, Chris? How many times touched the ball? What twenty times the whole season? He got hurt. It's over with. It's not about him overusing him. He got fucking hurt. That's it. Shit happens. So what are you saying? We're gonna we're gonna have more of an air attack and not a not a ground attack. 
Yeah, yeah. We have to we have to rely on pushing the ball down the field. That's why we lost those games last year because we didn't push the ball down the field enough. Well, we yeah, had plenty of opportunities you, to win the game. But why not why but, not use the play action to set that up though? You could because Christian not no eye running back. He not no eye formation running back. We're not gonna have him in the eye. It's gonna be some read option shit. And then we're gonna have him and Tuba and uh, Tuba on one side, Christian on the other side. That shit is That's so it. fucking dynamic. Sam could push Joe Brady. Joe Brady is not when they was at LSU, was he running the fucking ball? No, they was throwing the ball down the fucking field. Joe was getting like 400 yards a game. You know how many yards Joe threw? Joe threw for almost 5,000 fucking yards. Throw the ball down the fucking field. Why did the wide receivers get like 1,000 yards apiece? Because he was throwing the ball down the field. Even with mediocre Teddy. Even with me. What's up, dude? <laughs> Kurt had 700 and DJ had 1,200. That's what mediocre ass Kurt. I mean, mediocre ass um, Teddy. Mm hmm. And we still lost. Because Teddy it, Teddy is limited. You fucking small minded Negroes, Teddy is fucking limited. <laughs> Come on, we still fucking lost. Because it, Teddy Teddy was limited. Yeah. There's nothing against him. He was limited. Limited to what? There's a lot of niggas that's limited in, in, in his life. Teddy was, limited. Limited, Teddy was limited. Teddy was limited. He did not have the arm strength. Don't push the ball down the field. Even when even when we played against the Saints, when DJ was open, he threw the ball down the field. The shit was still a struggle. That don't make Shit sense. don't never you add up, big cat. We got, we got, we got, we got, they got. <laughs> Niggas said, let's be a pass on offense, but you should average 20 passes. What? But you talking about Teddy is limited. It don't make sense. <laughs> it don't make sense. Stupid hey, hey, Leo, you did lose me on that. For us to be a passing offense, bro, we got to have like 30 said, something, bro. Big cat, I said a minimum, I said a minimum of 20 yard, 20 passes. I said a minimum. Oh, okay. I said a minimum. Oh, okay. I said a minimum. Okay. I said a minimum. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, that's a minimum. This brain says so this is minimum and limited. Two of our wide receivers got over a thousand yards apiece, but we were he was limited. I don't understand, Big Dan. By throw by throwing the ball twenty ten yards or less, he was he was very low in his yards per attempt. Teddy, that's a fact. That's not my opinion. Is that is that based off analytics? That's based off his limited arm strength. Analytics. But to be completely honest, I mean Teddy ain't been hundred percent ever since that injury and in them. Um, oh, okay, here we go with the excuses. Here we go with the excuses. That's not an excuse. That's a fact. What you That's an about? excuse. Was his arm? Was his arm hurt? Was his arm hurt? Shit, something. It affected something. It affected something. <laughs> Big cat. Yes, sir. Wow. The, 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 the coaching staff and the GM know we drafted Terrence Marshall. Mm -hmm. We drafted Shy. We got more. Yep. We got the, the tight end hybrid. He's fast. He's 4 4. Robbie and DJ running 4 3. My man Chuba from Oklahoma State, mm -hmm. track motherfucker 4 3. The slowest motherfucker on the offensive side of the ball is fucking Christian. Damn. So it's no yeah, way in the world. That's a curve ran four three, but we got but but the size is four three too. We got speed. If they not drafting these fucking fast motherfuckers to fucking run the ball, yeah. move the ball down the field, take advantage of the motherfucking Saints not having Drew, take advantage of Tom on his way out, and take advantage of the Falcons not having a number two wide receiver option and a running back. We one. have the ability to dominate the division. Let's they they go. I'm telling you, bro. They're not finna. They're not finna dink and dunk. They're not finna play with the football. They're finna move that ball down the field. They have too many fucking weapons. They have uh an embarrassment of riches. I mean, you make sense. I mean, I just it's hard to see Sam Darnold yeah, being do. that they guy. Do. I mean, you make I mean, sense now. Been that. Like they got too many weapons. Cat, it's hard to but see I it, but like, mm -hmm. I'm just part of me. It's just like the lottery. We have to be in it to win it. We got Sam. I'm not saying that he's going to do none of this shit because, like you say, honestly speaking, his tape wasn't the best. I'm not making excuses for him. Sam was turning the ball over. He was doing a lot of crazy shit. But the ability is there. So let's maximize the ability. If they fuck up, they fuck up. It is what it is. Oh, wow. you, because you also heard read option. 
We should do Reed option with Sam Donald. That's what else I heard. Oh, wait a minute, bro. You don't, you, don't, you don't think Sam Donald athletic, bro? Oh, man. <laughs> Reed option is for running, so why is this nigga talking about running? Fire. That's why I'm so, so confused. But we need to throw deep, though. We need to throw deep. That's how we win the Damn, game. Damn, Leo, they Niggas countering your ass, nigga. Niggas just run some circles in line. Don't know what they talk about. Big Cat, yeah. watch Sam Darnold. Nigga ain't never be a read option in his life. He ain't did that shit in, in more, fucking college. It's more low Stupid lights shit. and highlights, but I'm saying the ability is there. The arm talent is there. They have to maximize it. If he's up, if he has it mentally up there, then you know he can win. You know we can win. But oh, I can also disagree room. with you on the defensive side of the ball. I think you're overplaying the hand on the defense. Okay. I think you overplaying it. We're going to see because I don't think we have the pass rush to, you know, to justify things. Because I'm, I'm not, I'm, I don't trust Hassan Riddick. I don't trust him. You know what? We had a Cardinals fan um on here that's saying that he was overrated. Um, yeah, yeah. What's her I, I, name? I agree uh, with that. Ariana or Ariana? She, she said he was overrated. So. Yeah, Hassan Riddick, because like they they was about to cut him last year. They was trying to trade him, but they didn't get any offers. Why they didn't offer him any money? Because they were they were trying to move on from him. Well, I'm glad you brought that up here. Let's talk about uh Brian Burns. I said 13 and a half sacks to be safe, but I could easily see him getting over 15. Is 13 and a half fair? That that's a bit much, but I I, I would settle for 10 or 11. Um, <laughs> but 13. Great. That's great to me. 13, that's a bit much, brother, because, like, we, we don't have any other viable option on the other side. If we had somebody that we didn't have to double team him, we didn't have to double team, then Brian possibly could, but yeah. they could focus on him because YGM, he, he, you know, he hasn't shown anything yet. But we'll see what happens. Well, you know what? Again, you're making some good points here. I just uh, – I mean, when you look at our when you look at our pass rush defense, really, I mean, proven, proven pass rush. I, we, we don't know what YGM is yet. Uh, Hassan Riddick, I mean, I mean, I guess we got to see a consistent year. Matter of fact, let me look yeah. up his number. When, when has he been consistent? Let me look up his numbers. Hold on, stay right there. He had twelve. He had twelve sacks last year, but he had five in one game against the Giants. Oh, okay. Let me let me um, look Riddick. up what his career was. I want to look up his career. Riddick. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. He had a pretty good season. So really no, nah, fuck a season. I want to see what what his career has been. If you look at Big K, you're gonna be disappointed, brother. You're Hold gonna on. be disappointed. Let me let me look it up. Okay. <laughs> Because I want to see what 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 proven pass rush do we have? Consistent proven pass rush, not just like one year. I mean, you know, I mean that was cute, but I want to see. Hold on, y'all. Let me look it up. God damn, man. Yeah, consistency does play a big factor. Mm-hmm. All right, hold on. Jets better head coach in the Wow. He had fifty three five. 20 assists and 12.5 sacks. And how many years? No, that was his that last was, year, that, probably. That, that, that was his last no, year. No, I ain't talking about just last year. That's I'm talking about his long. career. Because you got to be careful, motherfuckers, playing for their contract, man. Right, yeah. Career, he had 20. I'm talking and, about one, and last year, he had 12. So if you combine career, that. Career, career, he had 20. All in total, 20. And one year, he had 12. So, Big Cat, you yeah. got to divvy that up. That's. That's what two a year. Yeah, I mean, um, you know, shit, man. I mean, that's why I was saying I wasn't, I wasn't mocking you what you were saying because I, I made the same point earlier. When mm-hmm. Brian Burns, if Brian Burns goes off, all you got to do is like, like, like a guy like him is throw bodies at him, throw tackles, throw tight ends, throw pulling guards, throw chipping, chip H back, mm-hmm. chip, chip his ass. I mean, yeah. I mean, negate that speed, make him go through four different layers. Before he yeah, gets to the quarterback, that, you know that, what I mean? How yeah. many sacks do y, YGM have as a rookie? One. <laughs> he only 2.5. 2.5? Yeah. Uh, really? 2.5. Okay. <laughs> but we're we going to see that. I mean, I give I give him that. I give him that because he has the ability. He got hurt, too. But you also got to – well, we have a plus in the middle because um, Derek Brown, he's going to take up a double team, and he has the ability to get in the backfield. Um, I'm not saying he's going to be – Donald, nothing like that, but he has the ability. Y'all got to realize this though. Well, what about Morgan Fox? His addition to the team is going to be a uh, pretty much pick your poison type of deal mm-hmm. or defense. Facts. Pick your poison. Fox is a rotational yeah, player. player. Or it can be a defense in. Pick your poison. It ain't got to always be uh, shit. Uh, Burns coming for you the whole time. You got to worry about key, key other key players. 
There are no other key players outside of outside of Brown in the middle. We don't have another dominant play on the defensive side of the ball. No, really, we don't. Are you serious? We don't. Or outside of well, we we don't know if um um I don't know if I don't know if Horn would be dominant like that. We're gonna see. I think you, you know it's all it's all, it's all projection, so we don't know. Facts, facts. There you go. I guess I guess Chin not uh dominant. He's <laughs> he's not. He definitely not. He definitely not. <laughs> What do you think chin, about Chen, um, Leo? Chen, <laughs> Chen, 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 Chen we're, we're going to see. I think Chen is better suited as a linebacker. I don't know about playing safety. Was, I'm not what sure. What position he did? He just had a dominant fucking first year of the season. Yeah. fuck have you been watching? Yeah, I, he must be watching. I don't, I don't know, bro. Like, that, I don't know. Bro. Well, let me, well, Leo might got a little point here, man. What, 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 now listen, I'm asking everybody on here. What guaranteed lineman outside of Burns that you can rely on day in and day out to get it done? Other than Burns. That's proven. He, he's a DN, though. I'm talking about that's proven. That's been proven. You know for sure he's going to show up. Other than Burns. No, I'm talking about lineman. Lineman. You said lineman. I was just a lineman. Yeah, no, lineman. Yeah. I mean, shit. I mean, don't get me wrong, shit. Don't, and please don't get it misconstrued. YGM, he he plays his part. Yeah, I said proven, though, bro. Yeah, they won. They won. He's pretty good. I mean, Derek Brown, I mean, he plays his part as well, too. So, I mean, mm-hmm. like I said, all the additions, it's pretty much a pick your poison. You can't run to one of the side without worrying about either the motherfucker coming for some help. Or it's gonna be like a team tackle, or or it could be you know, uh, you know individual. Yeah, to me, I, I feel like yeah, I feel like it's a collective thing. You know what I'm saying? One thing yeah. gotta happen for another thing to happen. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they're gonna slow you down. Yeah. Yeah. If they if not, they all meeting in the backfield. From what I've been seeing, mm-hmm. right? Sometimes. No, no, no. Why I think you? Morgan Fox gonna show up though. I think he gonna show up this year. Now, why, Leo, you there? Yeah, I'm here, brother. Why, why did you say 13 and a half sacks was a bit too much? Because I don't see him, like I say, he, you know, 13 and a half, that, that's a bit much. That's a stretch for him I, I, because I don't see it right now, brother. I don't see it. Yeah, but why Why don't you see it? That's what I'm, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Oh, because of, his, <laughs> because of his weight, because of the ability of him – you know, I, I don't see him being a bull rusher. He's a speed rusher, and yeah. you know, but he got to pick up weight because I think Cam Jordan came into the league a little light, if I'm not mistaken. But, um, but we're gonna see. But I, I don't think I don't. I see 13 is a little stretch for him because um, speed rushers, you know, if they're not playing the three four defense, then you know, because you know, if he if he's not balling like um Von Miller was in his first three or four years, you know, I don't see it. But he's solid though. He's a good tackler. Um. He gets to the ball. He creates turnovers. Um, he's, a, he's a solid player. Um, but um, if he get 11 sacks, I'll be satisfied with that, brother. But 13 and all that, I don't know, brother. All right. Well, let's, let's talk about DJ Moore here, man. Um, my projection for DJ Moore, I got him at 1,300 yards, 62 receptions, and um, eight touchdowns. And I think he make his first Pro Bowl here. Now, if you like I said before, man, if you don't remember, I said DJ Moore needs a double-digit touchdown season in order for the national media to recognize him as a superstar. I think in Carolina and regionally, he's he's local, he's he's honored as a as a star, but you know, on a national I, level, he's not a star. But so so, what do you think about those numbers? Those numbers are solid. 80, 62 catches is very low. I would see him in the 80 range. But I'm going to tell you why I disagree with you on him not being nationally known. Because Julio, how many touchdowns Julio was averaging? <clears throat> Barely 10. Yeah, but, but Julio, that nigga had like 1,500 yards a season. A that's what I'm saying. So, I mean, you know, he got – DJ got to dominate, you know. Fact, so, so we're going to see. He got, he got to put a two. He got to put a 200-yard game on somebody. Yeah. You know. Yeah. You know, he got to put a 200-yard game on so somebody. So, the quarterback got to dominate. <laughs> yep. <laughs> DJ has the ability to play ball. I, I have faith in him. You know, yeah. we're going to see. Um, we're going to see. And that, that, I'm, I'm going to say that, I'm, I'm gonna go in and say that Marcus Haynes is going to be a player to watch next year, too. 
Yeah, we're gonna Marky watch him Payne, get cut. So we might watch him get cut. I don't he because he he got he got more tackles than uh than YGM. I mean, because it got hurt. <laughs> but it, it Haynes is a little Dude. small too. That's why he's like a rotational player. Haynes is supposed to have been coming Haynes around since Ron Rivera. He's a little he's a, Haynes is still a little ain't small. Haynes so came into the league small light. <laughs> but yeah, Haynes is a solid he's, he's, he's a solid rotational player. We probably could trade Haynes to get somebody for him. But um he's a he solid got, player, he but he's a tackles and four sacks. He's a solid rotational player. But Big Cat, I'm gonna tell you this: this is the last year Shaq Thomas is gonna be on the team. Thompson gonna be on the team. Yeah, I'm hoping they're gonna they're gonna move they're gonna move on from him. I I think so if he doesn't if he doesn't perform, brother. If he doesn't perform, yeah, I don't. Yeah, he, I he, 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 he's a good player. He's a solid player. But in order to win, you need better than solid players. You know, not getting that kind of money. So I um, I'm glad you said I that. There. Gonna, so you said we need better than solid players. So so what do you think of Sam yeah. then? Sam, Sam, don't. I mean, it's, it's the potential is there, but we got to see. No, no, we no, no. no. I, need you to, I need you to give him a label. You just said that we need solid players to win. So, what, what do you, what do you consider Sam? We need Sam to play. We need Sam to play above average, and thus, in order for us to win eleven games, like I projected, mm-hmm. we need Sam to get at least thirty five hundred yards and twenty six to twenty seven touchdowns. I mean, a maximum of fifteen interceptions. We can't do no more than fifteen, though. <laughs> Big Cat, you laughing, but Big Cat, how many how many scams was averaging a year? <laughs> Wasn't no fucking fifteen. He was the Big fuck? Cat scam was, averaging, scam was averaging about uh, oh, about thirteen or fourteen INTs a year. So I mean, we gotta right. live with that. So he averaged about thirteen, fourteen, bro. Say again. Chad Zilla already young. Bob, your numbers the last live Leo, so we ain't trusting your fucking numbers. Nobody is. Big Cat, let's see what happens. I mean, I'm not, I'm not pushing for him, but Sam could throw for four thousand easy, easy. I just don't see easily. it. Man. I don't see it, man. I'm, I hope. I mean, I'm I understand. Wrong. I understand. I mean, I, it, it, that's logical, you know, to see how ineffective he was at, at, at the Jets, but you know, he has. An embarrassment of riches on the offensive side of the ball. Yeah, um, yeah. I, I will say that he is loaded, man. I'm, I, I'm not going to take that away from loaded him. Loaded is the understatement. A lot, uh, of, that understatement. Depend on him, though. A lot of that is definitely going to depend on him. Yeah, 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 absolutely. But I think they're going to coach him up. Like, look, just play within the system. You know, take your shots when they're there. Get the ball to the players in space. DJ, he has some, 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 some wiggle with him. You know, Robbie has a little wiggle. Kurt got – I mean, not Kurt um, – McCaffrey got wiggle. Tuba don't really have too much wiggle. He's straight line, dude. Um, Shy got yeah, wiggle. I just, hope, I just hope you don't go back to that. I'm seeing ghosts out there, shit. I mean, but but I mean, that, no, 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 no. You have to deal with that because wasn't that his rookie year? We have to deal with that, and the only reason you know about that is because the shit was on fucking Monday Night Football. Let's not act like. Let's you not act like. You would have if it was a one o'clock game. You let's, watching the game. He ain't had to be prime time. Right. Let's not know. Let's not act like you know. Stop trying to make excuses, perfect. Leo. Shut the let's fuck not up. Act, let's I'm not, not making like, excuses. Not let's not act like that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Making excuses. That's all he been talking about. A bunch of bullshit. That's all he been saying. Just a bunch of bullshit. He came on the air huffing and puffing and shit. Like he was running for his fucking life. Let's <laughs> see what happened. Let's see what happened. We we Sam is a quarterback. We let's see what happened. You know, making so many excuses. So many excuses. We just talked about it earlier. You can't hold him and make no excuses for you. Or you can make him any excuses because sure enough. I, I just said he has no he gonna make some excuses. Okay, but let's see. Okay, no more excuses for Sam. Let's see what happened. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. But I know, I know this though. I know this much though. Um, the boy in Houston only won two more fucking games than he did. I know that though. I know that. I know that though. And, so, and how many yards did he have? God damn! Did, 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 did you I, fucking I win? We already had this conversation before. We already had this did he did he win? Talk about the stats. Did he win? Let's talk about the stats. How many how many how many stats? How much the stats did he have? Did he win? Did he win? Oh, did he did he win? Did he win? 
Did he win? Did he win? <laughs> did he win? Do I, do I need to repeat him to you again? Hey, hey Jameis threw for 5,000 yards. Did he win? Did he win? Did he win? Did he win? Let's go ahead and have this conversation one more time. Did he win, though? It's all about winning. Let's have this conversation one more time. But he only won three, three games. I have a sound on a one. Sound fucking retarded. It's all about winning, but this nigga ain't won shit. And but yeah, but your your excuse for your excuse your excuse for Sam Darnold was he ain't have no no wide receivers. Neither did Sean Watson, but he put up. Yes, he did. Games. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Hold on, big cat. You see how small minded the Negro is? Oh yeah. They say he put up numbers, but he didn't have no wide receivers. <laughs> how you gonna put up numbers with no fucking wide receivers? <laughs> you fucking niggas are stupid. <laughs> it's easy by making people the better around you. But you you can't be that much better if you don't. My, How you gonna be better if you're not fucking yeah. winning? Who the fuck is Aaron Rodgers? Hold on, hold on, hold on. 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 Leo, Leo, then how the hell did Aaron Rodgers did it? Because in your case, Adams ain't shit. So who else is the other star receivers that Green Bay got? Mm. Hey, big cat. Hey, gentlemen. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Shut the, the fuck up, Rodgers. nigga. That's what I'm talking about. You can't tell me that's shit. I'm not answering, big cat. I'm asking your dumb ass. Don't try to go with a big cat. Gentlemen on the line. I'm that, that, that person who that, that, that somebody, somebody's talking. Gentlemen on line. I always got to prove this nigga retardedness. All the type of ways. Gentlemen on the line. Be careful. You don't know, know what he's talking about. Gentlemen on the line. The phone. Gentlemen on the line. Gentlemen on the line. Nigga just be I'm talking. talking to. If I don't. I'm a gentleman on the line. There's a ghost in the building. I don't recognize yeah, your ghosts. mama. I don't yeah, see your him. mama. So, gentlemen, <laughs> Yo, gentlemen, on, that's the ghost gentlemen, the building, man. gentlemen, gentlemen, if, oh, gentlemen, gentlemen, <laughs> if I don't respond to the ghost, just don't, I'm not crazy. Yards he threw for 33 touchdowns. You better say something. You better say, hey, mom. But he, but he didn't have no, but he had no, but he had no, he had no wide receivers, though. He didn't have no wide receivers. You was throwing the ball to. excuse was he didn't have no wide receivers. He did. All the dumb shit you done said tonight. He did, bro. But I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not making no excuse for him, brother. I'm not, I'm not making no excuse. I'm not making no excuse. He's going to be fucked Sam, up the first four games. Sam, Sam got to play better. Sam got to play better. Now, we don't even play nobody. He'll be Sam fucked gotta up. Sam got to play better. Sam got to play better. Sam got to play better. We don't Sean, see. Sean Watson rat ratings for 2020 was 112.4 rating. Did you fucking win? Win! Seven interceptions. Win! 4,823 yards. And he won points. two more fucking games than Sam did. Win and still made it through the what? Pro Bowl. Win. So the Scam made it matter. to the Pro Bowls. You can talk wins and losses, but you say, hey, they have no team. They ain't have no offense. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. He, how he, he, he had no offense? If, if he had no offense, how he threw for fucking four thousand yards, sir? I mean, if, you're not making no sense. sense. Deshaun Watson is a good football so, player. I give him that. He better than Sam. He better than Sam. He better than Sam right and, now. And, so, he so better than Sam right now. Name the wide receiver from Houston. Man, I, I'm going to name him, but if you don't know, then name it's, him. It's, it's, it's... Name him. Sir. Sir. You don't, you, just say you can't. Just say you can't. Sir, I can, but you... It, what you sir, this conversation is beneath me, sir. It's beneath me because I know if you don't fucking know, then... You name, you name for Sam Darnold. Oh, he had Crowder. Man, no, I... I not, look at... Look at who, who, you talking about, who you talking about? You talking about um, Sam or... or, 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 or Oh, I need a massage watch. So I who you talking about? You name one for the Jets, which is Crowder. I need a massage watch. <laughs> who you want me to name? The wide receivers for I need a massage Instagram DM Watson? Deshaun Watson. You said he didn't have, he he had wide receivers, so name them. Mm, sir. So name it for you. Nah, sir. I, it's, it's all good. It's all good. Big cat, big cat, the big cat. The, 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 big, big cat. Yeah. The the linebacker for Houston Cunningham uh -huh. is a really good player. He had over 100 tackles last year. I I know the players on Houston, but but I'm talking down. You I don't go, waste you my go, time. You already named oh, you ain't got to play the brother. Have, when I'm you talking don't even down, know half the players I, on the Panthers. This, he thinks he knows the players on the Houston. The fucking question is beneath me, sir. I know the fucking, but I'm not gonna dignify your your infantile question with a fucking answer. Dummy, you still a dummy. <laughs> you you trying to use big words as an phrase? Nigga ain't trying to use them. I'm, ain't trying to use them. I'm using them. I'm not trying to use them. I'm using them. That was asked of you, Leo. Was who is the wide receiver that you said that Texas Houston Houston Texas had? You can't name. I, them. Just say that. I I know him, sir. But like I said, your question Just is so him. elementary. I won't dignify him. I won't Crowder dignify your fucking. 
I won't dignify your question with an answer because it's beneath me, sir. You can't answer it. That's why. You don't know. Martin, so says you. Says, so, so says you, so, sir. So smart and stupid. So says you. So says you. So but big cat. Stupid. But big cat. Big cat. We have the offensive weapons to excel on the offensive side of the ball. We can pretty much be unstoppable, you know. But it's all down to us, all on the quarterback and his ability to play within the system and be effective. Now, what about Robbie Anderson? I got him down for um, 51 receiving um, receptions and 735 yards. Nah, brother, that's my nah, brother. Robbie gonna get over. He might get a hundred catches, bro. Okay, that, you you short you short change, bro. You short change, Robbie, bro. Okay, now 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 listen. The reason why I did that is because. You do know in the two years that he played with Sam Darnold, he never had over fifty-three receptions, right? I think Sam. I think Sam is an upgrade <laughs> over Teddy, so I'm going a little more. If Teddy got him 90, 90 catches, he, over a he, thousand yards. He didn't hear what you just asked him. Yeah, you didn't. You didn't hear what I just said, bro. <laughs> I heard what you said, Big Cat, but in the offensive scheme, <laughs> what's up? <laughs> he, thousand with ninety some catches. I'm pretty sure that Sam in the same scheme because Sam has more talent than Teddy under the bridge water. I believe that Robbie can get more yards. I ain't gonna say more catches because 90 catches is a lot of fucking catches. So you're saying that you're saying the scheme is gonna make him better. You know what you're saying? He had over 1,000 last year, big cat. Yeah, man. Listen, man. With 90, almost 90 catches. If he didn't have 90 catches. Robbie is effective. Robbie is a Robbie can catch the ball effectively, and he and his run after the catch is premier. Well, so, well, well you're jumping you around here. You, you just said we got to spread the ball around. Now you're saying that he's gonna have a hundred catches. I mean, which one is it, my G? No, it's possible, bro. Like I say, if, that's why I say we got to throw the ball more. That's what I'm saying. All that running the shit, run the ball. You know, how did they have, but, how did they have over a thousand catches last year if they ain't throwing the ball? <laughs> Exactly. Running the ball primarily will not be Tampa Bay. It's not going to be Kansas City. It's not going to be. How, how do they get over a thousand no. yards of people? If they need to throw the ball. Yo, yo, yo. I don't understand. Wait, 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 what's your, what's your we got Twan Don in the line. What's up, Twan? My point is. <laughs> You talking about throwing DJ Ben throwing What the fuck is Bud Carolyn talking about here tonight? Idiot. I didn't, I didn't say that again, sir. Bunch of confusion. Hey, Seven, what the fuck is... What is Bud Carolyn in here talking about tonight? No, no. He ain't making no sense. He ain't making no sense. No, no, no. Y'all niggas just fucking slow. Y'all niggas fucking slow. Nigga, I agree. He said that. Fucking confused and retarded. Oh, I don't, I don't know. I don't this understand. understand. We know you don't. This nigga's name. This nigga's name is not Leo. It's Black Karen. Big Cat. Yes, sir. Big Cat. Like I said, we who the fuck is he in here telling on the net? On on the offensive side of the ball. Oh, we I see. He's still coming from his daddy and shit tonight. So. We have the offensive propensity to dominate. We have the op- we have the opportunity to dominate. Mm-hmm. So an unstoppable offense. Yo, what's good, hey, Tom? Hey, hey, yo, man. Hey, yo, sorry, sorry I'm late, y'all. Big Cat, I'm sorry I'm no, late, bro. It's all good. It's all good, man. We just chilling. Hey, Tom, you, know you must have catch it earlier. Nah, I, I had a, another podcast to do tonight, man. Hey, shout out to Steph for stepping in for a second, bro. I appreciate you coming over there. Come on, yeah. come, come on, fall, man. Oh, we are. Y'all talking about my boy Winston? Shit, we now, I got a bone to pick with uh, 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 that nigga 704. He he about to make a real pimp step back in the game. Now, I'm, I'm trying to stay low. Shh, be catch. Shh. 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 What are you talking about? Okay. Hey, bro, you finna, you finna bring me back. I'm trying to stay away from that shit, man. I'm trying to stay away, bro, but you, you finna bring me back, man. I keep telling you that, bro. We just cooling. We just cooling over yeah, here. Facts, facts. Leo said that the offense needs to go through Sam Darnold and uh, not and Christian doesn't need to be on the. <laughs> go ahead, Leo. Man. Explain that shit again, bro. So I see, I see y'all got BK and BK Junior on here tonight. Big Cat and Black Karen Junior. 
You, you know what I mean, yo? <laughs> Leo. Big cat and black carrot. <laughs> Leo, you there? Oh, my God. Asshole light. I don't think Leo hung up. Yeah, they don't like that. that, that you know that Karen shit. They don't bitches don't like that shit, bro. That's, that's the way. <laughs> they don't like that Karen shit, bro. Fucking hung up, bro. Leo, call back. Dick hand, dick hand, dick hand. I want to tell you something. You know my. Leo, we didn't get a chance to talk about that. What's going on in New Jersey yet, bro? <laughs> Oh, wait. Hey, so, hey, so we kissed Big Cat ass and he's even like, hey, brother, Big Cat. Big oh, my God. Big Cat, you was going to get a question. Big Cat, you know only call it here for you, Big Cat. got the fuck out of here, didn't he? <laughs> hey, they don't like that Karen shit, bro. They don't like that Karen shit. Bro. Oh, shit. You know what I'm calling it. I call it because you, Big Cat. Hey, shout out to DJ Moore, man. That's a, that's, that's a cool brother, 704. I, th I think I'm going to have to go get his helmet, man. That's a cool dog, man. I, I What's up, fellas? Man, who, who, who up in here? Who up in here? Pretty uh, quick in this bitch. Pretty quick. What's up, bro? What it do, though? Yeah, yeah. yeah fuck, no, fuck, hey, where right, What's going on, man? Where at? Uh, I don't know. All right. What the hell, Ray? Ray worked two jobs. Oh, shit. Oh, he's there. Damn. They not, I, I, I was hoping uh, Up was going to call in. I got to ask him some questions. Some... Damn, bro, I feel good today. Hey, Kat, what's going on? What's in the air today, man? You feel good today? Heineken and some Dorito or uh, Tostitos over here. Damn, bro, I feel <laughs> good today, man. How y'all feeling? Another day. It's been great, man. All good, good bro. Yeah. Evidently, Black Karen ain't feeling really good. She got off the phone. Really good. <laughs> Brother Leo, call back in. She got off the phone, bro. She got off the phone. You know you the super. You can't tell your bitch to call back in, man. <laughs> you know you my superstar, brother. Call back in. <laughs> and can't tell your bitch to call back in. <laughs> I can't. I can't hang with niggas. You know? <laughs> call back in, Leo. Goddamn, bro. <laughs> Big cat, I only call back in to talk to you, baby. That's it. I, don't, I can't fuck with these other niggas, man. I don't fuck with niggas. I don't fuck with these niggas. Somebody said a phone company. Oh, I with these niggas. Phone company get more water. These niggas are stupid. They not white. Hey, Brother Leo. <laughs> 704, what's up, man? Hey, you back? You don't like, hey, bro, I'm telling y'all, they don't like that Karen shit, bro. They, they get missing. Leo, make sure you call them. We got to talk about New Jersey, too. I'm not hey, calling back here, Big Cat, until you get them niggas off the line, Big Cat. <laughs> when, you get them, when you get them niggas off the line, I'll call back, baby. <laughs> I'll call back, daddy. What's up, Dan KK? What up, boy? What up, what up, what up? Austin GT, okay. As a matter of fact, y'all there, y'all. I'm pretty sure all y'all watching there on the Chappelle show. I saw my lady this morning. That was that was there. Leo at the end and shit sticking his head in the door, nigga. And then running out that room real quick. <laughs> so so Kyle, what's going let, me, on? let me tell you, this is how you call that, right? Um let me speak to Big Cat. Uh, I is Leo. And, uh, but Big Cat gotta be here on the other line trying to pick him up, bro. You know and and do it, please. You know, um, the trifecta of the situation. Uh, Leo, the call back in that cooking, you, bro. Line, big cat. Leo, call back in that cooking, bro. I don't, I, I, you get all these liberal black niggas off the line, I'll call back. Call back in, bro. They're cooking your ass, bro. Baking potato your ass, bro. I can't deal with that nigga calling me no damn Karen. I can't deal with that, sir. <laughs> that nigga ain't gonna call me no Karen. Hey man, shout out to Young Nels for the cash app, man. <laughs> he said, "Keep your." He said, "For keeping on that bitch ass black cat." <laughs> it, 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 it doesn't offend you. Your 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 papa. Oh shit! Who uh, this is? Hey hey hey, big cat. Yes, hey yeah, keep bringing Leo. On. We we make money off his ass. No no, too. shout out to Leo, man. He's up. That's my brother, man. We gotta talk about Fourth yeah, of July. We, make, we making money off his ass too. Hold on, let me see who sent this cash up here. <laughs> Happy 4th of July, everybody. Shout out to Kendall Francis. Yes, sir. I got you. Yes, sir. Shout out to Yannels. Leo, Leo is like, is like Sammy the Clown on uh, Apollo. Yeah, he just come in yes, to get him off the stage. Yeah. Kendall, I got you for the, uh, the Fantasy Football League. 
I can't tell. I look, uh, man. I can't talk to these niggas, big cat. I got you, Kim. <laughs> Bro, y'all cold, man. <laughs> Call back in, Leo. You gotta get, you gotta get little Nas X on here, or something. I can't talk oh, to these niggas. Oh hell no. Nah. No, I don't, I don't, I don't like the the, the, uh, the homosexual the calling me, and you know that's why I don't, don't go out in Atlanta things. because you know too much homosexuality in Atlanta, so I don't go out. I just stay inside. And, I work at the no, and I walk the Tell him his boyfriend right now. And like, all this money I done made, big cat. And this nigga let these niggas on the line. <laughs> so he's just a white he, he, he just a white liberal. That's all. That's fine. He's, he's just, just another liberal. nigga. I just, I, I knew I couldn't trust big cat. He a nigga. I ain't calling back in. Fuck that nigga. Call back in, Leo. <laughs> Fuck you, big cat. <laughs> Indubably. <laughs> Respectfully, nigga. Got to run my way, man. Shit. Yeah, man. Hello, man. Make sure y'all check out Nigga Scare Sports, man. You know what I'm saying? Me, uh, the boy seven, uh, Aaron, the man, Ray Pat Bone, bro. You know what I'm saying? We're going to be live sometime this week, man. Also, check out Never Scared Podcast. We did another show tonight, man. It was a banger. We went live for the first time. We, the show was called fucking... Um, men, why men shouldn't pay child support? So obviously, you know, a lot of women got into that shit and they got fucking raw. <laughs> oh man, I know it. Did. Go check that shit out. <laughs> Never scared podcast. Subscribe, then go check it out, man. That's a tough subject right there. Bro, wait, look, that shit was wild, bro. That shit got wild. <laughs> hey, tomorrow, how you feel about Gino coming to the uh, Carolina Panthers? Gino, who? Go dogs, nigga. Uh, Atkins. No, you ain't gotta say Action. that nigga say go dogs. You ain't gotta say this name, last name. Coming where? All you gotta do is say fucking go dogs. Matter of fact, matter of fact, everybody on this goddamn line say go dogs right now. So what does that mean? Like something just said. The motherfuckers ain't want our shit in forever. Say go, go, say go dogs or hang up on everybody. You gotta say straight dogs. <laughs> the dirty ass puppies. Go fucking dogs, nigga. Beat the shit out of Clemson. I can't. You know it's gonna be beautiful to see my dogs go to Bank of America, my my beautiful, beautiful second home, Mecklenburg County, Bank of America hey. Stadium, and whoop they motherfucking ass. That's gonna be fucking beautiful. Hey, college football is gonna be wild this year, bro. Yeah, man, that's just gonna be light. Mm. Beat the fuck out of Clemson. Anybody, anybody on the line that play against some fucking ragged ass Georgia Bulldogs is it? <laughs> Everybody, you can catch catch, everybody, everybody bulldog again, bulldog. never scared podcast. You can catch me at 704. We're gonna be going at it. I'm gonna be talking about them shitty ass Sun Hills. He's gonna come out to my fucking Seminoles game week. It's gonna be a fight on that motherfucker. <laughs> you know, that nigga gonna be dressed out to the socks in that Sun Hills shit, too. Tyree, oh no, seven. We're gonna be at that game. Shit, we ain't Aaron. Shit. <laughs> Besides, Brian Burns, Brian Burns, who you think is gonna be uh, a potential uh, upcoming uh, name on the defensive line? Besides uh, Brian, Brian Burns, bro. Um, like uh, the guy I like, man, is um, um, what's his name? Davion. You know, Davion. Davion. Uh, yeah, the, the kid from Davion. Iowa. Yeah. Oh yeah, from Roy. Yeah, really? Kid from Iowa. I got, I got big. I, I got a feeling about him. Obviously, we, we got to see him play first. You know what I'm saying? I got a feeling about this kid. You know, um, I'm hearing good things about him out of camp. Um, um, shit. Um, what's the big boy next song? Shit. Get my own fucking play, man. Um, Derek. Derek talks big, uh, big with him right. too, man. He said they got good energy with each other, bro. Who? Derek Brown. Derek, oh, yeah. Derek yeah. Brown? Yeah, I said yeah. he was going to be pretty They'll good. They'll be right next to each other. You know what I'm saying? He said he got good energy. So, you know, when he said that, you know, I don't like to read nothing into it, but I don't, maybe, you know, maybe he, he won't fill in the dude that was next to him last year. Shit. What's the, uh, what's the other dude we picked up? I think he played for Alabama. I think his last thing was Man, we got, we got a lot of studs on the line, though, when you really think at it, though, bro. I'm telling you. We got a lot of studs down there. Man, I think, 
I think we got a position to be a, a damn top ten, top five defense in here. For real. But I don't know. They kept, uh, when Leo was on the line, they was talking. I was going to ask him, they kept that. About what? If, if, if we only got one guy that's for sure that on defense that's going to do something in, in Brian Burns, then how, go, how are we going to be a top, even a top 10 defense? Well, Fox. Man, ain't about I think, I think, I think by the end of the year next year, we'll definitely be top motherfucking 10, bro. Without a doubt. The defense is going to be hard, bro. J- Jermaine Carter was on the uh, he did an interview today on on this, on the sports channel. Mm. I think yeah. this defense can be reminiscent of that 2015 defense. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This yes, going to be uh, as well too. You remember a lot of those dudes. That defense too. Shit. You remember the, the defenses they came into their own that that them years, bro. He's gonna be on the microscope. You know, 2015, Kawhi Short, man, that motherfucker lived in the backfield, bro. I mean, he was sucking everybody. Was it? What? Any supposed to be trying to come back? Nah, we can. We don't need KK anymore, man. <laughs> Fuck that. He was trying to come back, though. He was trying to come back. KK hurt, man. No more hurt glass. <laughs> Didn't, didn't they say he was trying to come back? I don't feel like they said they were flirt with the back? idea. They ain't gonna be that motherfucker. Y'all idea. seen Big Cat? Y'all seen Big Cat talking shit about Cam Newton out here in these motherfucking <laughs> these median streets? <laughs> my brother Leo right here. So I see dog. Man, what's going on, man? Another day, man. You ready to be merged in? Yeah, man. All right, bro. What's up, C dog? How you living, bro? Everything good, man. Good, good. The dog. Huh? Hey, real quick, man, Leo Tom, Leo Tom, uh, hold on, man, Leo, man. That's, that's Black Karen, bro. That's Black Karen. Hold on, man. Sam Donald had Le'Veon Bell, Robbie Anderson, and Jameson Crowder. It didn't do nothing. He said he only had one wide receiver, which is Crowder. No, he had Crowder, Robbie Anderson, and Le'Veon Bell. We ain't got that new deal. <laughs> it didn't do anything. That nigga lost. Mind you. Yeah, he gone. He gone. Yeah, of course, he hung up. Why he leave? Don't leave with a dog, man. It's, well, it's facts. facts. Well, get his ass back on the line, man. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Leo, call <laughs> back, brother. <laughs> Tell your bitch to call back. Keep it small. Motherfucker, you don't leave until we say you leave, nigga. You <laughs> must have. Nah, hey, oh, come on, hey, hey, try not to call the black hair, man. He left. He know, man, man, hold on. <laughs> Do you know what this motherfucker talking about Lamar Jackson? Ne- never forget, Lamar Jackson was the last pick of the same draft that Sam Donald got drafted number goddamn three. And he got a motherfucking MVP. What the fuck Leo talking about? Nothing. He, he, he only made plays with fuck. his legs, uh, C-Dog. He said what? He only made, he only made plays with his legs, C-Dog. I don't matter. He's still better than Sam Donald, and he got a fucking MVP. Hey. Exactly. Whatever makes you, whatever helps you win. Am I the right? Fuck? Wrong? You know what? I'll tell you what we don't gotta worry about. We ain't never ever gotta worry about Sam Donald winning a motherfucking MVP. <laughs> Man, who, who, who the fuck wanna bet on that? Hey, the we fuck? Do, do, do talking about goddamn Lamar Jackson. What the fuck? Oh, Leo said, give him a second. Yes, sir. Come on, Leo. Hey, look, man. Get his bitch ass back in here. We're going on Twan, dog. We're going on uh, Big <laughs> Cat, everybody on the goddamn phone line right now, man. Hey, Big Cat, we need, a, we, need a, we need to do a show about the top five most slept on motherfuckers on the team, bro. No doubt, we did no that show yet? Yeah. Well, hold on. Let me ask you a question. So, Leo, you, you mean to tell me only MVPs win championships, right? Most of the time, shit. <laughs> I mean, uh, look, 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 we should have won the motherfucker. We should have won the motherfucking Super Bowl now. You know what I'm saying? If we had a better motherfucker, got there, it don't even would have got them had motherfucker out there blocking. The fuck? O line, O line with the man, sweep. Man, come on, man. Oh, yeah. Are you serious? Oh, yeah. Come on, man. See, dog. See, dog. This is the thing, dog. That game was for, was a narrated game for, uh, Denver took them niggas' soul. He took their heart in that game, bro. Look, man, you can't. No, listen to me. You cannot have goddamn. You cannot goddamn. Uh, 
block, goddamn block motherfucker, uh, Von Miller with one motherfucker. You gotta got them tips somebody out here. It gives a motherfucking hell. That's that's common fucking sense. Mm. Mm. But think about it, see, dog. One hundred percent of the calls, and I'm not exaggerating, was on Carolina Panthers. That was a narrated game, bro. The game was already against us. Still, man, you gotta got them put, give them both some fucking help out there. You can't let well, Von shit, Miller go crazy like that. But the offensive line was still yeah, shitty, bro. We saw that shit. No more food. That's why you got them put. You why you run a fucking twelve personnel. You can't run the same shit you've been running all goddamn year. When I said that last last podcast as well, too. Yeah, the fuck? They can't you can't. They can not stop Von Miller to say they like in that game. Cause he got one motherfucker blocking on Twine. That's why. That's dumb as fuck. He looked unreal in that game, bro. I'm like, what the fuck, man? You ain't played like this all year. <laughs> Shout out to all because they weren't exposed. Shout out to all because they weren't exposed. You could have got that October and motherfucker got that store in the backfield for extra blocking, whatever the fuck you got to do. Man, don't let this motherfucker just run ram shock all over your goddamn offensive line all goddamn game. And that, that killed us. Our defense actually played a better game than us, but them fumbles fucked us up. If you go back and look at the stats, the defense kept that game respectable. Shout out to Sula for that 2015 season. Super Bowl. I ain't gonna even lie, bro. I knew the Broncos was gonna win that damn game. The first chance they signed for me, they had both damn end zone tainted Broncos. I was like, yep, ain't nothing to win this shit. You get out of here. Oh, you said it did what? <laughs> no. Wasn't both of them was a painted Broncos. Yeah, what are you talking about? Yes, it was. Yes, no, it was. definitely remember our side, bro. No. Yeah, no. We got to no. have the side of the Broncos side, dog. Leo, call in and tell us why we lost. No, I'm saying, <laughs> bro, <laughs> they erased it. They erased it, bro. I'm telling you. They erased it? Nah, they erased bro. Oh. I, watched that, I watched that damn... Look, I should be watching that shit. Like, we definitely got a Panthers painted in. We had the end zone. Time time. We had a black end zone, dog. A black and orange red zone. T-Dog made a valid point. That was a, he made a valid point. That was all Mike Shula. It's Mike Shula, man. Come on, man! You can run that. Look, man, you gotta got. You can't look. You cannot block this n- nigga with one goddamn offensive line, man. This is, that's dumb as fuck. You gotta chip his ass. F- do something. What the fuck? Like you right. playing, got man. You can't. That's dumb ass shit, man. Again, man. Look, have y'all been? Yeah, have y'all been looked at it like this? And this just throwing some conspiracy shit in it. It seemed like it seemed like we had to play the two fucking worst quarterbacks you can play in a damn Super Bowl. That was fucking Tom Brady and fucking your boy, um, motherfucking, was Manning on his way out. No, Don Casey cost us that last goddamn Super Bowl with chicken that damn ball that got them bounce. We should have won that shit. I know. I mean, shit, but. Don't you know, get me started Brady, on that shit. But Brady, hey, but Brady, look, but they, but they, but throughout that damn game, they was giving Brady a lot of shit. That game really shouldn't even been close. That 2003 game shouldn't even been fucking close. Right, and then again, John Casey kicked the ball out of bounds. That's what I'm saying. I mean, shit. I mean, when you keep it close like that, all it takes is one fuck up. Yeah, I don't want fuck up when he keep the ball out of bounds. It ain't, it ain't like Brady. It ain't like Brady won the game. They motherfucking field goal kick and punch that shit in. But see that? Right. Adam like, Vinatieri. I wanted to they kill that motherfucker that night, bro. I they go back to big shit, bro, man. <laughs> <laughs> that two, that I told, I told seven that 2015, I had them Super Bowl party miles. When I saw that we was gonna lose, I came out my bedroom door and said, "Get the fuck out!" <laughs> Everybody had to go. <laughs> that goes back to what uh, Big Cat. Yeah, I went on. back and laid in my bed in the fetal position, and then I might have been that bitch two days. I didn't even go to work the next day. Fuck that. Man, I was hurt. I, I was fucking hurt. I cried in the car. Bro, who, man, who you telling, bro? Who you telling? <laughs> Nigga, I was I hurt, bro. I ain't want nobody to look fuck, bro. I was hurt. But look, let me say this, man. Everybody keep talking about this offense. If Joe Brady don't learn how to use the motherfucking tight ends, we're not going to go far. We're not going We're not going to be in the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? You got to use the fucking tight end in the fucking NFL. Hey, brother. Hey, what's up? I ain't gonna hold you long. I'm about to shut these niggas up real quick. Please, please, tighten these niggas down. Let me let you in here. We had Greg Olsen and Ian Thomas. We were streaming for two tight ends. Mm-hmm. They, when they finally, they finally season started, they didn't do none of that. And that white boy, that white boy we got. 
The tall white uh, kid, man. He nice. Yeah. What are we talking about? That tall white kid that, that, we, that we got from um, the Cardinals. Yeah, the Cardinals. Big, big, look, big, man. Uh, Hey, we got a lot of tight ends now, bro. Yeah, bro. Look, man, if they're, look, if they're honorable that dude, they would have kept him in Arizona. Same thing with Riddick. Everybody keep talking about Riddick, this, Riddick, that. He's a fucking linebacker. He's 6'1". Hey, the dude, Arnold, he's, not, yeah. he's not a defensive end. Hold on, let me finish. The thing with the dude, Arnold, he gets open, man. The thing is, he just like to fucking fall when he catches the ball. Brother Leo, tie these niggas open. up, bro. Tie these niggas up, Brother Leo. <laughs> they asked why Carolina lost the game. Yeah. You know why? You know why Cam got mad? I told y'all to drop that subject. Y'all niggas want to keep bringing up old shit. Hey, big cat, big cat. Man, fuck this. Real, real, real bitch. quick. This telling ass, black Karen ass. Big cat, I got the facts, though. Here go the facts. Yeah, get the facts. You know man. why I can't? You remember at the podium? You ain't got no facts, nigga. Big cat, big cat. I'm, I'm, can I speak real quick? Nigga, that's one thing you don't know about. Can I speak real quick, gentlemen? Go ahead. Can I speak? At the podium. No. Go ahead, bitch. No, you can't speak, nigga. No, you can't. At the, at the podium. <laughs> Told you I was about asking permission to speak. No, you can't. Hold on, man. Look, man, I don't at want the man podium. really say anything about Cam, man, because okay. Sam Donald not even fucking Cam Newton. Nigga. Oh, you know, you know that's talking about. about. You know, he, you know that's him. Let him finish. Let him finish. Y'all ain't talking about Bill Cosby and none of that shit with this nigga tonight. No, it's coming up please, later. Please, 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 real quick. No, let him, let him finish. Let him finish. So you, you tear I'm going to see you. Go ahead, your turn. Fuck me, yo. At the podium. <laughs> he ain't about to say nothing special. Big Cat, real quick, gentlemen. And all of us want to listen. At no, we don't want to listen. No, that's the point. Shut the fuck up. At the podium, when Cam was quiet and he was upset, you know you know why he was upset, gentlemen? Why? Because he lost the game. Big Cat, Big Cat. No, 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 no. Big Cat. Yes, sir. When he, Big Cat, this is the facts. You can look it up. Nigga, stop saying his fucking name, you bitch. Big Cat, listen to you, Big Cat. You can look, Big Cat, you can look this up now. At the podium... Damn, Mr. Big Cat, they won't let me tell the truth. They won't let me speak it, though. They won't let me say it. Tell the truth, brother. Cat ain't no it, fucking truth, nigga. It's your fucking opinion, nigga. Can, can hurry up it. with that bullshit. This, this is the absolute That's truth. Fine. You can look it up. You can look it up. At the podium, when they were interviewing him, he was quiet and potty mouth. You know why? Why? Because Chris Harris was on the other side talking about Cam. Guess what he said? Guess what Chris Harris said that made Cam walk what, off the what, fucking what stadium? Say? What did he say, brother? Chris Harris said... Load the box, force y'all to throw the ball. Can you throw the football? That was the game plan. That was Chris Harris said. Big cat. Yeah, that's look at, that's look laughing. Chris Harris. <laughs> nigga, he ain't even had no time to throw the fucking ball. Nigga, what the fuck right. is you talking about? Because he wants to double team the Bob Miller ass. What the fuck is you talking what about? He was in this man's face all night. So <laughs> fuck. Big cat. Yeah, I remember Big that. I remember that. I seen that interview. They ain't in the tip his ass. They ain't double team got that Von Miller. What the Big fuck cat. you talking about? Big cat. Can, Big cat, can you validate what I just said? Yes, sir. I can. I can. Okay then. So that's it. No, no more of that. No more of that, gentlemen. So Leo, no just tell me this, Leo. Tell, no hold on, Leo. Leo, no tell me that. this. Man, is Sam Donald ever going to have a forty touchdown season like Cam Newton? Is he ever going to win a motherfucking MVP? He can't. You know what Robert? Nobody can't do. He can't win rookie of the year. Mm. He can't be top one hundred by his fucking peers. This is what Chris Harris said. Low now you keep talking about what Chris Harris said. Chris nigga, ask my question, nigga. Chris Harris said, "Force y'all to throw the ball." Can you throw the football? That was the game plan. That's what Chris Harris said. That's why Scam got mad because he was listening to Chris Harris say that about his bomb ass. <laughs> he's not. He's, he, he couldn't throw the football. Hold on. Denver said. Force hold on, man. Hold on, man. Kim Newton never goes at the press conference talking about he's seen fucking ghosts on the field, nigga. What the big fuck cat. is you talking about? Big yeah. cat. Hey. What I'm big cat. What I said a lot. Stop calling no, goddamn no. big cat like you got to step that in, nigga. The fuck. Big cat. Big cat. No, I ain't no lie. I ain't no lie, bro. The fuck okay. is what I said a lot. No, it's the truth. Yeah, man, that nigga goes there like they fuck it. Hey, hey. So, no, hold on, Leo, Leo. At any point in the Super Bowl, did did Von Miller get double team at all? If we had a better quarterback, we would have won. If it happened, I didn't see it. If we had a better quarterback, we'd have won easily. Nigga, shut the fuck. Nigga, get the fuck out of here. Easily. Get the fuck easily. out of here. Easily. Man, big cat. Why you and nigga call in with this bullshit? Freedom of speech, my brother. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about dumbass shit. <laughs> nigga talking about Ken Newton like got them shit like like like, like, like some other would ever be here. Nigga, Ken Newton already got shit at the Hall of Fame, nigga. Big cat, did the nigga do the Sam Donald got anything at the Hall of Fame right now? Big cat, did I tell a lie? No did I tell a lie? Yeah, nigga. No lie, Big cat, brother. did I tell a lie? It wasn't a lie. Keep calling your stepdaddy, nigga. That's what you got there, <laughs> Black Karen. Black Karen. 
I didn't tell them. So we're going to act like we didn't see any offense. We didn't and see and Big Cat is the cops. <laughs> Black Karen. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't tell no lie, gentlemen. No nigga, they ain't never seen Von Miller none the fucking game, nigga. You talking about what the fuck got them Cam did? Then, nigga, his leader, his leader receiver was Terry Ginn, nigga. He had a number one offense in the league with Terry Ginn leading the league and drop balls, nigga. Talk about that, nigga. Load, and for the Load. Brown. And for the Brown. Load the fuck. And Philly and Brown. This, the fuck. Load the fuck out of here. Then this bitch nigga went to fucking New Orleans and learned how to catch. Nigga, they were double teaming goddamn Greg Olsen all goddamn gang. Nigga, talk about that. Nigga, that was the best fucking receiver. Let's talk, let's talk about that. Nigga, Terry Ginn would have had 2,000 yards receiving if he thought the fucking boss of goddamn much. Load the box. That was, that was good. Yeah, nigga. They didn't get back. Load the box, force your bum ass quarterback to throw the ball. Khalid, Khalid. So, nigga, who, who, who the fuck we got our quarterback down there, nigga? You talking Load. about, who the fuck we got down there, nigga? Load the box. Who the, the fuck box. we got now, nigga? So, you talking about goddamn Cam, nigga? A motherfucking Load. MVP, nigga? Load the who the box. fuck we got now? Load the box. Yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, nigga. Shut the fuck Load up, the nigga. Box. Load the box. Shut the fuck up, nigga. Load the box. I'm sorry, dog. I didn't hear you. What did you say? He's an MVP. What? An MVP. Load the box, Thank force, force it down. This is on his name, man. nigga. This nigga, <laughs> this nigga is persistent. Like, he'll keep going and keep going and keep going until he say what he got to say. Lamar Jackson, does he know what? Lamar Jackson. Jackson was the last pick of the fucking draft, nigga. Sandano was number three. He already this got an MVP. Said, this, nigga said, load, this nigga said load the box 30 times. <laughs> load the box, force a stupid-ass quarterback to throw the ball. He can't throw the ball. He he just load the box shit, man. <laughs> Load the box, force your stupid ass quarterback who can't throw the fucking ball to throw the ball. See what happens. What the fuck is Sam Nolan got them doing there, nigga? He's saying go from the goddamn field. I'll yeah. tell you Load what, I'll tell you, I'll tell you right now, nigga. It's an off, it's off of the line, got them to shake out. Man, I'll keep that same energy, nigga. But Sam Nolan got them, I'll only got them back all got them, you nigga. Look at it, it's seeing ghosts all got them, you again, nigga. Since you're gonna talk about Cam, nigga. Load the box. No, I'm gonna tell you how we could have won, see, though. Load, Load the, box. the box and let this black hair. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> Den- Denver knew our quarterback was the liability on the offensive side of the ball. Load the box, force the stupid ass quarterback hey, to make the defense. I he say, didn't do it. We I, him I say again, I say again, how can Black Karen be a Panthers fan when he never has anything good to say about the fucking team, bro? No, the team My, is good. He, he, he wanted us to lose. This nigga, this nigga <laughs> hates the people that play for the team. Because uh, he don't like the motherfuckers that play for the team. He don't, yeah. he, look, and his claim to fame is like his Sam Darnold. Big Cat, you there, brother? Fuck out of here. So what's up? And Sam Darnold was so good, why the fuck he get traded? I'm here, brother. Big if he's so goddamn good, why he get traded, motherfucker? If he's so he goddamn good. Because he didn't load the box. And he was... <laughs> 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 was <laughs> brother said, said, load the box up on Sam Darnold, he'll see goddamn ghosts, nigga. Okay. Because everybody... Yeah, because everybody in love... They loaded the box on his ass, and they sent his ass to Carolina. Real quick, real quick. Lou, Lou, the best player on the team at the time, they held Denver to 147 total yards. 147. Big Cat, you heard me? Big Cat, you heard what I said? Yeah, 147 crazy. total, but scam the ignorant-ass stupid dancing bear can't be the fucking <laughs> defense quarterback. Couldn't what? even win the fucking game. What'd you call him? The ignorant dancing bear can't read a fucking defense. I think I think he was the MVP that year, but I'm maybe it's just big me. cat, big cat, yeah. Luke Luke Luke. Help. big cat. I, yeah, what's up? I think this maybe I think this maybe he won the same year you call him a dumbass dancing bear was the year he won MVP. Big cat. amongst his peers, yeah. big cat. Luke Kigley doesn't have an MVP, sir. He got defensive yeah. player of the year. His Sorry. second fucking year. His second year. His second year. Fuck Does he have an MVP, sir? He got a second. He got he got defensive player of the year. Does he have an MVP, sir? That's Best player in the him. league. Best player in the league. That's the offensive player of the year, a defensive player of the year, and then there's the MVP, the best player in the league. Big cat. Now, Luke? Leo, Leo, I never understood. What do you mean by dancing bear? What what the fuck does that mean? Oh, that, Man, he been watching too many. Look, see, a real nigga will tell you to dance to me. He watched flicks with a bunch of niggas running around with their dicks, spinning another nigga's dick's mouse with a bear head on it or some shit. Big cat, big cat, big cat. All, 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 can, all scam was good for was running around dancing and showing people. Love. That's oh, okay. all he was good for. He was a hard quarterback. Big cat, you ain't seen them dancing bear videos, man. No. So, hold on, what the fuck is Sam Nolan good for? Throwing interceptions? Have the same thing he did at fucking college? Big Cat. Yeah. yeah. The best player on the team was Luke Keekley by far. He Boy, served stop. it up. He served it up for Boy, Sam Newman. 
but he's so now, stupid. Did, Boy, what did Lou Pinky do in the Super Bowl? <laughs> the stupid dancing bear couldn't even. What did Lou what did, what did Pinky do in the Super Bowl, though? Stupid ass Cam couldn't it be old right. ass hurt neck Peyton Manning. Per- Peyton Manning was he he was benched to shit. <laughs> and he came in the Super Bowl. He was a fucking in that quarterback. His neck was fucking hurt. He was on his way out. Didn't he retire after that big cat? Yeah, he retired after that shit. He was fucking. He, the, he was a shell of himself. But stupid ass Cam, I can't read the fucking defense. Mm. Couldn't even do nothing. Load the box. So the de- so Cam can't read the defense. You remember that game we played the Packers? And Clay Matthews said he, 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 he knew what, what, what he was doing. He knows he know how to read the defense. Yeah, get the fuck out of here, man. Big cat. Get big the cat. fuck out of here, man. Big cat. Big cat. You there, brother? Yeah, I'm here, brother. You been watching the film. Big cat. Big cat. Big cat. Big cat. Yeah. They, they Tell him again, cat. man. Watch big this, nigga. Big cat. You know what they talking about? You remember that? Big cat. 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 You remember that play? What play? Big cat. Baby. Big cat. It should be saying step daddy. Step daddy. Step daddy. Big cat. Big cat. Big cat. Everybody said, man. Everybody said with him. Big cat. Big cat. Big cat, big cat, big cat, talk to him, big cat. You know what, he really wants to suck big cat dick. He don't want to say that. Big cat, I already said that. Oh, faggot ass, oh, faggot ass nigga. That nigga wants to suck big cat dick, nigga. Get the fuck out of the old fucking faggot ass nigga. What's up, brother? Big cat, you still there, brother? You still there? Big cat don't even want to answer that shit sometimes. I'm here, brother. This is the same motherfucker who's been out there going to call him the motherfucker show no more. That nigga don't like that, nigga. Stop my name like that, nigga. Fuck out of here, nigga. Yeah, the yeah, 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 the Green Bay Packers play. Tell me about it. You know that play they're talking about? Yeah, tell me BK, about it. BK, BK, BK. They, BK. Used, they, they used that as an example of Cam reading the defense, but the play was already called, so he wasn't reading shit. He told him the play was already dummy. fucking called. The play, no, 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 no. The play was already called for a stupid ass. He already he called already, it, dummy. No, he already knew the fucking play. Man, what this guy's so doing? Like, what, what, what this guy's doing? What this guy's doing? What this guy's doing? He's a fucking topic. idiot. I'm glad he's not on the fucking team. <laughs> nigga, I always want to come on converse and talk about something that happened four or five years ago. Yeah. So, so you tell me, so, so can some down and read the defense then, sir? He was <laughs> seeing ghosts on the field. Fuck Cam and all his fans. Hey, look, man, I want to, I want to say, hey, look, I want to say a shout out to my boy in the chat, man. Y'all was saying, hey, man, shout out to Darren Kincaid, man. Hey, who's this? Call from? Zilla. What's up, Zilla? Uh oh. <laughs> hey, let me let you up in here, man. I guess. Well, fuck you. Now, now mind, mind you, Leo is off of the band. Yeah. Mind you, Leo is off of the band. Hey, look, nigga. I, I know it's fuck me, nigga. But we don't. But nobody likes a Karen. <laughs> See, you a black one. What's that nigga in the play, Leo? <laughs> nah, he's, he, he's not working, man. He's not working. He's talking about the same shit. He ain't got nothing, he ain't got nothing you know, reasonable to say. Sounds familiar. We got Chad he's Zilla talking. up in here. What's up, Chad? Talk the same What's story. up, fellas? Another day. I'm scared, Chad Zilla. Another, Look on, Jazz. Zilla. Another fucking day, Jesus. Zilla. I can't call it. I can't call it. Load the box. Force y'all to throw the ball. That nigga said yeah, Sam Donald should do re-option. But Cam did re-option, too. Obviously, he don't know what he be talking about. This nigga ain't never loaded a box, stuck his dick in no box, or nothing ever in his life. <laughs> hey, did that yeah, yeah, I'm here, man. brother. Why does he keep talking about male didn't tell y'all? I'm about. not sure, man. You, you can ask him, though. I, 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 no, 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 no. No, thank you. No, thank you. I, 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 no, thank you. No, thank you. The first thing that comes out of his mouth is Jim Miller, Jim Miller, Taylor, so no, thank you, bro. I'm good. Okay. Okay. No, okay, you. Karen. Okay, Karen. Let's go there. Let's go there. I was waiting for you to say that. I just want to know. I was waiting for you to say that. I was waiting for you to say that. Why do you continue? Now, hey, Leo. Hey, not, hey, 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 no, 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 no. I, I got him on this one. No, no, no. I, wanted, I was waiting for him to say that shit. No, nah, I got him. So, my, you hear my voice? I sound like a man. I don't say, hey, big cat, big cat. Big cat every five <laughs> seconds. Nigga, you sound like the faggot. Not me, bro. Mm. But who but you, you talk, but you keep bringing up male genitalia. I have what I have you yet to hear you talk. So about. what? Nigga, you don't bring up male genitalia. It's things in your eyes, nigga. You gay on top of that. I've been telling motherfuckers you was gay. This nigga is in the closet. I have yet to You keep trying to convince yourself every fuck. Hey look, man. Don't no straight man go. Big cat. Big cat. Okay, have, you did a big cat. You did a big cat in a feminine ass voice, man. I have yet to hear you talk about a vagina one time. Mm. Nigga, I talk about pussy all the time, bro. You're a liar. You're a liar. We just you're don't want to piss. We look. We just don't want to piss you off by talking about it. You're a liar, sir. You're an absolute liar. Okay, watch this right here, Leo. How much pussy do you get? 
You're a liar. That would be a redundant question because you fuck dudes. I get just as much as you say the word penis. Nah, nigga. No, you don't. You don't. Just because the nigga put on a wig and say his name is fucking Felicia, don't mean he's really fucking Felicia. Sir, I don't know. ass nigga. And you told us you live in the gayest part of fucking Atlanta. But if you don't like them motherfuckers, why are you living there? I don't want to hear about penis all day, sir. You can't even get a white get a white girl off of your ass, nigga. I don't get the fuck out of here, nigga. I don't white women out here saying they wouldn't fuck with you. <laughs> I don't want to hear about. He penis. talking about stop talking about penis, but he can't get off big cat's dick. There you go again. There you go again. Yeah. He can't help himself. <laughs> hey, nigga, that's that's you. You you telling your card. <laughs> I don't call this motherfucker's hey. name all damn day like I'm trying to borrow money from his ass or go buy a Gucci purse or some shit. <laughs> hey, hold on, Twan. Hold on, Twan. Hey, Leo, how many interceptions was Sun on the throw this year? Hey, Big Cat, every time he said the word penis. Oh, hey, my God. You know, you ain't his, you know, his bitch, so he can't. Big Cat, every time, he, he, every, every time he mentioned a male penis, I'll send you some money, brother. Okay. Nigga, you talk, nigga, okay. I'm talking okay. football, nigga. How many interceptions are going to send on the throw this season? Hey, big cat, I'll do it all night. Now you're going to have to give me half, nigga. <laughs> nah, I got to do the half. I don't do half. I'll do it all night. <laughs> Run it up, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> big juicy dick. Yeah. <laughs> big balls. Big balls and dicks. <laughs> Now send him his money and Big Cat just send me half, bro. <laughs> Leo, how many interceptions will send Donald Trump this season? Big balls and dicks to the wall. <laughs> so all the dicks fall. Hold on, Twy. Hold on, Twy. Let him ask my question, Twy. How many interceptions will send Donald throw this year? About the same as Cam did. What Cam Newton got to do with Sam Donald to throw an interception, sir? C Dog, he said 15. C Dog, he said 15. About the same as Cam. He said 15. <laughs> I think he called Cam. He called Cam Scam Newton. So what's Sam Donald's name? So is he Scam too? Sam, the great, Sam the, the Scam? The Great White Hope. Mm, like the Great White Hope who got traded? Like Are that. you for real? I like that name, Leo. Who, who <laughs> couldn't even keep his fucking job in New York with a new fucking regime and a new coach? Yes, sir. The great white hole, baby. And why they, 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 they keep him in? Why, why, why New York can't keep his bum ass in? You ready to get paid? You ready to get paid, Victor? Huh? You ready to get paid? Yeah, go ahead. So let me ask my, my question, Twan. Why New York can't keep his bum Big ass in? He's a great white hope. Hey, nigga, big cocks and socks. <laughs> <laughs> big dicks and tricks. <laughs> uh, <laughs> nigga, this nigga seeing ghosts on the field. He talking about Cam Newton. Penis, penis, penis poppers. Why did Brett Favre get traded? Yeah, he ain't seen you that money yet, did he? Nah, nigga, Brett, Brett Favre ain't getting traded yet. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He hold wasn't on. 23. Brett Favre wasn't 23 when he got traded. So that was a mm -hmm. dumb comparison. Why, Why did the, the, the number three pick in the draft get traded, sir? And they got a new regime and a new coach. If he's so Brett fucking Farr good. Traded, why did Brett Favre get traded from the Falcons? Hey, man, the only person trash. we trust around, the only stats we trust around here is 704s. Yo, stats is fucking trash. I'm going to stay off the stats of Leo life. I make Karen life. Now, Leo, when yeah. you... Why D I, hold on. Why did Deion Sanders lead the goddamn Falcons, nigga? They were sorry, Black motherfucker. Black Karen ain't never read a stat in his life. He's just all opinionated. Did he say that they only had 160, 65 yards in the Super Bowl? 147. He said, he said dick, dicks, and huh? ricks. He said a lot of backwards dumb shit tonight. He oh, said yeah, if you need to have a pass look offense, you need, to, you need to throw the Leo. ball 20 times. Leo, look it up. That's incorrect, sir. So I wonder if how, how many yards they had. Patrick how many Mahomes is, is, is averaging 20 throws a game. How many yards they had in the Super Bowl? Eight men had 141 yards, sir, passing yards. He's gonna tell you gotta look it up. Hey, Chad, he's gonna tell you he gotta look it up before it's true. I mean, what? Leo, you ain't lying, are you, Leo? No, how many total yards did Denver have? 230 something. Now you just switching it up. Okay, pardon me, I was mistaken. He, um, the quarterback had 141. You always mistaken, nigga. You always got them screwing Bill shit, nigga. But we should trust his numbers. Hey, look here. Load the box, force y'all to throw the ball, 
Can you throw the football? That's what, that's what the fuck they gonna do to got them stuff on this year. Keep that same energy, nigga. But you get them same Leo. ghosts out there throwing goddamn interceptions, motherfucker. But that's y'all, but that's y'all MVP, though. That's y'all MVP. Leo. That's you know, you do got an MVP. Leo that's in the box. MVP. Affirmative, affirmative action MVP. I'm just I'm just kidding. <laughs> Leo, you know how many you know how many yards Cam had? What two fifty? Two sixty five. Damn. Load, load the box. Damn. Don't start to throw the football. But no time to throw the goddamn ball. But Terry Gill leading the league and got them drop balls. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. He did. He did drop a pass. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. He had the number one offense, but the nigga leading the NFL with drop balls, nigga. Mm. Hey, Man, but yeah. that's not, oh, let's not forget. Let's not forget, like, the year before that, you know what I'm saying? Or the year after that, we got the loss of the Saints because Caleb Clay dropped the goddamn touchdown pass. Mm -hmm. Listen here, sir. But you're talking about, you talking about Kendall not accurate. Shut that dumb man shit up, nigga. You cannot say nothing to me. Yeah. You, can't. you can never yeah. say anything about scaring to me. Get I the fuck out of here. There's no convincing me. I'm firmly Get the fuck out of here, nigga. I'm yeah. firmly entrenched on scam being hard. Nigga dropping fucking balls out I, there. I, no, his, I, his best I, looking I, receiver was a fucking tight end, nigga. What the I, fuck are you talking about? I hated the so way he, he play. But see, Leo's under the impression. Either. Well, no, I said Leo. Black Karen. Black Karen is under the impression that we give a fuck what he says. <laughs> I, I hated to watch Cam play quarterback. I wish we'd let him go a while ago. You know, it ain't no we, nigga. You ain't no motherfucking Panthers fan. I hated to watch Cam. Come on, fucking we. Hey, no, 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 no. Hey, see, though, I don't know if he was on the show the other night, but this nigga said the silliest shit ever. This motherfucker said that he was hoping and praying that the Panthers lost the Super Bowl because he didn't want Cam Newton to get the credit. Yeah. That's wow. what I said. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, man, why you let this motherfucker call in, big cat? What the fuck? It's 4th of July, I'm freedom of peace. <laughs> this silly ass shit, man. Scam, scam, new fuck. Trash. Undeserved accolades. Affirmative action MVP. Cross dressing as. <laughs> Big hat, fake ass smile. Oh, Justin, hold on. Because your broke ass can't divorce, uh, afford designer clothes. Uh, first of all, nigga, Travis Kelsey look up to Kel Newton, nigga. Big cat. For oh, fashion, nigga. And he was a, he, and he bet he got all the bullshit, but got that Kel Newton, nigga. Slam. Trying to get them dressed like got them Kel Newton. Nigga, man, shut the fuck up. Nigga. You don't know what the fuck you talking about, nigga. Shut the fuck up, my nigga. Slam. I'll take your bitch ass every goddamn time, nigga. Slant throwing, nigga. No touch on the ball, gun the ball on a slant ass quarterback. <laughs> Overthrowing six five wide receivers. Overthrowing so two minutes when Kaylee Craig dropped the touchdown pass. Who fault was that? It was it was an accurate pass. Big we lost to the Saints in the play, in a playoff game. Who fault was it, nigga? Big Cat. Carolina deep offense. Yeah, man, shut the football. fuck up, man. All they did was the fuck here, man. Big Cat. They were so predictable. All they did was the RPO and Cam throw a slant. Am I lying? Uh, I'm not sure. I gotta look at the tape, brother. Big Cat. Every fucking game, all he did was a fucking slant. And, and, and the wide receiver was always falling to the ground catching the ball because he was fucking gunning it. The dude's a fucking idiot. <laughs> so what the fuck is Sam Donald did, nigga? He got traded at 23. Nigga, Cam Newton ain't never get traded at 23, motherfucker. What oh, the fuck is you saying? Cam got cut. What are you Cam, saying? Scam got cut. Did, did I hear RPOs? MP, MVPs don't get cut, baby. <laughs> did I hear RPO? MVPs don't get cut. MVPs don't get cut. It was so system, effective. But, they, but they're MVPs. just in RPOs now. I, I forgot. I forgot. I'm sorry. So tell me, say MVPs don't get cut. Because we were dumb as fuck to got them cut his ass. MVP. We don't want to got them Teddy Bridgewater, the fucking Teddy Bear, to Monster City and got them ghosts. But you fucking happy. Get the fuck MVP. out of here, nigga. MVPs don't get cut, baby. Yeah. Yeah, it's where I let me in. All right, hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Bust his ass. A ghost, bust her ass, back ass motherfucker. <laughs> He was a turnover machine at goddamn USC. He came to the NFL and did the same goddamn thing, nigga. I want to just got rid of his bum ass. The fuck? Everybody talking about he had Adam Gates, nigga. Adam Gates ain't made seven dollars throw a goddamn interception, nigga. I don't want to hear that bullshit no goddamn more. He threw the goddamn ball. Get the fuck out of here. Load the box. Throw the ball. Let's see you win the game. He didn't do it because you're an idiot. I hear you. You not you, sir. Not you. Not not you. I'm not talking to you, sir. Come I don't know you. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Uh, Bunch of fucking shit. The fuck? This motherfucker. 
This motherfucker said he wished we didn't win the Super Bowl. And I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. There's something wrong with this nigga, bro. I tell you what, and, t- and tell him Morton don't get his motherfucking money. Let's see how goddamn how, how motivated he's gonna be to block this goddamn year, nigga, and see what the goddamn send down to do then, nigga. We just tra- we just trade him there and get some more picks. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and, and, and let's see how that's gonna work out. Let's trade the offensive lineman. Let's trade the offensive lineman in the middle of the season. Taylor Morton played right side. Taylor Morton played right side. Sam is right handed. We're going to get some more picks for Sam Donald with an S. <laughs> let's just trade a dominant top five hey, big, white tackle in cat. the middle yeah, of the season. What's up? What's up? Big Cat. Yeah, what's up? We, we, we could do without Taylor Moore. Let's do that mad and shit leave. I'm going to tell, tell you why. Let me tell you why, brother. Yeah, tell me why. Oh, my God. Taylor Moore. Taylor Moore. Big Cat lied to you. He ain't looking no damn links. Big Cat. Taylor Moore is a, is a <laughs> right tackle. Sam throws from the right side, so it's he not he not protecting no blind side. He throw you got to protect the left side because that's his back shoulder. We could do without Taylor Moen because he could Again, Sam could well, see, me tell you, let me tell you Sam let me tell you could something. see the rush coming. If you think for one second that the Panthers is gonna go out and and, and cut. I didn't say cut, so I said trade, sir. I said trade, sir. I said trade. Because Sam Darnold was on our team, you must be fucking drunk. Big cat. If a quarterback's right handed, they might figure it out. As a quarterback's right handed, they're not going to let him go because Sam Darnold ain't our future. Big cat. If the quarterback's right handed, you need a left tackle because that protects his blind side. The right tackle is not. I mean, don't get me wrong. You, you, if you need an effective one, you need a good one. <laughs> but I'm just saying, though, to pay him, to pay him eighteen million dollars, that's oh, ludicrous. Because, what do you mean, Taylor not worth the money? Well, he just said it was ludicrous. Big cat. Yes, it was. Have, yes, it was. Big cat. Why do we have a contract? This nigga is rainbow. Look at they dumb as fuck by not got signed his ass last year, nigga. Now we don't fuck up because the Saints done signed that motherfucker. He done got paid. Now we gotta give him more goddamn money, nigga. This man what? just said because Sam Donald is right-handed, that makes t- that makes Taylor Moten his blind tie. A motherfucker who see goddamn ghosts. Man, this nigga still, hey, this nigga retarded as fuck, man. Yeah, I think he's missing to understand what blind means. Big Cat, you, are you there, sir? Big Cat. Big Cat. Yeah, what's up, bro? Taylor Moten is a right tackle, is he not? Yeah, he is. Sam Donald's right-handed, is he not? Right. He's a right, yeah, left guard. He could throw the ball. He throws the ball to the right side, does he not? Yeah. Okay, then. So his blind side oh, is the left man. tackle. So he throws the ball to the right side all game? Is that he's what you just said? He's why, not our cat, future, is he not? <laughs> big Cat, why haven't they given Taylor Bowen the contract? Because they ain't dumb as fuck. Have you seen any team cat, trade a goddamn top cat, top? Why haven't they the given him the a contract, Big Cat? What, hey, listen, what do you I've never seen that, though. What do you think? Y'all should be happy. Y'all should be happy that Leo wants him because everything this motherfucker wants never comes to fruition. Never. Never. Big he's cat. like a, he's a Charles Barkley in the show. He can never get it right. Big Cat. As Big so, cat now, so, now, so now I know Taylor Milton good. Big Cat, hey, why haven't they given him a contract, Big Cat? I'm trying to get Curtis Samuel. Why haven't hey, they given him a contract? Hey, what's up? Y'all, y'all, y'all want to hear something? That's the scary truth, though. What? Guess right? who got the highest? Now, nah, listen. Guess who got the guess who got the better completion percentage over between Jam Newton and Sam Darnold? Who, who, bro? <laughs> it ain't Sam Darnold. Oh, well, I want to hear. It. <laughs> <I'm serious. laughs> Yo, bitch, I can't hear this shit clear. Hey, look, hold it, hold it. Hold it, Twan. I'm finna tell you. I'm finna tell you another stat. He got, he got 45 career touchdowns and 39 career interceptions. Who that is? Sam Donald. That's terrible. As Skip, as Skip Bailey say, is, is that good? Mm, no. Mm. I'm, no, I'm no, just we, speaking we, out we, facts. Trust me, trust me. We knew his facts. Try. We knew his stats. You know. But he, but he's taking the MVP guy and calling him no, again. No, we want, we want, we want everybody to know. <laughs> this nigga said forty-five touchdowns for thirty-nine interceptions. That is fucking. That is, that's why he's the bottom of the fucking barrel. He's hey, a fucking cat. bum. They care. Why haven't they given Taylor Moore the contract, brother? Hello. 
I'm not sure you can tell me why, bro. Because it is not <laughs> primary to the yeah. offense. He's a right tackle. You got to pay a left tackle that type of money. Hey, you don't hey, pay you a right hey, tackle hey, that money when your quarterback is hey, right hey, hey, Karen. Hey, right, Karen. You want to make a bet? Don't make a bet. Twenty dollars, twenty dollars, and Taylor Moore will be signed by the end of next week. No, don't bet that, Twan. Don't bet that. We done fucked up. Don't bet that. Yeah, we fucked up, man. We fucked up by not signing him last year. The Saints got that on set the ball now. Yeah, yeah. Now we gotta pay this nigga more fucking money. Take that, Leo. Leo, take that, Leo. Leo, take that shit. Leo. The Panthers <laughs> like the better. Leo, take that shit, bro. The GM is intelligent. Matt Leo. Rose intelligent. Leo, take that shit. And that same GM didn't put an offensive line around goddamn uh, Russell Wilson, nigga. So what the fuck is you talking about? He wasn't the GM, sir. And whatever. Or whatever he wasn't the GM, though. I'm trying to bet him. I'm trying to bet him. Until you address me with my name, sir, I won't speak to you, sir. (laughs) Are you (laughs) black? Nigga, you don't even ask the question. It doesn't even even fucking matter. I told you, 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 I told Hey, how you feel about how, how do you feel about seven dollar career stats though, nigga? <laughs> the fuck, he got quiet. We're gonna talk about some bullshit. But so every time motherfucker bring out motherfucking stats and numbers, your bitch ass get quiet and got them chance to got them subject, nigga. Oh, wish you watch your ass, motherfucker. Big cat, we gotta save money. We gotta save. Money. We gotta save money. <laughs> save money for what? And pay who? Saving for in the rebuild. Yeah, what we say, money for my G? Hey, Black Karen, I, I sure hope you're reading the fucking. I you gotta save it for the community or something, baby. You gotta save chat. money for. Hope, you gotta save money hope, for. I hope you're reading the chat. Yeah. You gotta get a left tackle. Okay, what, what left tackle we gonna get, bro? <laughs> we gonna we got going forward in the future. We, we, I don't see I don't see them paying a the right tackle seventeen eighteen million dollars a year, bro. What about now, now look, now look, now, 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 now look, chat. I know you had a son, man. Why what? you ain't tell us you had a daughter? <laughs> Leo, put him in his fucking place, Leo. I mean, we knew you had. No, 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 no. no, no. I, I, I'm talking to you now. I knew you had a son, but when, you ain't never tell us about this daughter. Leo, put that nigga in his place. But big cat, you see how I'm talking to you about football related shit? Yeah. But 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 the female. Nigga, you ain't talking about football. Cause you ain't answering no questions, nigga. No fucking but the, fe- but, but, but the females, <laughs> but the females keep reverting to what we call it. Ad no, 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 no. Nigga, talk about yeah, Sam Donald career stance, then, nigga. Yeah, Why he got 45 yeah, touchdowns with 39 interceptions, nigga? Talk about that. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> hey, see, how many times? How many times there have you called go. big cat today? I tell you, how many times do you call me that's me? Seven? Not too much. Yeah, it ain't a bunch of bitch. It ain't a bitch on the line. That's you. Hey, see, dog. What's up? And guess what? And guess what? He got a lower rating, too. We already know. But but Leo Leo don't want to talk about that, though. Yeah. Bitch. Black carrot. Forty-five like touchdowns, thirty-nine interceptions, but you quiet about that. Look, this nigga, 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 nigga say he was seeing ghosts on the field, and you quiet about that because it's a black Karen. They go around lying about shit all the time. Look, it's a fucking reward up for his ass in the chat. So they big cat two hundred, and we'll capture that bitch and get away, get out of it. <laughs> You remind me of that dude up there and got that New Jersey. He was talking all that bullshit <laughs> and talking about pull up and the motherfucker pulled up and showed the fuck out, nigga. The motherfucker pimp, the pimp trying to tell you off. What about them niggas? What about them niggas in New Jersey, yo? <laughs> Your pimp trying to show you off right now. He's trying to get rid of you. What'd you say, brother? Are you talking about the Bont Law thing? Yeah, what about them niggas up in New Jersey? What do you think about that silly shit? I mean, Mount Law, New Jersey, that's South Jersey. It's a real affluent part of town. They have money down there, so I don't know what the dude was doing. Like far as the African guy, the white man was telling them that you know this is America, shit like that. Oh. They the no, guy. nigga, he called him a fucking porch monkey, nigga. And then he gave motherfuckers his address, time I pull up, and they pull the fuck up, nigga. 
Big cat. Man, you know what? Hey, man, look, if he ain't gonna talk, look, if he gonna talk about the fucking facts, dog, just shut the fuck up, my nigga. Well, you did. All thing you do is fucking lie on this motherfucker. Well, then you don't ask no motherfucking questions, nigga. Well, you did. Well, you did. You did. The fuck. Well, you did. Then you just got there look it up, nigga. And, yeah. and I'm talking about when the police got there. And, and I'm talking about what I don't like. When the police got there, he was talking shit to the motherfucking police. Well, it'd be a black man talking shit. It would be all, man, fuck with a goddamn nigga. Well, the, you did. The white boy? Oh, man. Just go, just go, 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 go inside, sir. Go inside, sir. Nigga, well, get the did. fuck out of here, nigga. Well, you did. Well, you did. Look, look, it up, look it up, nigga. Well, you did. Black, look it up, nigga. Well, you did. Black, black, hey, black Karen wears skinny jeans and good and tops. Well, you did, sir. Big look Karen, it up. It, it, about, it was about 300 motherfuckers out there on the top of his head, and they fucked that nigga house up. They're on his ass, nigga. Big Cat. Throw a the police and everything. The police they ain't want to do nothing, nigga. They ain't want no smoke, nigga. Talk about that. Were well, you there, sir? Nigga, look it up. They ain't want no smoke, nigga. Police yeah. out that bitch scared. Ain't nobody nigga. worried about Ain't nobody worried about y'all. Please get it. Oh, I hear you. So why they ain't do nothing there, nigga? Why they ain't do anything, nigga? You're not worth nothing. I hear you. I hear you. I your hear you. Your community that I hear you. The barrel and hey, black Karen, I hear you. Hey, Black Karen, was you there? Your community at the bottom of the barrel in every statistical category in America. They ain't gonna talk about Rocky Night. Well, I forgot. No, I forgot. You said your community, not his. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not like y'all. No, no. Your community is at the at the bottom of the barrel in every statistical. How can you? When you was on here with Petey Quick, you was calling him all type of niggas, and your first time you came in it was peace, 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 everybody, peace. But you got married with with, with Petey Quick, you was calling everybody niggas and shit. Your so how, how can you? So how was it? So your how was it you not your, like us? Your community. But I will go. You were sounding like us. But I will go. You sounded like us. Your community is at the bottom of the barrel. Every you sounded like category. somebody on Beta Four or something. Man. Your community is at the bottom of the barrel in every statistical category. You have no reason. And now you want to switch up. Out. You have no reason to have your chest poked out. You are doing hey, nothing. Listen. So, so listen. Economic. So listen. The hundred and twenty motherfuckers in this chat right now. So what look you got poked out, Leo. What you, no, no, no. Look. When this black Karen motherfucker start talking about this and talking about your fucking neighborhood and saying you ain't shit for being a black man, this is what y'all motherfuckers should be calling this motherfucker by the boatload, the toughest motherfucking ass out. Because he want it. He want it. Your community is at the bottom of the barrel and every this single is, category. This is what every single one of y'all motherfuckers should be calling into this he motherfucker. He ain't been in nobody's community. He this nigga out. He don't know where, who, where, where people live. And his name is fucking Leo. It's Black Karen. When you when you come to the community, the property value goes down. This nigga, this nigga got that line about what happened in New Jersey. Nigga, they was on that motherfucker ass, nigga. Leo, why when the property you come, value go down, bro? Because they are uncivilized savages. When gay niggas like him come to the community, the property value goes down. Big cat. They throw trash on the ground where they live at. <laughs> Hold on, nigga. First, first of all, nigga, white people got them brain nests and got them black people, nigga. What the fuck you talking about, nigga? Big Tell my thoughts okay, touching the ground, nigga. Man, you, yeah, there you go, yeah, that, that bullshit. Hey, don't so, get mad, you know. We can't, hey, we can't all live in the gay community. Big cat. Fuck. Fuck. This nigga don't do nothing but fucking lie. Big cat, they rob and steal from each other. The term it is, goddamn Leo. Who, 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 who goddamn, uh, on goddamn government assistant more? Niggas or white people, is nigga? Hey, is anybody trying to call into this motherfucker right now? No, no. Big cat. <laughs> Yo, seriously, don't let this nigga talk shit about y'all. Are y'all still even calling? Keep going, Leo. Keep going, Leo. You're at the bottom of the barrel. You're at the bottom of the social pecking order. Yeah. You're at the bottom of the social pecking order. Then what are you then, sir? And you're at the bottom of the social pecking order. Hold on. What what are you then, sir? You're at the bottom of the social pecking order. Yeah. You have no economic base. You have no religion. So you ain't Leo. So you ain't black, right? job in Miami. So you ain't black, right? got denied in Miami. Have, Leo got denied no, in Miami. You have no <laughs> political base. Leo yeah, got denied in Miami. in Miami. You got cut. Yeah. You got cut before you was ever on the team. So baby. obviously you can't you fit in no community either. You know? no, I wonder why. You have no political base. You have no economic base. So you Leo, no, nah, you good. Space. This nigga act like he got that living butt here to suck. Nigga, hold on. Nigga, where the fuck you live at in Atlanta, nigga? Where the, the fuck bottom. you live at down there, nigga? You at the bottom. You say you're call it. Hey, guys, you live down there, nigga. I know you. I know you ain't got no money being butt here, nigga. No, Shut the fuck up, nigga. He say he was in the hood. He dog. He was in uh, what you call it? He dog. He dog. He dog. There. Yeah, I'm here, nigga. Go ahead and lie and say you got that living butt here because you don't, nigga. 
where, 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 where Atlantic Station at, C Dog? What that say? Then where all the goddamn fuck is that, nigga? What the fuck you got? I'm talking about. That's where all the goddamn fuck is that, nigga? Who the fuck you think? Nigga, I just went down there, nigga. But Big Cat, Big Cat, he just said I ain't lit it. Hey, Big Cat, he just said I ain't lit it, though. No, 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 fuck you, nigga. Yeah. See, this is the conversation we had on the night. Big Cat, did he just say I ain't lit it? This is, this is. He just said I ain't lit it, though. This is what we're talking about. Nigga, Atlanta Station ain't got that book here, nigga. It, it, it's, it's right. It's, it's across the street, brother. It's across. No, the street. fuck is not, nigga. It's across the street. It's this is what I thought about. This is what nigga, I thought about. Nigga, you can't even got that got that train to the motherfucking book here, nigga. What the fuck you talking about, nigga? It's, it's across the street, sir. It's I street. hear you. It's Keep lying, street. nigga. I used to live down there, nigga. You can't lie to me, nigga. It's across the street, sir. It's I hear you. It's across the street. I hear you. Big cat, big cat. They got a curfew. I hear you. I'm like, I'm like, motherfucker. Hold on, nigga. I'm like, motherfucking got them Kennesaw, motherfucking. Uh, 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 hold on, man. Got them uh, Gwinnett County. Nigga, ain't no, ain't no train station out there, nigga. Where the fucking money at down there, nigga? Ain't no motherfucking train station. They got them bus running, nigga. So, hey, so Leo thinks, so Leo yeah. thinks he's no, 10 hey. minutes away from a good neighborhood. No, that means, okay. that means he's something. Oh, yeah. Big Cat, he just said he's still on the okay. outskirts. Leo's okay. staying on the outskirts. He think okay. he in there pre-part yeah. of the community. He don't. He don't. He don't live in Kennesaw. <laughs> he don't live in goddamn uh, the, the, the other shit that's up with the motherfucker. Man, it's Kennesaw, goddamn Gwinnett County. Motherfucking, uh, God, it's the one that started with a guy that nigga flat on Broadway. You don't live with a guy that money yet. Shut the Big fuck cat. up, nigga. Big cat, what's the first thing you say? You don't live in Buckhead. Didn't you say that? Yeah, yeah. Is that what he said? 704, 704, this nigga's in the house. Ain't that what he said? <laughs> nah, they, that's what he said. Ain't it? But now he trying to change it. Now he trying to change it. You see how niggas is? They stupid. They stupid. <laughs> hey, you lying, wrong. nigga. Stop lying. Stop, Stop lying to these motherfuckers on the goddamn lie, nigga. Look, 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 y'all. Look, let me kill this for him. Let me kill this for him. Hey, hey, yeah, Black sure. Karen. Black Karen, check this out. Big Cat is a nigga. <laughs> he ain't white. <laughs> you're, you're, you're right to find him. I know you can see him. He ain't white. You're right to find him. So you're going to say he's different too, right? You're at the bottom of the totem pole. So Big Cat is at the bottom of the totem pole. You're at the bottom of the totem pole. I so Big Cat is at the dark bottom of the totem pole. Go ahead and say it. It's okay, bro. I would not be so arrogant if I were you. <laughs> it, it's okay. Go ahead and say Big Cat is at the bottom of the totem pole. Go ahead and say it. I would not be so arrogant if I were you. No, go ahead and say it, bro. You're at the bottom. You're at the bottom of the totem pole. I'm not at the fucking bottom of no fucking pole, nigga. I live well. My life is good. So, so, so don't so don't take it personal. So, no, 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 So, so you said Big Cat is at the bottom of the totem pole, right? You're at the bottom of the totem hey, no, pole. No, 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 no. It's either one way or the other. You don't get to pick sides. Big Cat is black too. He's a nigga. You're so either you talking to all of us, you can't exclude a nigga from being black. He's black. So all black people are niggas. Is that what you're saying? Twan, look, let's not forget this man say he live by Atlanta Station where all the faggots at. According to you, according to you, all niggas is black. No, no, no. That's that's just what you're saying. No, no, no. You said y'all are at the bottom of the totem pole. Big Cat is black, so he must be at the bottom of the totem pole. Leo, yeah, why do you stay around faggots, man? Yeah, why do you live around faggots, Leo? Because it's, safe, because it's safer. It's safer. I hear you. I hear let, you. Me, let me get it. Let me get it. I hear you. He's He's not like any of you. You live around faggots because you probably a faggot, nigga. That's why, motherfucker. It's safer, sir. It's safer. Nigga, you ain't on the outskirts, nigga. I already said, nigga, anywhere the train station, the bus from the nigga ain't no real money, nigga. So because, like the rest of these so because someone is gay, that means they can't, they can't, they can't rob you. You're right. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be so arrogant if I were you. I would tone it down. That sounds like some arrogant shit right there. How, you, your your living is is very arrogant. If the black, if the black, if the, if the black, black American, black Karen, Aaron, look, Aaron Nation Karen, whichever one you want to call it, black Karen, the Aryan Nation Karen, the lips Karen, you know, anything that's fucking white is despicable. That's that's it. You say he don't like faggots, but stay around, goddamn faggots. Get the fuck yeah, out of here, nigga. Get the fuck like out of here, nigga. See, you know, that's the thing, bro. When you are something, you try to cover it up by trying to be to join along with the people that are talking about it. If you How many motherfuckers talk shit about gay niggas just to cover up who they are? Nigga, we can hear it in your voice. If you, you had are any, a gay ass dude, bro. If you had any Trapped in the closet ass motherfucker. If you had any self awareness, you wouldn't be so boastful. You're good short, you good in shorts wearing motherfucker. You're at the bottom of the totem pole. Economically, politically, and socially, you're at the bottom. You fill the prisons up because you're savages. 
Hold on, man. Let me tell you something. Man. I watch Snap every Sunday on my DVR. And 99.9% of the time, it's right there, white people killing white people. What are you talking about, sir? You feel the prison. And I watch a TV show called uh, Bird in the Backyard. And that's all crackers. You killing feel the crackers. Prison. So what are you talking about, sir? You feel the prisons up. Sir. I hear you. I hear you. You feel the prisons up. Nigga, you'll never see black people on Snap, nigga. That shit come on every Sunday, nigga. Nothing but fucking the only, crackers. The only I wonder race, why, I wonder the only, why we fill up the prisons. I the wonder, only, I wonder the, why. The only race that will openly disrespect and degrade themselves. <laughs> openly. Big so, cat, they, big so you don't see all these white girls on TikTok, nigga? Shit your dumb ass up, nigga. Big cat, big cat, you just be they, saying the dumbest shit. Big Cat, they make music talking about drugs which destroyed their community. Damn. Stupid ass people, man. This fucking Look, man. If y'all, if y'all let that, what this nigga say get to you or take that shit with an ounce of any disrespect, he he, like, he ain't black, so he don't even know what it's like to be fucking black. They can't he's, like, only- yeah, he's a wannabe straight black dude. And see, this is the thing. We know what each other look like. Nobody knows what this bitch nigga looks like. He hides behind this bullshit name. He's Karen. He's black fucking Karen. He okay. shows you how to live your life, but he won't even show his own fucking ugly ass face. Big okay. yeah. so cat. He wear makeup every day. The only race Before he go to work at goddamn the legislation. The only race <laughs> that will open yeah, like, it. He acts like, and this Leon, you know, this shit really hurts our fellas when he say that shit. Big huh? okay. cat, the only race of people that open it. Look at nigga. I'm black nigga. The only race that will openly disrespect their women. Openly. Right, I'm a nigga. I'm a nigga Openly. right here. Twan is a nigga. Meet, I'm a meet. nigga. He's a nigga. She's a nigga. They some niggas. Wouldn't you like to be a nigga too? They make music to openly degrade and denigrate their women. Yeah, we we don't, we don't walk around on stages biting the head off fucking pigeons. You're the right. The cat. The cat. They they promote drug abuse oh, yeah. in their music. You're right. Nigga, who do you think got them being on fit now and sit out here, nigga? Talking about drugs, nigga. Just bought hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nigga, nigga, who, who be out here? Hairline, nigga, the most. Nigga, white nigga, people, nigga. nigga the fuck? Oh, man, white people are addicted to everything. You just bought them drugs. Big cat. Nigga, we smoke weed, 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 nigga. Cat, white people do cocaine, fit, and all, heroin, hairline. What the fuck hairline, you talking about, nigga? They'll just take some shit just because you give it to me, man. Take that. Put your oil. This nigga be just lying, man. Shut the fuck up. Man. Black people, we ask, we ask questions. What the fuck is this? Big cat, they're so stupid that they, the 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 major corporations get them money for them to act like a nigga, and they, and they and they pass it down to to their people, and they make it cool to act like a nigga. They making money off them, and they breeding. Money. Nigga, I don't know no niggas who do hair run, nigga. So what are you so, talking about? But you're such a stupid. I hear you. You're such a I hear stupid. You. I don't know no niggas to do hair line. Big cat. Yeah. Well, I said earlier. They, they get so, on. Well, I said earlier, big cat. They so stupid. <laughs> big cat. They got a TV station predicated on continuously showing them acting like fucking animals, and it's called BET. Man, BET is not black entertainment TV. That shit is owned by Viacom. A so white goes, company. So Big Cat goes to show that they're so stupid that they let the white man who own this shit make fools of their ignorant, stupid asses. Hold on, man. You talking about all this bullshit, nigga? Do you know that know the, the goddamn uh, the Koreans own more shit in America than the white man? You know that, right? Big Cat, he just bridges. You know that Cat, shit, right? Big Cat, he told yeah, him nigga. That the white yeah, nigga, man shut the fuck it. up, nigga. He told no, the white man don't own the white man don't own shit out here, nigga. The Koreans, the, nigga, the Koreans own America, nigga. They been no, no, selling no. America, nigga. Big Cat, he told me. He said, dude, ain't salty tasters in the chat. He said, literally, all races do all the things. Nah, nigga, that ain't true. White people do all the drugs. They can't. Yeah. And they don't take anything, bro. Black people question shit we put in our mouth. He just told niggas, niggas don't do Niggas don't do meth. The white man owned it, and he paid him to act <laughs> like fucking yeah, yeah, yeah. How do black people you don't smoke fucking meth and huh? That's a yeah, white people drug. How many, how many black people y'all know popping pills on a regular like it's like it ain't shit? All the white time. people shit. The rappers talk about it all the time. How many black people you know out here on this waffle flock and all that damn shit to make your ass run into a fucking wall a hundred miles an hour? Leo do all that shit. Nigga, meth is a white person drug. 
Heroin is a white person drug. What the fuck? We don't make, and for the rest of niggas, we don't make none of that shit. <laughs> so the coach show how stupid you are because you use it. <laughs> you probably use it. Nigga smoke weed, nigga. So, but that's some niggas who do crack. That's about it. You talking about the other shit? That's white people shit, nigga. But see, but see, you know this. He said that's because we so stupid. But white people use the shit at an alarming high number. But he didn't say they was stupid. You know, my boy's always talking about smoking weed, and he said we doing drugs and wasting our life. Leo, why, why is weed bad, brother? We, any, any marijuana, any, 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 any. anything that you put fire to. <laughs> hey, nigga, stop saying weed. You are not. Hey, look, I think we can all raise our hands and say, nigga, you are not in our community. We don't fuck with you. You have been banned. If you, if you even black, we don't even know that. Stop if we so bad, why the fuck? This shit going to be legal everywhere in the next five years. Why the fuck is so bad? Hey, big cat, are you there, brother? Yeah, it's and if you hate black people, if you hate black people so much, why do you keep calling into a nigga show? Because if we so bad, why do they have medical marijuana then, sir? <laughs> because I'm, I'm, I'm gonna answer your question real quick. Because because the white people don't want to play with me anymore. The white people don't fuck with me no more. Big cat, I'm a, um, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna answer your question. Listen to this, big cat. Okay. This past weekend in Chicago, 140 people were shot. Were you Big cat, are you there? <laughs> <laughs> The cat. So if we go with the random, if we go with the random sickness, he. Okay, listen, the cat, he listen, gotta listen, go find some shit. The cat, listen to this. The cat, we don't want to hear your Chicago story, nigga. We ain't gonna let you say it, nigga. The cat, are you there? We ain't gonna let you say it. Hey, fuck, hey, I swear that nigga won't get this story off tonight. I bet you he won't get this story off tonight. He found up and watching CNN. He gonna be playing the cat all damn night. Hey, tell me the story, Leo. Go ahead and try. Go ahead and try, Leo. Go ahead Once and try. Upon a time in Chicago, and but they can't decide. He just showing you how weak they are. That's all. They just showing you how weak they are. Weak as fuck. Yeah, you weak. You weak. Oh, you really like that motherfucker I mean, crack up there in motherfucking New Jersey, nigga. You, you, nigga, you weak. You call us all these bad names. We might as well be that shit, right? So watch, watch how stupid we're going to be tonight. Start yeah, telling that story, nigga. The, the bottom of the totem pole socially. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'm, I'm so glad he don't write y'all checks. Wait, hold on. This nigga might not even have a job. Because he just got fired from some shit he didn't even get yet. That white dude, that white dude in New Jersey, he got fired. The bottom of the He lost his pole. job. He lost his job for being a racist. The bottom of the totem pole. I hear you. But we're not so, getting fired from our job for being racist, though, but we're at the bottom of the totem pole. So shit, your dumb ass up. Take care of you there. All niggas do is talk shit about white folk, but they crying about somebody when they talk about their black ass. Mm. Hey, look, man. Okay, so this shit is getting funny now. He keeps talking to Big Cat as if Big Cat ain't no nigga. Big Cat ain't the white cat. <laughs> he's a black person. Why do you keep referring to him as a third person like he's not black? You're telling that story, Leo. Yeah, he won't get that one off. They weak, big cat. They weak. I need to know what happened to Chicago. Nigga, you weak. Nigga, I probably bitch more than you, nigga. I don't yeah. weigh nothing but a buck fifty, nigga. You mentally weak because you care about racism. That's right. That's no, nigga, no, nigga, you mentally weak. You mentally weak. Nigga, you mentally you, weak. You, you, you talking about got that can new, nigga? Get the fuck out of here, nigga. Because you believe all the shit they told you. You believed it, you dumb nigga. Only a weak ass <laughs> man would care about somebody who don't like him. That's weak. Only a weak ass man would talk about motherfucking MVP, nigga. I never talked about racism. That I hear you. Don't mean nothing to me. I hear you. Weak ass men talk about racism. I hear you. Don't mean nothing to me. Nigga, you're weak ass there. I got them manifestations. All got them facts, nigga. You weak, nigga. I don't fuck out here. I don't care if nobody don't like me. I'm a grown ass fucking man. That shit don't mean nothing to me. But you, nigga, you 45 out here, and you got that either, either you got that either you sucking dick or you beating your dick, nigga. Shut the fuck up. But you weak ass, but you weak ass black men. But you weak ass black men keep talking about the white man don't like me, racist. I don't give a fuck. Let me tell you something. I don't give a fuck if niggas don't like me. Yes, you know you what I'm saying? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. I don't. Yes, you, do you know why? Because the motherfuckers won't got them you touch care. me, nigga. So all that shit what you said is irrelevant, you my nigga. You care? You care? That shit is irrelevant, my nigga. You care? What's talking about? You know what I'm saying? Let me tell you something. I got a truck. I got a shirt that say Trump 2020, nigga, and wear my shit all around goddamn town, and not one goddamn cracker gonna touch me, nigga. So all that shit you said is irrelevant, my nigga. Shut the fuck up.
Twenty twelve. You scared? I'm scared, man. I hear y'all. Y'all love him. The white man. The white man. Racism. Racism. <laughs> no, nigga, you love him. You love him. If I want them not worried about it's a motherfucking cracker, nigga. Get the fuck out of here. The white man don't like me. He don't like me. Don't put that shit on us. You love him. You don't want to suck his dick. The white man don't love me. He don't like me because I'm black. Look, bro. Let me tell you something about most black people. We can give a fuck. We can care less about that shit, bro. Yes, y'all do. Get out of here, man. The only motherfucker trying to impress white people is you, nigga. Black, you, black, you black trying to be like them motherfuckers is you. All y'all niggas do is cry by the white man. Y'all love him. Y'all want his approval like little fucking girls. I ain't heard nobody on this show. I ain't heard nobody on this show cry about the white man. The white man, because I, I, when you when you talk about racism, you're just crying about the white man because you love him. You envy him. You want to see him. Who cried about the white man tonight? Come on, I got here late. I got here late. Who cried about the white man tonight? You are the main one. I bet you know why you are the, the white man. You are the head chief. All you do is <laughs> nigga, everybody ain't scared of white people about your punk ass, nigga. We we we, we whoop ass around here, nigga. No, you guys are not scared. I hear you. You love me. I you hear you. My, hey, you better check my resume again, nigga. Around here, nigga. We whoop, what? We whoop crackers around here, nigga. Talk no, about the don't. dead, man. No, you don't. See, I'll leave your app. No, you don't. No, you don't. I don't fuck with Y'all whoop crackers around right here, nigga. No, you don't. No, you don't. Around here is open carry. And like I said, nigga, I wear my... Fuck no, Trump shirt, nigga, and I ain't no, never been touched yet, nigga. I don't weigh nothing but a buck fifty, nigga. No, you don't. You niggas, I hear you. Pet. You niggas are the pets of the white man. I hear you. I pets. I hear you. They look a, 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 a cracker ain't never pet me a day in they fucking life, nigga. What the fuck are you talking about? Fucking pets. I hear you. All oh, you guys are. Pets. I wish the motherfucker. I wish I wish a cracker would pet me. This is the fuck happened to you, got them ass. It get broke down like a motherfucking shotgun. They let y'all run that's around. What, that's what Leo. Did. That's what he's used to do. Good job, cracker. I meant Leo. <laughs> you, be at, you be at work, got them kids in the goddamn cracker ass. Yeah. All in the goddamn yeah. ass. I don't, I don't know what ass she tastes like, nigga. That's why he tried to get that job in fucking Florida because they they ain't get the one he wanted. They said, nah, we ain't fucking uh, with you. Excuse me. Hey, Big Cat, it's a street. What's that street in Charlotte? Was it North Tryon? Big Cat, they got this street down to uptown Charlotte. The, 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 I do believe there's a brother on the line that's from Charlotte. Nigga, shut up. Big Cat, Big Cat, Big Cat, the white man. Let, Big Cat, the white man felt so bad. That nigga, oh, he, he, he once said that the Penn Stadium had rocks and hills, but I ain't no seen that. Big Cat. Big the cat, fuck up, nigga. You don't know cat. nothing about Sean. No, seven up four. Let the nigga lie. Let the nigga go ahead and lie real quick. Cat, seven up four. Let the motherfucker lie again. Big cat. That's when you know you fucking with a fucking clown. He gonna ask Big Cat, and he knows damn well who lives in Charlotte. Big Cat, check this out, Big Cat. On 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 the major street downtown, uptown, whatever they call it. Black Karen. Big Cat, check it out. The the white liberal let. You ain't okay. getting no stories off tonight. No, man. Let that nigga go ahead and lie. Go ahead and let him lie. Oh, seven four, no, let him lie so seven or four can check his ass. Let him I'm finish. I'm tired of the lies, man. I'm tired of the lies, yeah, man. Cat, this, ain't, cat, cat, this ain't no lie, big cat, though. This ain't no lie. On the, on, 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 is, it, is it North Tryon? On the major street? Right across from um the Roof Fridge restaurant in, in the court. Nigga, why the fuck are you reading up on Charlotte? No, no, that's what I know for. I seen it myself, Big Cat, on a major... That's why I let him finish so 704 can check him. Please. Cat, right across from the Wells Fargo in the courtyard on a major street, the, the, the white liberal let the pitiful ass nigga paint Black Lives Matter in the middle of the fucking street. And they blocked the street off. Big Cat, it's a major street now. Yeah. It's a major fucking street. They let the pitiful ass nigga crayon fucking Black Lives Matter in the middle of the fucking street like it's a fucking memorial. These niggas know I'm not lying, but they so fucking pitiful and stupid. <laughs> Fuck you and your Black Lives Matter shit, you weak ass niggas. Oh, I want Big Cat. I wanted to spit on the shit when I saw it. I ain't gonna like little lock me up. Big Cat. I wanted to. Spit so on if if, it, if you was in Charlotte around that time, you didn't want to get your ass up. That's why. Yeah, no, you let, let, let sit up for a talk, Twan. You was in Charlotte around that time. So where you was working at, Leo? <laughs> Quiet. The motherfucker gets quiet. Big Cat, I'll send you a picture of it. You can see it for yourself. Well, you don't need no picture? I'll send you a picture of it, Big Cat. So you you know, that, that, that shit not even there. I'll send you a picture of it. How long ago? That shit was a long time ago. I'll send you a picture of it, Big Cat. I'll send you a picture of it. Send you a picture of nothing that don't even exist. I'll send you a picture of it, Big Cat. The same shit happened in D.C. They wasn't just doing that shit just in Charlotte. 
Man, look, this show is half sports, half gay porn. And then he said, Roof Chris, Leo, what street? What street is uh, Roof Chris on again, Leo? What street? You said North Tryon, right? You said North Tryon. North Tryon comes from North Tryon. Then, then you know, you can you got Graham. You can go to the plaza. You can go, you know, head to uptown. I could have sworn, because I, I was at Roof Chris this year. I could have sworn that shit was on South Tryon, Leo. Damn, Leo. He caught in another motherfucking lie. You know what? Oh man. With that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get off of here. This man a lot all night. They can't they can't see the pictures of me at Ruth Chris. He seen the pictures of me at Ruth Chris. <laughs> so I ain't gonna see them shit. This is facts. Not lies, um, sir. You not about damn North Graham. You probably talking about some fucking uh, it's a whole lot of shit that's on North Graham. But I, I damn sure bet you ain't no goddamn root Chris on no no on no no far. Uh, hey, sir, hey, somebody catch the pictures, somebody catch the pictures like he do. <laughs> With that being <laughs> said, I'm going to get get out of here. I'm gonna let Leo continue to lie to y'all folks for the rest of the night. His name ain't Leo. Well, whatever you want to call him, uh, uh, his name is Liar Liar to me. Until he, <laughs> it, 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 until he tells the truth, his name is Liar Liar, like got them Jim Carrey from the fucking movie. But with that being said. Uh, hope everybody have a great night. Keep pounding. Shout out to Big Cat, Twan Don, uh, 704. Uh, Unk, even though he ain't here right now, Ray Pabone, uh, Caleb Dixon. Uh, and uh, I, I hope we have a great season this year. But but that's depending on the defense. Mm-hmm. But, we, but, but, but we already know Sam Donald, Steve fucking ghost on the field. And got them Leo don't want to talk about that. No, liar, liar doesn't want to talk about that. But everybody have a great night. And it, look, as soon as, you, as soon as you get a chance, check out that uh, Forever Purge. That shit is fucking lit. We, hey, we're going to have a great season because Leo don't want us to. But thank you, sir. So I, 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 I hope we have a good season, too, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Black we're not, we're Black not with that bum-ass quarterback. We're not with that bum-ass quarterback. But everybody have a great night. You too, sir. Thank you, thank you sir. Fourth of July. I think I ran into you. That nigga was running around nah, with. Uh, uh, that nigga was, uh, was running around with a motherfucking flag. He, he's he's always on repeat. Nah, I just went to the. I went to Pete Mount Park and chilled out for a little bit. Nah, I just oh, okay. came you know, home and watched the movie. Okay, okay. Yeah, nah, I wasn't home. Uh, I went nah, to the That nigga was running around in a flag bikini with flip flops on, nigga. And fucking red, white, and blue good in his eyes. No, I, I just reminisced on how great the country was, brother. I'm thankful beautiful to be country, here. Beautiful country. Yes, sir. Beautiful country. Yes, sir. So you celebrate that on just a holiday? Won't you celebrate that every year, you, uh, Leo? You got to wait till July 4th to celebrate that? <laughs> Guess people take advantage of shit. Got to wait till a holiday come around to celebrate some shit. It should be uh, celebrating every day. God bless America. And no one else. That's what you want to say. I uh, say, nah, don't put that shit on me. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he want to say. And no one else. <laughs> so any more conversation about football? Uh, I don't know. You were never talking football. Yeah, any more conversation about football? No, I want to talk about the 4th of July. Mm-hmm. You going to have hot dogs and shit, bro, or what? What'd you say? You want to have hot dogs and shit up there? You said hot. So I didn't hear what you said, bro. Just off of July, <laughs> nigga. Hold on. Hold on, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let me get up here. I want to know about your 4th of July, man. Oh, no. I just I just chilled out. I'm going to be in my park and people watch a little bit. Watch everybody have a good time. You were chilling with the kids? Did you watch the kids, man? Yeah, you had to keep my project. What's special about that day? What's special about the 4th of July? I watched them. Um, some people hang out with their family, you know, fly some kites, you know, kiss their little children. Hey, what? Yeah, hey, yeah. look. Hey, hey, niggas. What the fuck was so special about the 4th of July? I grab, grab their wife, on the, grab their wife, wife on the ass, you know. Don't that sound like some stuff? He was watching families kiss their children and shit, like he was plotting on them. <laughs> yeah, you know, had a good time. What was so special about the 4th of July? July? That's what I want to know. The what happened? Nice what family. happened special on the Fourth of July? What was that? What was that day known? Other, and they could watch other nice. families while he ain't got no damn family. The weather, the weather was nice. <laughs> yeah. I just, you know, I, I talked talk to some of my family was on the phone. You know, yeah. hung out, you know, chilled out with myself, listened to some music, some documentaries and stuff. Did they have bands and shit out there? Did they have the bands and shit out there? 
Nah, nah, they didn't. They didn't have any vans out there. Nah, nah. Hmm. It was just put people outside, just having a good time, you know. But so, what you had like a port- oh. portable grill or something, bro? No, 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 no. I was just chilling on the bench, you know, just chilling out, you know, watching. Big cat, well, let's see. Yeah. Where that nigga tell you he lives, man? Where he tell you he lives? No, bro, he's staying in, um, what's his name? Where? Downtown, what'd you say, bro? And, 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 and Black Town, and, and Black... Mid, Midtown, bro. Midtown, Midtown. 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 And Black Town, too, that's where most of the fucking gay people live, and boom, 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 whatever. So that nigga was out there looking at fireworks, you know, with, like, big sparkly dicks in the, in the, in the sky. And, and balls and shit was like raining down on his head and shit. That's what that nigga was out watching. All they look, all they cooked was hot dogs and sausages. They ain't cooked no chicken and none of the other shit that men eat. You know. Now, Leo, somebody That's all the fuck that nigga was fucking with, nigga. Leo, somebody chat said, "Why do niggas celebrate Fourth of July anyway?" Can you want to want to take over that conversation? Well, people who celebrate the Fourth, it's just a fucking holiday. It ain't shit. I mean, but Big Cat, let me just tell you this though, Big Cat. Oh, yeah. Out of respect for you, I'm going to answer it, but for what the um, the young man is talking about, you know, but it's the, it's the, it's the inauguration of America's independence. Yeah. America's the greatest the fuck nation. Out of here. America's the greatest nation in the human history. America was created and founded by the creator, divinely um, inspired. America wasn't founded by shit, nigga. It was people already here. Big Cat. Yes, sir. I'm not even going to engage with this conversation. Oh, yeah. yeah. I want you to school the brother in the chat. School the brother in the chat. He need knowledge, bro. No, no, no. See, this is, this oh, is what this about. Somebody about. in the chat. Is yeah, somebody in the chat asked that question, talking about critical race theory. Because he knows this is why they're trying to uncorrect that stupid shit. Critical race theory is for, for weak people. And it's, it's, a, it's a bunch of lies. And it's and it's, and it's no, promulgated by women. Do you want men? Do you want to be critical race theory? Because all you any, do is what? Any any man that runs around and co-signs on this critical race theory stuff, he has to really question his masculinity. Mm. Because it's, it's so, nothing. It's nothing. So, it's, not, it's not. So it's, this it's thing not wants. Easy. Yeah. Call from Robert Foxworth. To accept, press. What's up, nigga? Fucking holiday. Hey, cut your TV down, back up, Robert. 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 When, when every nigga, when every nigga was a fucking slave. So that's this. So 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 you want to so you want to so, return? So you wanna revert, he wants, back? He wants you want to, to he wants to celebrate. So you black people it. literally are celebrate some shit that we weren't allowed to celebrate when it first started. You want to change history? Right. Change America history. was founded on fucking blood, bro. Change that change reality on fucking blood. So he no 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 that's what I'm saying. So he so he's proud of a holiday. Well, that black people were not even allowed to celebrate. What? We were still slaves. Tighten him up, Leo. Oh. Tighten his ass hey, up, Leo. Big Leo, big we got time tonight, Leo. We, we got time. We were slaves. We got time. We were slaves. Because it's an effeminate argument made by effeminate weak ass men. <laughs> this thing is me up. We were because it's an effeminate argument made by weak ass. Look at the fuck that's why I don't give a fuck about what nobody says about a, your answer. It's a weak, bitch. it's a weak that's argument. That's why I tell you, black Karen, because you a it's bitch. A, it's a weak argument. It's easy to talk shit when you ain't for. So Leo, yeah. what the fucking weak yeah. argument is true. That's right. So Leo, you were saying all that. So where was your niece at? <laughs> it's a weak ass argument promulgated by weak ass individuals. Leo, you were saying all that. So where, 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 where was your niece at? Did you say your niece lived with you now? In 1776, nigga, we, it was it was never slaves in this fucking country. Big cat. Yes, sir. The, these individuals who promote this shit. And a bunch of, they, no, they no, 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 big cat. You gonna hear the truth? You gonna hear? You gonna hear both sides of this big shit? Big cat. Right they won't say this. Shit <laughs> to get dudes, up, Leo. A bunch of white dudes with wigs in their fucking head set out and wrote laws up just for them. Big cat. Ain't nothing. We weren't doing shit in Africa, big cat. Cat. Africa ain't not, ain't Man, produced not a dumb. goddamn thing. Big cat. Africa ain't, produced, big cat. Africa ain't produced a goddamn thing that was useful <laughs> in civilization. The Egyptians were not. The Egyptians were not. They, they were not Nubians. They were a mixture of Arabs and blacks. They created the pyramids. 
the Africans in the middle of, middle of the continent ain't did shit. They still over there running around with bones in their fucking noses <laughs> fighting this shit. They ain't go. did a goddamn thing. There you go. So don't act like the bones in their noses. What, what tribe is that? What tribe is that, Leo? Oh, I, 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 I want to know. And like, and like me, nigga. So we the motherfucking Flintstones. We live in Bedrock now. Nigga, like me, nigga. And like me, what tribe wear bones and shit in their nose? Let me know. Let me in on this. Big Cat, name me Don't one thing. That, Big mean. Cat, name me one thing that came out of Africa that was great, brother. You uh, name me one thing. Black Panther, bro. That shit ain't real. <laughs> you can't, Big Cat, you can't tell a nigga that because he thinks. <laughs> they coming from that, ain't <sighs> Big Cat, Big Cat, these niggas went to the fucking. Bro, I'm telling movie. y'all. I'm telling y'all. This Black Karen, this motherfucker has got to be a totally different people in public. Because if he even said even a tenth of the shit he says on this show, this nigga would be dead. <laughs> and the same and the same thing you would say, fuck America, go out there to northern go out there to Tennessee talking that crazy shit. Yeah, and watch the white boys break my and, and the white boys break your fucking You know what? Living in America gives me the right to feel about it however I want to, motherfucker. Big cat, big cat, big cat. This motherfucker can't be enslaved my people, I'm supposed to love it. Big cat. We ain't supposed to be here. Big Cat, this Negro won't go to Asheville, North Carolina and That's talk true. that shit to them white boys to put a fucking boot in this nigga ass. <laughs> and you know why I'm going to go to Hidden Valley in Charlotte or they'll kill me, y'all. Big Cat, Big Cat, Big Cat, Big Cat. Yeah, man. Big Cat, this, this Negro won't go to Hidden Valley. I'm going to kill a couple of them motherfuckers before I go. Big Cat, this Negro won't go to Rome, Georgia and talk that shit to them white boys to kick his black ass back to fucking Rome. Let me tell you, let me, let me tell you something, old boy. I know I'm going to say this really. It ain't to get nobody. Nigga, nigga, I'm from Brooklyn, New York, bro. It ain't a fucking city out here that scares me, nigga. And I'm damn sure not going to be afraid nigga, of nigga, no nigga, fucking white man, bro. You ain't saying shit. That I'm damn sure I ain't going to be afraid of no white man. You can forget that shit. Be cat, be cat. We can go out guns blazing, nigga. We can go out guns fucking blazing. Yeah, Ask him why I moved from Brooklyn then. Why I live in Brooklyn now? That's a good question, bro. Why you live there now? Hello? Look at Brooklyn was gentrified in the middle of the early 2000s. Hey, nigga, Brooklyn. hey, look, don't you fuck. Hey, nigga, don't start talking about my fucking city. You better talk about that raggedy. Why you don't let it in? You better talk about that raggedy shit you went, nigga. Why you don't let it in? You better talk about that raggedy shit you from, bro. Why you don't let it in? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? This motherfucker, he always claims to know about every fucking city. Leo, why you don't live in Richmond no more, Leo? Why you don't live in Richmond no more? You don't even live in Richmond. Don't talk, don't talk shit about my city, nigga. Stick to yours. You say you're from Richmond County. Why you don't live in Richmond County? Big Cat. Yeah. Somewhere in the trailer, in, in the in the wood, in, in, the, in the goddamn woods, or in the backwoods. Because Richmond County is filled. Yeah, who this Call is? from? Hey. Who this is? Hey, what's up, Big Cat? What's going on? Who this is? This is T. Let me let you in. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah, I'm here, brother. I'm here. Man. Big Cat, they gent- look, big, big Cat, they gentrified Brooklyn mm-hmm. and they ran the niggas out because they outpriced them. So the niggas ran to the they, south. So they ain't gentrified shit. Nigga. The niggas can't afford it, bro. Man, get out they of here. Swan, Brooklyn is you to walk down the fucking street in Brooklyn. Yeah, fucking fucking fuck that, bro. I'm not arguing with you. You don't even know what you're talking about. I'm not even arguing with you. Big Cat, big cat, big cat. They gentrified Brooklyn. They ran the niggas out. They pushed the niggas to the Bronx and pushed the niggas to well, fucking um. White Plains could have outpriced them niggas, and some of the niggas went down south. Damn, they, can't. they ran them out of their own shit. What about the black people that was in Tulsa? They had their own that's a lot. project. That's a lot. They had their own building up, oh, and yeah, got talking about white people. So and now you can told... say that niggas ain't doing nothing. What are you talking about, man? Hey, hey, I told him about that the other night. He didn't want to discuss that Tulsa shit. He didn't want to. He wanted to change subject. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm talking about. Look, 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 we even when we shit. grow, even when we grow shit. our own shit, even when we grow our own gardens, even when we own our own business, we own our own city, them white motherfuckers were so jealous 
<laughs> when they <laughs> came and burned our shit down, you didn't want to be around yeah. it. We know they destroyed. We, they destroyed. They destroyed. They like I lived here in Wilmington, North Carolina, in eighteen ninety eight. Everything was black owned, and we know they said they we came in and it. destroyed it. We produced they it. They destroyed our own we black business. We produced it. I'm talking about football. Reproduce it. You know, know, know what happened? When we reproduced it, it in 1898, it was done. 1942, it. they destroyed it. Every reproduce time it. we reproduce, they destroy. Do well, you not you understand do- that? What you, so what you still doing here then? Why don't you just fucking leave? Mm. Oh, but Cal, let me tell you something. Oh, 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 hey, right. I'm, 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 if you want me to leave, don't buy my plane ticket. If you buy my plane ticket, I'll leave. That's it. Oh, right. Hey, Big Cat, since you like to give you a lot of information, Big Cat, let me let me give you one sentence, all right? All right. One sentence. How about this? Get back to football. Tulsa, Let's get back no, to football. The, the, Tulsa, the Tulsa massacre, since this country is so great, was the worst massacre in this country ever. No, it was not. You no, are wrong on that. The Wilmington Wil- 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 was worse, brother. Wilmington Wil- was worse. No, nah, man, Tulsa was I the worst one, bro. Well, well, Wilmington was the worst one. Most people got it. I mean, I don't want to compare apples to apples. But look, it, it, it's on the books, and you from Wilmington, Wilmington is going to think it's that. Motherfuckers in Alabama well, think they started running by and motherfuckers in New Orleans think they started. I don't know. But both of the fucking events was fucking horrible. And it was niggas who all went in there, all their own shit. And, this, and the only answer this nigga got from, from, from people that he saw lazy and don't get their shit is reproducing. Reproduce it. That's just reproduce it. Mm-hmm. Okay, so so every the time we produce, they destroy. So well, what so are you saying? So how so, do we fight the reproduction every time it gets destroyed? Leave we're them. destroying ourselves right now because leave. what we're yeah, doing to leave? each other is wrong. Leave. This is so bad. Just leave. Mm-hmm. Buy my plane ticket. I will leave. I will. There you go, you ready? Where you want to go? <laughs> brother Leo, brother, brother, where you want to go, brother? I send you the money right now. I buy a ticket. Where we want to go? You got a password? Wow. No, oh, no, no, oh, no, no, no. I want to go to eat. I want to go to eat. Bro, hey, you gonna pay, you gonna pay for my plane ticket and my passport? And some of the shit we were talking about when they cut the black people was saying, "Bro, bro, 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 I, well, oh, you you hey, hey, back, how about this, Leo? How about Leo? Like Leo, what, what, now, what are you doing to rebuild? Bro, what are you doing to rebuild, Leo? Yo, oh, this nigga ain't working here. He don't do shit with the. He, he don't do nothing with the black community. He already told you that. Bro, when you leave, you can't come back now. I'll buy this one way ticket now. You ready? You gonna send a spirit airline? You gonna send a spirit airline? What are you doing? Hey, Bobby, you want to do that, nigga? Bobby, you want to? You got that kind of money? Bobby, you want to? There's no problem, sir. Whenever you're ready. You can't go back now. It's a one way ticket now. Leo, Leo, what are you doing to help the black community? You want to send a spirit airline? You want to send a it's a one-way ticket. I'm doing nothing. He's not going to answer that question because he's not doing nothing. I'm not doing nothing. I'm trying to get out of here. I'm trying to get out of here. I'm trying to get out of here. Leo's a troll. I'm not a troll. I don't, I'm not interested hey, in helping hey, you, nigga. Hey, hey, Sammy. I'm not interested if in helping Leo's you, nigga. Leo's a troll. Put troll up in the chat. I'm not he's trying to troll. I don't, I'm not interested in helping you, nigga. You are a troll. I'm not interested in helping you, nigga. I'm not interested in helping you, nigga. Oh, wait, 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 wait. How about this, Leo? Well, somebody's gonna hurt you badly. Bro. What can we do you badly, to fix the black community? You have a trick of being a black man. I'm not interested in helping you self loathe the niggas. I'm not. Mm-hmm. I don't care about you. I want you to get away from me. Mm. I want so to live you don't want to you around you. I want to live around people that are upwardly mobile and not complaining. But he'll call in and want to talk to you back and forth like this. No, everybody complain, bro. No, I just want to talk about football. I don't want to talk about football. I want to talk about the defense of the Carolina Panthers. No, no, no. no. They're going to talk about the defense of the Carolina Panthers. He's going to talk about the defense of the Carolina Panthers. He's going to talk about the defense of the Carolina Panthers. He's going to talk about the defense of the Carolina Panthers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't call in to talk to you, Negro. I told this nigga gay, bro. I don't call to talk to you, Negro. Oh, this nigga's a foodie. This nigga's hey, a foodie. Hey, but Leo, hey, Leo, oh, it's cool. I understand that you're one of those people who wants to step outside the black community and live your life. And that's fine. Do what you do. But yes, but you, 
you don't have any answers for the black community, and that's fine. I have an answer. Have I got an answer. You, an answer. you want an answer? You want an answer, sir? You want an answer, sir? I got an answer. You want the answer, brother? Get an answer, answer, bro. Get an answer, answer. You want the answer, brother? You ask for the answer. You want the answer? I'm waiting. Leave <laughs> so <laughs> fucking bad. Just fucking leave. <laughs> if, Why if, do if, I have to leave? Because Why? you talk. Wait, 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 because wait. you talk Why like a bad. Why do I have to leave? You're talking to live about. Here? You're Why talking like leave? a. Because you're talking like a battered wife. Mm, shit. No, no. Why I gotta leave? Why because do I have to leave? If I, if I live in this country, if I pay taxes, if I raise kids like in this country, you. why do I have Shut to up. leave? Shut it's like I told you earlier, Shaq. But what did the British I'll, do when they... I don't need... I don't need the white people... Ain't nobody the fucking British. This nigga just talking about the British. I don't need the white people going to fuck back to Europe. It's Big Cat's daddy. Are you thinking Big Cat's dick? Nobody give a fuck what the British did. Motherfuckers ain't British. Quit running Big Cat. Talk to me. My name is Pete. Talk to me. He told this nigga, man, like he ain't no man about this shit. He trying to be on his knees. He, did, he did don't even know how to talk to the motherfucker like a man, did, did bro. Mention, did, did, you a mention, did you mention your taxes? Did you say you pay taxes, so you feel it's unfair, right? If you, I'm a self-employed individual. I get my you, own business. You say you pay taxes, so you don't feel you don't feel properly represented. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. No, no, that no. I didn't say that. So so you just say you pay taxes. No, don't, what did you say don't, that? No, don't what did, do that. Well, well, what did don't you say do that. that for? What don't did you do mention? that. What did you don't, mention no, taxes? No, 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 why don't do that. Mention, why did you mention? Why did you mention? Why did you mention taxes, sir? Why did you mention you pay taxes? Why did you mention that? This ain't gonna die, man. Because when Tell I pay taxes, <laughs> that means I pay for the woman's house that you're not paying for. That she's on welfare. I'm taking care of your woman. Oh. He ain't got a woman. Big cat. So you say he's a man. Big cat, you here, yeah, I'm here, brother. Big cat. Quick on the big cat. Leave big cat. big cat out of this. Keep this tying them up, Leo. and you. Big cat, are you there, bro? Yeah, tighten them up, bro. Oh, big he's cat. running. Quit running. No. Big cat. Yeah. Quit the, running. The, the I'm going to need Chad Zilla to oh, make no, us something no, out of that. Oh, no, you want to run a big cat? Big cat. The big cat. Big cat. Chad Zilla, chop oh, that up. We're going to tie it in or something. Big cat. 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 Big Call him Big Daddy, Leo. Might Call him Big Daddy. Hook or something. Big Cat, Big Cat. How many, how many plane cat. tickets are you Big buying, Daddy. Leo? How many plane tickets are you buying? Big Cat, Big Cat. Because every time you run, that's what you do, Leo. You run. Big Cat, Big Cat. Call him Big Daddy. Call him Big Daddy. Yeah, what's up, nigga? And that's what cowards do. When the British felt that they were... Then we gonna make some money off Leo and we ain't gonna get that one cut. When the British felt they were... that's what cowards do. When the, when the British felt they were and, under And that's what powers do. Nobody don't when give they, a fuck about what the British did, nigga. Ain't nobody the British. Yeah, nigga. I'm going to tell you. We don't have to help the yeah. black community, but you don't want to help the black community. You I'm say, about what oh, the British go did. back to Africa. Go back somewhere else. But, Leo, one thing you want to do is be suppressed. That's big what you cat. want to yes, do. This, this is why... Oh, oh, no, call him Big Daddy. Call him Big Daddy. Don't big call him cat. Big this, Cat. This is why they had to buy me no. the totem pole. You know, they they call you don't run. Don't run now. Don't run. Had, you they they don't run. Your, mama, your, your mama and daddy was at the bottom of the totem pole. So what, what is it matter? <laughs> they don't have the ability. Don't run, Leo. Don't run, Leo. They was in that same pole. You got to call you Zaddy or bro. They were in the same pole. You don't get to call you Black Cat, bro. You got to call you Zaddy or something, nigga. Leo thinks because he had a basketball goal in the back of his yard, that meant something. I don't want to know why we had yeah. to buy them to the totem pole. You probably don't give a fuck about that cheap ass basketball goal that you got from this family. I'm saying, what? I'm saying, what? Tell me why the nigga is at the bottom of my family pole. What's your goal, Leo? What's your goal? To get away from you. Come on, what's your goal, Leo? To get away, to get away from y'all. Then leave the country, nigga. Leave the country. Leave. If you yeah, you me, nigga. Leave. You know you leave. Leave. <laughs> Leo, yeah. you don't want to leave. Huh? Yeah, why, why you want to leave the beautiful you, you country, Leo? You think it's only 13 percent of the population? You, live, you only live in 13 oh, no, 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 no. in the city. Oh, oh, you want to leave? Go You think you go to leave? You go to Montana. You leave. You go to leave. You go to my. You go to Montana. You can go to Salt Lake City. You can go. You can go, you can go to boy, nigga. You go to Moscow. You go to Europe. Leave. No, I'm not going to leave. You go to Texas. 
This is my country. <laughs> That's right, Leo. This Tell him again. Country. Tell him again, Leo. This is your country. This, this is my country, and I love it here. Yeah, I'm I fucking right. You damn right. Tell him, Leo. This is my country, too. Because you're crying. You're crying like fucking women. Leave. Ain't nobody, leave. Crying. Ain't nobody crying. crying. Ain't nobody crying. Ain't nobody crying. You're crying. I'm not no, crying. crying. Get them cash out. She said he don't want to be around us. He's crying. Nigga, you leave, bitch. You don't go I, somewhere. Go to Sideline or some yeah, shit. I, 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 I left him around you. Get him out of here. I left him around you. Get him the first thing smoking. Get up out of here. I'm up. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. You get up out of here. Let's, and then let's, 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 let's deal with the fight. And you leave. Get up out of here. You leave. Let's leave, nigga. Let's leave. My neighbors are not black. Wow, congratulations. How did you pull that off? You must got a hug. A little bit of extra money. But you mess up there. It's worth it, huh? Thank you, bro. Thank you. I made it. I made it. I made it. I made it. They breaking in your shit, bro. You made it. 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 You What's your address? What's your address? Oh, shit, man. Nigga, slip right to that back door. You have a nigga right there. You have a nigga right there. You have a nigga right He's staying in the gated community with his door open that he hates. Right. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. What's your address? What's your address? You see him, Dick Cat? You see him? Look at that. You hear him? So wait a minute, bro. You he, see, you he stays in a community where he don't like, and he sleeps with the door open. <laughs> 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 hey, you don't get this nigga chill, man. Oh, you don't get this nigga chill, bro. bro. You can't have nothing around Negroes. Yeah. Leo said, come, come right on in. You don't get this nigga chill, bro. Enter, enter and exit this way. Come right on in. Now, now Leo, do you got the security out there? Y'all got security in your neighborhood, like the little team or whatever? No, it's, it's, a, it's a code you got to put in. You got to have, like, a key. Oh. Like, uh, yeah, that shit yeah. works. Big cat, big cat, don't you think he Thomas lied. Davis had that same type of shit? <laughs> he lied, he lied, he lied. <laughs> he had a code to get this label. Yeah. Big cat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like that shit works. He lied, he lied, he lied. Yeah. You can't get in. You can't get in without somebody <laughs> letting me let you in. Leo leaving that for some reason. You leaving that for some reason. You can't get in without you letting me in now. You can't get in without me. Man, those ain't, but, uh, the yeah. man does ain't, ain't like that now. Somebody gonna get in there yeah. before they gonna get in. But, but you, had a, you, you had a nigga talk. The niggas talk like, oh, yeah. you can't even get in now. Hey, get in. you can get in because you don't live with Thomas Davis. Just be real. Just be real. That's a fact. That's why we know. He ain't really saying nothing, though, Leo. Leo, you're mad at us because we defend black people. If you're so mad at us, why are you still here for us fighting for us? I'm why did you mad. leave? The I'm not mad. I'm not mad at all. But listen, listen gentlemen. Yeah, yeah. Real, he's real, sounding real mad. I'm not yeah, mad. Yeah, gentlemen, yes. gentlemen listen, listen real quick, though. No, nah, we don't want to listen because you don't live in a community like Thomas Davis do. So we don't want to hear none of that shit. Listen, gentlemen, listen, listen real quick. No, nah, I was right, flushing listen, the toilet. All listen, all listen, these, all shit. flushing hey, the all shit. These, no, no, listen. All these black people come together to talk about sports. But his dumb black ass can't stay away. And he keeps saying he don't want to be around us. So you leave, nigga. Listen, gentlemen, real don't quick. Don't ever come real back. Quick. Listen, real quick. I do apologize for calling you nigga. Why the fuck do you want to be a part of a nigga show? No, no, no. I do apologize. Nobody wants your apology no, or accept nobody. it. No, nobody. No, I do apologize for calling any of you. Why do you want to be a part of a nigga show? Like I'm saying, you're saying you're sorry for too much, nigga, and you're 45. No. Listen, no, listen, no, it's not an it, ain't, it ain't no, no, I, I do it ain't no, it ain't no quality, it ain't I no quality apologize. white shows you can go to out there. I do apologize for saying that word. Hey, hey, it ain't no quality white shows you can attend. I do apologize. Why you keep coming back? Why you keep coming back when you know it's nothing but niggas? I do apologize for using that word towards any of you that you guys are not that. None of you are niggers. That word is inappropriate, and I do apologize. Leo, what the fuck you doing, niggers. bro? Man, no, no, but, no, no, big cat. Because I, I said that too easily. I mean, because I don't know these guys to say that to them. So even even well, if it's like a, be, even, be real. Even, 
Just, just to be real, just to be real. If, if you're tired of us fighting for what we believe in, and you're tired of that fight, why not you just leave the country and go someplace they'll accept you? You ain't got to leave I, the country. Just leave I'm this a, show, I'm, a, I'm an American citizen. Right, right. Leo, tell them, Leo. I'm accepted. What are you talking about? Tell them, Leo. I so, have no so problem. Why tell us, so why tell us yeah, to leave? Yeah, we don't want to fight. Because, because, fight we want to fight. fight. What, what are you fighting against? What do you mean you're We're accepted? fighting for... Do you, do, you, do you know what redlining is? Do you understand how... But you're you going to get this nigga killed, bro. Oh, you're going to get this nigga killed, bro. You, how about you fight Thank against... <laughs> how, about you, how about you go to South Florida? How about you go to South Florida and fight against the you person? You keep pumping this nigga up, bro. I'm trying to tell you. What do you, what do you hey, mean? Bro. What do you mean? You're tell him, Leo. Go ahead, Leo. Finish it, 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 Leo. Big cat, big cat. Check this out. How about you go to McAllen, Texas? No, Big Daddy. They call him Big Daddy. Call him Big Daddy. Don't call him Big Daddy. Call him Big Daddy. Quit how doing that. Call you Quit daddy, doing that. How about you Negroes go to South Texas and climb over the wall? Hey, bro. Everything I predicted about this nigga is like, show, man. I'm telling y'all. Well, I just sit back and listen sometimes. Look, you it see, just feels good to hear other people reminisce what I'm saying. I, just, I, don't even talk, I don't even talk as much as this. I'm just, I knew you would catch on to realize who this motherfucker was, bro. You got you know, it. So yeah, black people ain't moving back to no fucking. What do you mean by he's accepted? I'm still trying to. Black people ain't moving back to no fucking Africa until white so people pitiful. move the fuck back to Europe. You're so pitiful. You're so pitiful. Oh, yeah. Are you ready for this? Tell Native me. Native Americans no, want right. us here. He's right. He's right. He is right. Every so time they say go back to Africa, go back to fuck Europe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Because y'all are right. you, Leo, you're European. Go back to Europe. How about you go to South Texas? And Leo, you want to hope they let your black ass come over there with him, too. Big Cat, how about yeah. you go that? How about they ask him to go to South Texas mm -hmm. and trade places with the Mexicans that's trying to come over here? There you go. How about that? There you go. How about that? But you're such a stupid people. Mm -hmm. And such a... Like such, I said. Such, such, such like a I said. Wait, 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 before... wait, explain that. Explain that. Explain that. How, how are we stupid? How are we stupid? Tell me, Leo. Oh, my God. I just told explain you. Explain How are we stupid? Explain that. Because a gentleman wrote a book called The Bell Curve. Where you get a chance no, to I know, no, 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 no. Yeah, I think but I got a Barnes and Noble, man. Let him speak for himself, man. He a bitch ass nigga. Let him speak for himself. Hit them like buttons and hit them cash apps. Go to South Texas. Fuck Leo, what he talking about? Go to go to McAllen, Texas, uh -huh. and climb the wall. Nigga ain't never been no wall. Let Leo, let Leo talk. Stop referring back to Big Cat. Pass the pass the Mexican climbing over the wall. You pass him going back over the wall. How about that? Let's see that. Let's see you niggas do that. Let's see you do that. Now what's that book? What would that prove? What would that prove? Yeah, yeah, you remember what Judge uh, what Judge Brown was talking about on on the Brown show? It proves that you have no no self awareness at all. Mm. It just proves that. Leo's one of them. Leo's one. You're making no fucking sense. And you're talking I've like been women. here for 50 fucking years. You're talking like women. I've been here for 50 years. You're talking like women. This is all I know. I left because I joined the military. I left. I don't hear the one that's on the line. That's you. Old bullshit. You can't, like hey, women. you can't, you can't have an, you can't have an opinion. You're acting like a woman. You can't talking have an like, opinion. No, 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 not, not an illogical opinion. Because only women think illogically. You guys are talking illogically. Well, so what's, what, what, what's your, your logic is? Go to Mexico. That's your logic. No, beat the Mexican climbing over the wall. You beat him going over his wall to his country. You do that. Let me see you do that. You what's go. your so? What's your logic for the black community? We gonna up. climb your gated fence and raid your house. That's what we gonna do for y'all. Well, he would he would act like so. <laughs> according according to him, he never lived in no black neighborhoods like that. So how the fuck? What would he know about it? And since, and since we and since you told everybody that you leave your door, but we know what we which door to come to. <laughs> well, what I, well, what I'm trying to, what I'm really trying to get up out of Big Cat. I'm gonna look, look. If, if y'all really want to put some money in, then send Big Cat some money to get Leo's number. Because we Big Cat got gonna that shit. We gonna beat that fat dude that's the security guard in the front because he ain't saving nobody. And, and nigga, when you got a phone number, you can find any nigga. You can find where he is, where he lives. It ain't hard. I know hackers. Hey, big cat. No, yeah, look, fuck all that. I'm still trying to figure out how he accepted. He said he was accepted. I'm still trying to. I'm still trying to. Hey, y'all send me a thousand dollar. I'll leave this nigga number. 
Send me thousand dollars, I'll leak this nigga number. Thousand dollars. On God, bro. Thousand dollars. Right now. Thousand dollars. I'll leak this motherfucker right now for a grand. Thousand dollars. This point, bro. I, I answer your question. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead, go ahead. Ask your question, sir. I said, I'm listening, sir. I'm listening. Do you love America? <laughs> God damn right, Leo. I don't know. Do you you love the way that. Africans came to America, was enslaved. The whole nope. thing about it, the Jim Crowism. You love all of that, don't you love? I love the freedom That's right. that America affords me. You fucking right. Say it again. So when the freedom happen for black people? I love the freedom that America affords me. That's right. Brother. As a citizen. When when did, when did that happen? I love the freedom that America affords me as a citizen, sir. There you go. I heard that. I'm asking you, when did that happen? Tell them again. I dude. love the freedom that America affords me as a citizen. Look who's been a bitch now. I celebrated. Look who's been a bitch now. I have celebrated the inauguration of the country Sunday. Oh, God damn Sunday. right you did. So you love 1776. All right, look. Look, man. Stop with the bullshit. Clean K. Drop a nigga a clean K. We get what you want. Cash out, take up to 5000 all right? Cash out, let you send up to 5000 I know, I know the limit. Drop me a K and I'll leak shit. I'm doing shit for free. Fuck I look like, nigga. <laughs> clean K. Clean K. Send me a clean K to get this shit leak out. Clean K though. God damn, you motherfuckers ain't got no money? God damn. That's a thousand dollars divided by Hold on, let me get my cat. Thousand dollars. Ninety eight of you motherfuckers. Tell you motherfucker send a hundred dollars in. If you want to divide it down to the simplest form, clean K, my nigga. Hurry the fuck up, man. It's two thirty in the morning. Send that fucking money in. Leo, tell him how great our fucking country is, Leo. Hey, brother Leo. Leo, yes, Leo, Leo, the people Leo, in the chat, just, 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 just to get the people in the chat. Okay, bro, you you, 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 you going to be a bigger household name than this once this shit over with, because he called your name fucking a thousand times. No, 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 it's cool. Show, hold on, hold on. Leo, Leo, the people in the chat want to know, you, just just for real, are you not on medicine, are you? I'm, I'm a whole. Yes, bro. You're not on medicine, are you? He, he wasn't telling me what he is. I'm telling you I'm thinking about wiping the hands. You, you, said, you said medicine? Yeah, some people are saying that you, they think you may be on psychotrophine or something. Some kind of... Yeah. No, 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 Big Cat. Can I get my answer? Go ahead, brother. <laughs> Big Cat, this nigga, this nigga is on psychotrophic. This nigga is on Halidol. I'm telling you, yo, the way this nigga talks, no regular people don't talk like him. He's sick. He said, he said medicine. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, brother Leo. Big cat, big cat, yeah, brother. Yeah, I'm here, nigga. Go ahead. The, the the reason why they think that is because they're so ignorant and worthless as a people. Now I want to talk to Big about football. They're so, they so I, I, I want to talk about the defense of the Carolina Panthers. Man, fuck that defense. That, that time over. That time over. There. You had calling before one. Let's yeah, get back to this. Now, nigga, nigga, are you on? Are you on drugs, bro? He don't say the Soviets, right? No, 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 no. The, 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 the oh, big cat, the black Why American. Why do you, 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 why
Yeah. 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 Big Cat, can I answer the question? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? This nigga's on circuit choking. So either, so either he's strong guy or he's just been stupid and that's still a problem. Mm-hmm. Uh, now cat, say Big Cat again. Yeah, go ahead, bro. <laughs> <laughs> can I answer the question, yeah, brother? Go ahead. Now say Big Cat again. Go ahead. Big Cat, can I answer the question? Yeah, go ahead, brother. He can't stop himself. He can't stop himself. This motherfucker's on circuit choking, bro. I ain't never heard the word I'm medicine saying before. It. Medicine? I'm saying it, bro. Hey, hey, chat, no joke. Hey, chat, no joke. Chat. Hey, I'm out. Chat, no joke. You, you, hey, chat, you know my feel, bro. No joke. Yeah. But, man, narcissistic, narcissistic motherfuckers be on second chokers, bro. I'm trying yeah, to tell you, bro. Go ahead, Leo. Answer the question. <laughs> Leo, man, answer, bro. I mean, I'm not. Them motherfuckers yeah. immediately said 100%. Yeah, that's, that's, okay. I, can't, I, can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't say nothing. Them motherfuckers said 100%. Big Cat, I can't say nothing. Go ahead, put these niggas in their place. <laughs> no, man. No, they won't let me say nothing. No, 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 you, you're you dominant. You need to take over. They, they are so well, hold feminine. Hold on, hold on. What'd you say? Hey, Cat, hold on. What's your name, bro? Go ahead, Leo. I know you niggas say this nigga was dumb. <laughs> they so, they so, they so effeminate. They so effeminate that they can't. I know you niggas say this nigga was dumb. You heard, you heard what I said. You now heard look, what I said. You hey, hey what get your money, but don't, don't make this nigga believe he's dumb. You ahead, heard Leo. what he said. Go ahead, Leo. You heard what he said. <laughs> you heard, you heard what he said. But you're so effeminate. You have so much feminine energy that you keep running off at your mouth. You never let nobody I get a word in your mouth. I heard what he said, but I'm also saying what he's right and he's trying to get paid to get rid of your ass. But, but, Twan, at least I afford you the opportunity to speak. I don't yell over you. I don't interrupt you. I let you speak. Man, that's a motherfucking lie. And you are a lie, nigga. And you, don't, and you still haven't answered the fucking question. If you hate motherfuckers so much, why do you continue to put yourself through this and keep coming back? Is there, is there not a quality white show out there that you can call in and be around your pals and shit? I mean, you're still talking. Well, Leo, the, the audience want to know, are you on drugs, bro, on medicine? And it brings me back to it. You see? That's what it goes back to. And it brings me back to it. And, and, and let, me let, you know, let me let you know why he doesn't hang out with his pals. Because <laughs> white people on these Panther shows have kicked his ass off. That's not a joke. Some no fucking porn and shit. These niggas don't fuck with him. And as a matter of fact, one of them shows told us your name wasn't even fucking real. I said your name was Van. All I know, we have a problem. We just take it to the chat, and the chat spoke tonight. Big Cat is so they, they he's so effeminate that he can't keep his emotions under wraps. Yeah, nigga, yeah. you on drugs, nigga. Yeah. He's not right now, I'm telling this motherfucker need to be in a fucking facility, bro. Right? Big Cat, he can't keep his mouth closed at all. <laughs> Leo, I guarantee you, I bet this nigga ain't got, Big Cat, I'm there for real, I bet this nigga ain't got no job, I guarantee you this nigga's living in the basement of his grandma's house, you know what I'm saying, he's a trailer, I'm telling you, this motherfucker, he, look, he's sick, he comes on here and paints his picture of himself, but the thing he can't do is he can't get on camera, because you would have to, you would get a chance to see how he actually looks, and how he's really living, so he oh. ain't gonna do that. Did y'all hear He's about our other football player. team? Did y'all hear about our other football team? The soccer team? They got a head coach now. Man, I don't give a fuck about no soccer. <laughs> his name is his name is Miguel. Well, they still... I know you didn't stop us for that shit. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the niggas going to be at the bank. The niggas might want to pull up and grab down and watch the soccer. Hey, remember y'all going to one fucking soccer game. Nigga, we ain't watching that shit. Shit, I might pull up and go out there. You're going to pull up to a soccer game. Yeah. Hey, big Cat, Big yeah. Cat, are you there, brother? Yeah, what's the name of that book, man? Because I might want to go to Barnes & Noble tomorrow. That sounds like a good read. What is it called again? Just like Chad Zilla. On, on, now, I said Chad Zilla. Just like Shell's Kitchen is in the city again this weekend with the seafood oh. uh, mac and cheese. Hey, Leo. You going to be in Raleigh? Nah, the city. He's going to be in Charlotte. Hey, Leo. Oh, shit, yeah, man. Hey, yeah, right, right. what's the name of that though. fucking book you, you were telling me about? I want to go read it. What's it called? You don't remember nah, what you just said? Have... You talking about a book? You said a book that the they book, was going to read. The book is called My Daddy Won't Stop Touching Me. 
No, no, no. Oh, wait, oh, what, what was that? What, what was what was the context? What I was talking about? I forget. Some racist shit, but it sounded good, man. You say it was what now? Some racist shit, but but it sounded good. What? Oh, it's called it's called the bell curve. Bell the curve. Was, okay. Now yeah, spell the, that. The book was written. The bell. B e l c r b e. The book was written. You don't get around to throw that shit, nigga. The, 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 really? The cat, the cat, real quick though. Yeah. The, cat, the book was written. Look at that. He really trying to say you don't know how to spell that shit for real. Go ahead, Leo. See how. You see, the big cat, the book was written by a Caucasian male. Okay. The premise of the book was... Yeah, we know, nigga. Hey, you watch the names, nigga. Richard Herrnstein and Charlie and Charles Murphy. Big cat. Yeah. The premise of the book was... Did y'all see the other news today? With the Tampa Bay Lightning, they, they, they won the Stanley Championship. So does that mean Tampa Bay going to win back-to-back the Super Bowls? And Tampa Bay what? won the championships? The, the hockey shit? Wow. They won it last year. Wow, that's good. I wouldn't be surprised. And they won in 2004. And the fucking baseball team was in the World Series last year. Well, if you guys are looking to check this out, the book is... It says it's a controversial book linking intelligence to class and race and modern society. Big Cat, cat, there you go. Big Cat. Check it out, Big Cat. I think I'm going to read this. Check that book out, Big Cat. Cat, I already read the book. I can see you my copy. You ain't even got to pay for it. No, nah, I want to. I want to do the responsible thing and pay for it. Nigga, you don't want to. You don't want to buy this bullshit. Just read it. I right? mean, it looks good. It says, it's, "What is it about Lincoln intelligence to race and class?" Mm-hmm. No, 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 no. You know what? You know what? I read the book. Let's let Black Karen talk about it since he knows so much about it. So I can check his ass when he lies. No, let 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 him tell you what what it's about. Let's go. Big Cat, get the book and read it for yourself. Yeah, I'm going to get it to no, you. No, 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 no. Like Big Cat said he just wants a little synopsis. He just want to know a little bit no, about no, what no, no, sir, no, about. sir, no, sir, no, sir, no. No, 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 tell him, no, tell him. No. Tell him what it's about, Leo. No, no. Tell him what it's about, Black Cat. No, no. Big Cat. He wants you to, so he literally wants you to read some shit that he ain't read. Big Cat, you see how feminine he is? He can't control his emotions. <laughs> That's all he do is yell all night. All he do is yell. Hey, I, 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 yes, I don't mean to. I don't, I, I don't mean to get in between no, no, no domestic. Well, you know, I I don't want to say. Look, I don't want to. I don't want to get in between no, no, no domestic shit. You know what I'm saying? Because you know. I, <laughs> All you do is you ain't never got nothing good to say, so let somebody speak over you. All you do is yell like a female. You, you never got nothing good to say. I don't, don't, don't want to get into it with you and your bottom bitch, so, you know. All you do is yell like a female. I say that, hey, I say everything respectfully. Control your emotions, sir. Stop being Leo can't even come on the show nightly and daily, but yet I ain't never heard a nigga speak anything about it. How many times are y'all hear this nigga yelling about nothing? All you do, all you do is cut people off. You yell, you show your emotions. Just like a female. You don't know better. He he talks about penises. I mean, what the fuck, man? Hey, 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 Charles, you want to hear? Whoa. <laughs> you know, you know right, that's that saying when they say you never go where you're not wanted. Why the fuck does this nigga keep showing back up? And he don't, and he don't argue. I, I, I enjoy talking to Big Cat. No, 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 no. But Big Cat ain't the only one on here, bro. You, you enjoy talking to another man like right that? You can do that on your all time, just like you did on Father's Day. Yeah, you just can't let me on the day off and do that shit. Don't wait for the show to do it. I enjoy communicating the big, the big cat. Yeah. I enjoy the big, big cat. Man, look, look, when they got therapy sessions for Father's and Son's Day, they have a problem. Nigga, charge me. Nigga, charge you like you was in jail. I also enjoy communicating. I can give you a, I can give you a, a few pointers and shit. If you don't make that, I'm gonna go sit down and talk to somebody. I don't do it with that. You know what? I enjoy communicating with the, yeah. the YouTube. Hey, look, I can send you some leads, and you and Big Cat need to go sit down and talk to somebody. Oh, yeah. I enjoy communicating with YouTube. I got all father son issues and shit. Well, I'll tell you, you what. I, I, all he does is talk, Big Cat. All well, Lee, I gotta talk. give it to you. You're very composed. That's one thing you're consistent about. You yeah, know? because because I because because I'm a man. No, he ain't. He's <laughs> never composed. He's always yelling and crying about something. Because I'm a man. Yeah, you know what it is. You're very you know composed. Call from. Hey. 
To accept, press 1. Who is this? Hey, it's T, man. What's up, T? The Mitchell here. Walking the Bachelor. Hey, bro. Bro. Get <laughs> a Shout out to Jerome. Destruction of a Black Civilization by exactly. Pastor Williams. This nigga is chaos. Is he going to read the bell curve? Yeah. Read that book. What's the name of the book? Of Black Civilization by oh, no, Mr. Williams. Hold on, what's the name of the book? Hold on, what's the name of the book, brother? Hold on, brother, what's the name of the book? Destruction of a Black Civilization by Chancellor Williams. Oh, okay. That's a good book. I didn't read all of it. I got about halfway through. Sounds like a good book to make a bonfire with. <laughs> Hope it don't cost me much. Does it cost more than a Kindle wood? Remember? <laughs> oh, what are, you are, you are you black? Are you black? You said it, I did. <laughs> I, I, don't, I, don't, I know you niggas don't. What's it all? No, no, you said it, nigga. You said we were stupid. Do you want the proof? Hey, Carla, they want to know what's the name, what's the name of the book again? Destruction <laughs> of a Black Civilization yeah. by huh? Chancellor Williams. It's called Firewood. <laughs> By Lowe's or Home Depot. Should be next to the charcoal. <laughs> um, who was what it called? Who, who, who was an agent? John Henry Clark. John Henry agent. Clark. John Henry Clark was an agent who taught back to Africa and out of Africa theory, which is wrong. John Henry Clark was an wait, agent. Wait, 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 John Henry Clark. Now, 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 this dude is a he, he's a professor. Bro, he's agent. wrong. He don't like and and Leo. Agent. Look, Black Karen don't like black people. He can't. They can be they can be the smartest people on the planet. He ain't gonna like them. He ain't gonna give them credit. John he's just like fucking Skip Bayless when it comes to LeBron. He's not gonna give him no credit. No, wait, 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 that he was an agent. John what Henry Clark was taught by Caucasians. He went to school. Taught by Caucasians. <laughs> he taught and that the out book of you recognize was by Caucasians. Out, out of Africa theory, John Henry Clark <laughs> promoted that. But That's the a book lie. You recommended was by a Caucasian, right? John Henry Clark promoted out of Africa theory. That hey, is, Black Karen is, is a black girl. girl. Hey, no, he's, no, hey, he's no, a black no, girl. No, no, that was Margaret Sanger. Margaret no. Sanger put the book out, not out of Africa. Because no, no, no. she, she said that everything that the Greeks learned was not out of Africa. Why would he put a book out called Not Out of Africa if he was an African scientist? Come on, Leo. Uh, be guard promoted the out of Africa theory. Because he's a racist. John Henry Clark <laughs> was wrong. He was giving misinformation. Yeah, he was. We are not from Africa. Okay, so, so okay, so, let's look at that premise. Let's look at that. So, the book you recommend is a bell curve written by who? A black person or a white person? The bell curve is a theory. But written by who? That a white person or a black person. The, 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 the bell curve is a theory, and you Negroes are proving it right. Mm. Written by who? Leo, what's the theory, real quick? Just real quick. What's the theory, real quick? That, 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 is, that, 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 that Negroes are. Yeah, that, that, he lying, big cat. He's stuttering too much. Big cat. Yeah, no, who, wrote, but who wrote it? But who wrote it? But who wrote it? The Negroes. I just told him. I gave him a, I gave him a freebie, but I bet he can't repeat it. I know who wrote it, but. Who wrote it? The Those Negroes, are white or black. We don't give, give you no time to Google it either, nigga. The Negro is predisposed to having less mental capacity. It's, it's genetic. Hey, you believe, so, so, so I guess you're not Negro. That is not. Uh, that is Negro. not what that genetic. fucking book is about. That's a fucking lie, bro. It's genetics. Oh, genetics? So wait, 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 hold on, hold on, Leo. That's a theory, that's a theory. Leo, 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 Leo,
you Negroes are proving it right that you are. No, no. The question is, Leo, are you a Negro? I am of Negro stock, yes, sir. So that means you're dumb. That, that might According be the case. To your essay. That might be the case then. Leo, don't you do that? Uh, you so, know you're a super. No, 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 might not be on the same mental level as the Caucasoid. That's what oh, I'm okay. Well, you know. So you're the Caucasoid. <laughs> Can't argue with that. <laughs> is that the same? Nigga, we're going to Can't argue with that, Leo. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm not dumb myself. I'm speaking what I believe. Okay. I'm saying. So I'm of, you, so you believe <laughs> you is above the Negro. Because I'm of, I'm of Negro stock, like the rest of everybody. Ain't no way in hell, hell, bro. Because I'm of Negro stock. I firmly you know, you know, believe. Even the Chakrasoi says that black people, that black, the black man was the first man to walk the earth. The person of color was the first man to walk the earth. A person of color. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So I, 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 I got a big... I no, no, it specifically, it specifically said a, a black a, man. It could have been, been, been... I got a big question for you. Even if you say that, it means it wasn't a fucking white man. A white man is just an offspring from black people. A person of color. He ain't say no black African man. He said a person of color. Well, you know what? It means that it wasn't a white person. So what? But they rule the world, though. So please, that one. Well, how do they do okay, that? Yeah, okay, okay, they, 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 no, 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 he's right, he's right. Europeans <laughs> do run the world. No, no, no. Now, let me he's tell you right. what, let's talk about why they run it, though. Why, why, why do Europeans go to Africa to go get slaves? Because why did they enslave their own people? They did enslave their own. The first slaves were white no, people. No, 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 I, I, I know. But look, but, but why do they do away with that? Why do they do away with that and go to <laughs> Africa? Because they kept finding, they kept finding themselves in many wars with people that looked like them. The so they decided slaves. to go to Africa, a continent that had no guns, and that's why y'all went and did that shit. That's the why first. white people are so fucking protecting that Second Amendment right, they'll die for that shit. They so don't, they ain't got no fucking guns, that so all right, shit so is what? over. So what, but you ain't got no guns neither, so what you gonna do? Mm-hmm. You ain't got no gun neither. Wait, wait, hey, wait, 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 you're not black. You're white. Leo, you're white. Okay, Bobby. I, I, I can't believe that. You're white. But let me get my question out real quick because I answered your question. Can I ask you gentlemen a question? Big Cat, can I ask him a question? Yeah, that's a nigga's question. Gentlemen, gentlemen, are you listening? No, we're not listening to you, bro. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, Big Cat. I got what you told me out of a Big Cat. We ain't listening yeah. to none of that shit you Okay, but quick, quick question, though. Since you Negroes hate America so much, yep. what do you want to do if Russia or what China you know attacks America? Do? Facts. Who are you going to rely on to protect your Negro ass? Please, facts, facts. What are you going to do? Can I, can I, can I, can I, can I, please, let me. I know what you're please, doing, nigga. Bro, he asked y'all a question, man. What y'all going to do? Y'all gonna no, do? No, 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 but that shit ain't no fucking facts, man. Cut it out. He's telling the truth. What are you going to do? Russia, no, come over here. Listen, what you going to do when, 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 when I... Answer the question. What are you going to do? They're going to rob Leo ass. That's what they going to do. <laughs> hey, when <laughs> Ivan when Ivan Van Stronghold come over here, <laughs> Ivan Van Stronghold with a nuclear missile, what are you going to do? What's going to do? Leo, Leo, Leo. Going to Leo. Good question, brother Leo. Smart question. Leo, Leo. Leo, Leo, Black Karen, Black Karen, Black Karen, question, Black Karen, I'm listening, Leo, quick, real quick, real quick, Leo, 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 can you hear me, I can loud and clear, sir, loud and clear, I can hear you, Leo, Black Karen, loud and clear, I can hear you, Leo, I can hear you, sir, so, what are you going to do, I'm going to fight on the side 
of the greatest <laughs> nation that ever existed. Right, and if you Negroes are in the way, That's you're right. going down too. You goddamn you right. Be, Tell them, brother. Don't you be, don't you be in the way because you're going down. You ain't fighting nobody. He said, if you, you don't even do a push you, up. He said, you I'm go against fight America, fight he'll mow your nigga ass down. That's what he said. I'm going to fight so, the so, soil on so, which I live. So you will be not going down first. He said, he'll, he'll, he'll mow side. your nigga ass down if you get in the way. I'm going to fight on the side of the nation in which I was born. I'm here to protect uh, the land. Yeah. You Negroes, you ain't got they, no Did your jerseys come in yet? Which one? The ones you have on what? Oh, no, no, no. Hell no. They Illinois. They Illinois, Illinois. The Trey Young. No, both of them coming in. They Illinois. Anybody invading this country, just believe this. We're going to fight for what we have. Whether we right or wrong, we're going to defend this country. They're going to definitely shoot care of right there. So, mm -hmm. so Leo, what you think about that? What does that make them if they if they wanted to fight for us? Let's let's go then. You 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 protect the same what you live in. That's all right. Let's go. So why Leo didn't uh, protect and go into any type of military thing? Well, quit saying go back to ask or leave the country. If we're gonna but, fight the feeling we love here and have, we ain't even need. never did all TC. I, I ain't got no argument with you no more, sir. If you're gonna fight for the nation, then I know let's you go. don't. Cause I will beat you every time any argument you have. God damn, sir. I will beat you down. Man, you ain't winning. Like man. Now, Leo, you need to bring this nigga down a peg. You're making me mad. He wanted to fight. He wanted to fight for himself. This nigga don't throw no hands. Come bro. on, Leo. This nigga ain't fight for nobody. He ain't picking up no guns. What you gonna do? What? If something happens? I got plenty of guns. Too much, too much guns. of a pussy. Nigga, so much space. Too much of a pussy. He don't fight for the country, but he's too much of a pussy. Nigga, so much space. Man said, he said, I got plenty of guns. Hey, look, look here. Look here, first of all, white people, white people have sounded off on you, and definitely look. It sounds like they gonna definitely fuck you up first. Big cat, yeah, big cat. The dude wow. that live, in, the wow. dude that wow. live, the wow. dude, the dude on the phone that live in Raleigh. He's the most <laughs> shit talking. Woman. Of, the well, woman to wherever you live at, Negro. You the most shit talking. Did you just you you the you the you you the you the quintessential pro-black fake woke ass Ooh, negro shit. talking that pseudo bullshit Ooh, the cat, all they do you. is talk shit about the country Ooh, but first thing come, the cat, they won't leave the country Ooh, they shit. won't go to fucking nowhere else oh, I, I, but they I, talk I, I, shit I about the no 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 I ain't talking about you bro no he's not nah, bro he said whoever in Raleigh bro he said who Raleigh I ain't talking about you brother I'm talking about the I'm talking about the nah he said wherever you live at so don't try to switch you now I'm talking Don't about, try to switch it now. I'm Don't try to switch it now. I'm talking about, about, about the Negro. That nigga had military. He wanted to switch it. I'm talking. I'm not talking you about that? you, bro. I'm not talking about you. You talking about the Negro in Raleigh? I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about the. I'm talking about the pseudo black. Oh my God! Leo, go ahead and plug your cash app. You got some fans out there that want to see you. Oh man! Oh man! Go ahead, brother. Plug your cash app, nigga. Dollar sign. Nobody after this nigga's cash app, man. Nobody after this nigga's cash app. Dollar sign. No poor. There's nobody after your fucking cash app. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm about to put it in it anyway. Fucking pseudo. Why would you want <laughs> you want <laughs> money <laughs> from me? Go ahead, they brother Leo. So black motherfuckers that won't lead the country, but they hate America. Why do you want? Why do you? Why do you want money from some low class black dumb niggas? Mm. Because, why do you want that? Because Big Cat Show is international, brother. That's why. Mm -hmm. So you assuming everybody listening is Negroes. Everybody ain't like you, bro. Mm. Hey, look, man. Well, hey, Leo, 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 look, look. You, you call everybody hey, bro. on this show. I can tell family. you everything. You call, it just wouldn't matter. But you, <laughs> you suck a woman. You suck a woman. Dollar sign, Leo. You, you really do. L -E -O -P -O -R -E. <laughs> you, you, Dollar you sign, call Leo. Big Cat Savior. Leo Poor, P O R E. The last name is French. Wow. Indian. Dollar sign. Huh? Leo Poor. You say mm -hmm. Indian? French Indian. French Indian. Y'all ain't gonna cash at me. Wow. Cash at that nigga. But cash at him. No, 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 I mean, I got some Negro. I said I was Negro stock. I got Negro stock in me, bro. What is that? Is that say it again verbally. Dollar sign Leo L E O. I'm listening to you, but I hear what you say. I'm listening. You want to get that shit off the night? You love black people. 
Somebody else said something. Somebody else said something. I'm going to start pulling that 704 shit. You ain't getting none of that shit off. Dollar sign. Boy, you so yeah, bad. Yeah. Hey, black people that love black. Why are you so mad at that? You got to be for real, though, bro. Like, this, if you genuinely How you know love, for real? If you genuinely love black who, people, who made this judge and jury? Because you Negroes ain't for real, because all y'all do is complain about white folks. Damn. And then, hey, look, man. Look, the, Mexicans don't, the, the Mexicans don't complain about white folks. Hey, hey, hey Carla, who's the other Carla? Who's the other Carla? Who's that? T. Huh? My name is T. T. Oh, T. T. Let me tell you what, let me tell you what happened, bro. So my, look, when this thing was 14, 15, somebody fucked this girl. Some nigga, some, look, some nigga made fun of him all his childhood. He got bullied and this, this shit. Fucked this girl. Probably fucked his sister and some shit. And he said, look, that nigga had it out for black people ever since. You know what I'm saying? No, that's not the case at all. <laughs> Oh, that's one. Twine, twine, twine. I'm surprised this nigga ain't a cop. I'm surprised this nigga ain't police. I told you, Twan is right, right, right. I told you, Twan is one of those. I'm surprised this nigga's not a cop. This nigga, look, check this out. Somebody black has done something so awful to this nigga that he just refused to deal with them all together. <laughs> all and the only thing I know they can get a nigga that mad is somebody just fucked this girl in and ran a train on this bitch. Something, bro. Am I? You know, yeah, something happened. Like, I'm I'm what, is he what is he mad about? What is he mad about? That's what I'm saying. One of his old boys. Listen, one of his, old boys, I, I, one of his old boys fucked his fucked his mom in front of him or some shit. Somebody did some despicable shit to this nigga, bro. I mean, what is that? Like, this nigga, he is mad for a reason, yo. But if the people listening, <laughs> if the people listening, well, Leo, sound... I, I could be your dad. You don't know. Who? If the people listening. <laughs> To the people listening, ah, who's, ah, you mad, nigga, you to the, mad. To the people who are listening, who sounds mad? Ah, oh, nigga, you mad, you mad, nigga. <laughs> oh my god, anybody laughing, sir? You're the only one. Black people, look, black people, black people didn't accept him, so now he's trying to say like, you don't fuck with us. Ah, oh, this nigga mad. Look, they won't let him in no group. I, 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 I really, I really want to know. I, I really want to know, real, real. I really want to know. Why do you think the bell curve so much? Why are you believe in the bell curve? I didn't hear you say that again. <laughs> why do you really believe in that bell curve? He's literally why, 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 why you don't know shit about it. <laughs> I know about it. Why do you believe it? No, he doesn't you know shit about it. He can't tell you about something he don't know about. You prove it. You prove it with your actions every day. Hey, so, yo, I, man. I'm hey. asking a question. I'm asking you a question seriously. Your people Why do you prove believe it. the bell curve? Your people prove it with your actions every day. Every other race comes to America and they thrive. You Negroes been here almost 500 years. Hey, Leo, years. stop right there. Leo. Yes, sir. Speaking of that, get what I watched today, uh, bro. What'd you say? Yeah. Guess what I watched on YouTube today. <laughs> What'd you watch, hey, bro? Hey, black people, they reparations like they paid everybody else. I watch a Mexican couple. Now, they teenagers. Mexican couple buying a vending machine, flipping them, making money. Mm. They put their own candy and juices and shit in there. They they got like five of them going to make it money. It's a it's a couple. What kind of candy wow. and juices? They illegal Mexican that came over here just to work hard, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But see, the Negro is so lethargic yeah. and mentally yeah. depraved. You said, you said illegal. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Lethargic. <laughs> Who built the country? Who the built the country? Is, the, the we will be we were not people. immigrant. We were hot. That will be black people. That will be us. Because, oh, yeah. Yeah. because you know what a Negro always talks about the past. That will be black. Yeah, right. That will be black people. Because you know what a Negro always talks about the past. Give these niggas a history lesson. No, no, real quick. Okay, real quick. Well, what's about present day? How, how far? How far you want to go? We talking about redlining. We talking about Jim Crowism. We talking about um from action. So where we gonna go? Because you know what a Negro. You know what a Negro always talks about the past. Why? Because he ain't doing shit in the present. Wow. That's powerful. So what's the president? That's powerful, so, so, brother. Big cat, big cat, big cat, big cat. Big cat. Big cat. Why does he always talk about Cam Newton here? Big cat, big cat, big cat. Talk to me. I'm talking to you. You talk to me. Talk to me. Stupid nigga shit. Just talk to me. Don't call big cat. Talk to me. The Negro. Oh, niggas always talk themselves into the trap. Oh, the Negro is so apathetic. 
Yeah, Steve apathetic. Lawrence. Apathetic. No, no, no. Yeah. No, are you looking at reality? <laughs> are the you Negro not seeing so things? Hey. I don't live in hey. your world, sir. I don't live in your world. Hey, kid, hey, kid, no, you no, want to no, talk no, shit? That's real. That's real. You don't live in my world. I don't live in your world. You don't live in my world. Call in, Kia. That's true. So my question is this. <laughs> what world do you live in that you think that you are so-called free? No, 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 no. Oh, no. You say you say you say you right? You say you say you right? Say again? You, what, you, you say your name was T. I don't want to mess your name up. Yeah, it's T. Yeah, it's T. 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 All right, so look, listen, listen. That's all we do it right here. Now watch this. T, what do you do for occupation? What do you do? I'm an insurance agent. Insurance. Okay, Leo works for a bank, making fucking minimum wage and some shit. He didn't like the job trying to go somewhere else. I see. What, how much responsibility do you got, kids, the wife, whatever? I'm sorry, you, you, you're breaking up. Say again? Do you have kids, a wife, you know, responsibility? Oh, yeah, 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 okay. yeah. Okay, yeah. so I'm going to so say yeah. so, so, so Leo don't have no fucking kids and no responsibilities. You know what I'm saying? You just get to sit around right. and talk shit. Do you have a family that loves you and cares for you, T? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And watches out for your brother? Yeah. Okay, Leo don't yeah. have none of that shit. He don't have none of that shit. They can't have well, that. Look, yeah, I'm here, brother. Well, tighten them up, bro. But he's trying to tell you that, your, mm. that, that his life is better than yours. They can't. Yeah. What do, you know, you, outside, what, what do you know of me outside of my phone number, bro? Uh, not <laughs> much. I, I think that's it. That's it. So what? So how is Twan so confident and speaking on me? He doesn't have my number, but he's so confident about my life, though. Because I know, I know, I know, I know niggas like you, bro. Put that no, nigga in the play, bro. You know, like lying, dumb motherfucker, bro. Hold on. 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 Wait, wait, hold on, Leo. Because you <laughs> came up here and told us about your damn life. No, no, no. What you no. said, Leo? No, set up. <laughs> no, the dude, the dude and Riley. The oh, dude and shit. Riley. Up, bro. The dude in Let me Raleigh. tell you something, bro. It's you can look, look. When people know where you live and shit, like they got things now where you can look up, see what uh, how somebody living. You know, there's reports you can get. You can find out motherfucking salaries and all that shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm not hiding. I'm not, I'm not hiding. Google, nigga, Google, Google me. me. Google me, nigga. Google me. You can, you can see how I'm living. <laughs> I don't just that. Leo, you gonna Google that nigga, bro? I'm not interested in Googling another man. So y'all gonna talk about the, uh... You Google Google um, Google to get to the show, nigga. The president that got uh, killed in Haiti? Yeah, we can do that. Leo, what you think about the, um, the dude that got assassinated, the president, the prime minister of Haiti? Yeah, that's that's, 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 that's horrible, man. Um... Um, Haiti is like a, you know, it's an unstable country. I remember years ago. Oh, uh, the first thing Haiti. he says about Haiti is unstable. I knew that. Go ahead, Brother Leo. Go ahead, Brother Leo. But they can't. Brother Leo, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I want to hear from you. I remember years ago when the Nothing CIA report went. Nothing report. To what he's never been. I remember in years ago when the CIA went to Haiti and kidnapped their president and brought him to America. You know, it's it's a, I mean, it's unfortunate. Yeah. Um, but, um, you know, Haiti. You know, that's 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 horrible. I heard about that. Hey, 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 Leo, Leo, tell tell everybody why Haiti's unstable. This is unstable. Well, I why the fuck are you talking I about wait. that? Well, I, you know, but look, hey, hey, Leo, tell everybody why Haiti is so unstable. Because Haiti is in the same situation that American blacks are in. You know, the reason why they speak French is because the French go to bed. took over that land. And, and the and French... To this day, have still refused to pay those people reparations and tell them sorry for enslaving them. Hey, big cat, did the Spaniards pay the Mexican but, reparations? But, but big cat. Oh, no. are supposed to love big the, cat. Yeah. Big the cat. fuck out of here, big bro. Cat. The, big cat, did the Mexicans pay the Spanish reparations? Hell did they nah. speak Spanish? Did, did they do the Mexicans? Now, Leo, you know Mexicans are really Indians. You know that, right? Yeah, they are. They are. They, they were colonized by the Spaniards. But did you see them? Ask for ask for reparations for the Spaniards. Hey, look, man. I'm gonna start. Strong. I'm gonna no, 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 start. Okay. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna look, look. I'm gonna start putting some of y'all niggas. Uh, look, man. Look, look. If you gonna come on this motherfucker pretending like you know about shit, then talk about it. Damn, don't don't, don't be motherfucking saying yes or no. Then when we say let's talk about it, then know the subject. Big cat. 
but it goes to show how. Look, this nigga Leo is dumb as fuck. This motherfucker ain't read all this shit he's telling y'all. He can It's, it's <laughs> yeah. the black American. It, it, it just show how weak the black American. He is. wasn't even talking about the fucking book. That, 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 you know they why you're talking about that book? Because he show. found out I read it. There's they no need for him to go to tell Leo what to do that. They're just so weak. They're such a weak people. The, the the Mexicans are native people. They were colonized by the Spaniards, but they won't. They don't. They don't want to ask the Spaniards for reparations. Well, let me ask you a question, Leo. Leo. You stay right there, Leo. Let me, let me, let me, the me. Fuck up. didn't want to give them their land either. Well, Leo, let me ask you this right here. New, New Mexico, why is New Mexico in America? Well, I got a question for you. All that shit was Mexico, nigga. They took they, America took their land too. <laughs> Leo, I got a question for you, bro. Yes, sir. <laughs> and I just, I just, I just need this. This is not a joke here. What 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 ethnicity on this earth since the beginning of time has been enslaved the most? Repeat that question. I can't hear you, man. What ethnicity been enslaved the most has been on the since the beginning of time has been enslaved the most, or the longest? The longest. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm gonna be quiet. I'm gonna hear this. I'm gonna have Nobody's to say. Gonna... I would probably have to say the um, the brown people. I won't necessarily say people of Africa. I just okay. say brown people because brown, brown people were original people to the planet Earth. So, and slavery is just as old as. Okay, now stay right there. So. Well, yeah, yeah, stay right there. Hey, so, all, so, all, all, I'll say, all I'm saying to him for that response is fuck you, nigga. Well, hold on. I just, I, it's a I'm point. It that. It's a point I'm trying to make here. So, <laughs> you so, know damn well. So, you're saying people of, of, of darker descent have been enslaved the most since the beginning of this earth, right? Yes, sir. I, I, conclusively, I would have to, to say that. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. So I don't want to. Christopher Columbus discovered America. So, 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 let me ask you this, and, and I'm just asking you from your opinion. If the majority of uh, people who have been enslaved the longest on this earth since the beginning of time were called Caucasian, you think they would have been there as long? But you mean been around? <laughs> I'm talking about you just said the people of darker descent have been enslaved the longest. You know think... what I'm saying? But they've been enslaved by their own. I'm, I'm talking about like since the beginning of time. I'm talking about people that came with the planet Earth, people with a skin color, mm -hmm. because the Caucasian is not an original people to the planet Earth. Oh, okay. I'm talking about. So where they come from? First time we told. First time we told the truth in a minute. Something, but it, but it, but but but. Hold on, bro. What you just said a white man not from Earth. <laughs> I mean, you know. You know He's no, 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 no. I'm just saying, like, Leo, what bro. the fuck you talking no, about? No, no, no. Come on, bro. Leo said, Leo said he was, Leo, Leo said he dabbled in, in, in Muslim culture, five percent culture. Where they culture. from, Leo? Then he can tell you where <laughs> white people from, Leo. Tell him the truth. No, nigga. no, I'm not joking. I'm not joking. Seriously, where, where the white man from? Tell him, Leo. Okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, tell him where the white man comes from. Everything that you learn, tell him where the white man comes from. Go ahead. Okay. I mean, this gonna be good as hell. Leo, be honest okay, with me. Don't see, lie to me. I'm not a nigger. Don't lie to me. He's gonna lie to you, bro. <laughs> you, see, you see how he can't control his emotions. Nigga, shut up. Don't worry about me, nigga. I'm gonna be quiet. Don't worry about me. Tell him where white people come from. Go. Big Cat. Yeah. Tell him where white people come from. Yeah. Every race originated from people of color. It depends on where you were born. That's not, that's not what he where, asked you. That's not what he asked you. You see, I'm because, 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 I can't. No, that's not what he asked you. Stop trying to work, talk around this shit. No worries, no worries. You mean, all you need you say, you need to say white people came from and then do that. Where they come from, Leo? Do you, you, you. Yeah. Big cat. Yeah. When humanity, this this is the, this, this is theoretical. This is theoretical. This, this is theoretical, big cat. Because right. it can, has it been measured. It's not theoretical. It's not fucking theoretical. Big cat. Yeah. Just say, white people came I, from. I told. I told. I told that right. I told you. He 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 is weak as. No, no, no. Is, even, even, so even, even your daddy, even your daddy said, "Don't talk around it. Just give it to me straight up." No, no, and you still you're trying to still make him some bullshit. So no, all you need to say is, "White people came from big cat or whatever the fuck you want. You want to lick his balls and then do it like that." Don't he ain't asking you for no fucking theory? He said the truth. Big cat. Yeah, brother. He. He's, he's telling me how to respond to a question that you asked me. Right, facts, facts.
let, let, let him answer. Let him answer. Go ahead. Hum, human beings migrated from all over the planet Earth. Where we originated, who knows? But we originated around the equator. So, around the equator, so news will be burned. When human beings. I, 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 chat, chat, chat. I'm going to let him answer the question. I'm going to be fully quiet. Let him answer. Let him all answer. I ask is, all, all I ask is that you come back to me when he's done, and I'll tell you what white people came from. Okay, okay. You need to say somewhere around the equator. Because yeah. he, he, <laughs> human beings originated around the equator. Human White man can't even handle a sunburn. What yeah. the fuck he gonna human be doing? Be- <laughs> no, Leo, no, 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 not people, human. bro. I'm talking about. I'm talking about white people, not not human beings. But this is what I'm yeah. saying, because okay. this is this is this is the theory. See, he, he asked him for the history lesson. He want to give him the history lesson and then tell him answer the question. Hold on, hold on, let me speak. Let me speak. Go ahead, Leo. Right. Human, the human being migrated all over the planet Earth. The human being migrated north from the equator. The further he got away from the sunlight, the lighter his skin became. So therefore, right. once the once once the Caucasoid settled so he, over, oh, so Santa is true. From they did from the North Pole. Once the Caucasoid settled mm-hmm. in Northern Europe and in Northern Russia, it was predicated. His skin color was predicated on his ability to stay alive. So the sunlight was not as prevalent as it was in the equator. So no, therefore... no, 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 fuck that shit, man. <laughs> no, 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 no. Look, tell me how they got the Europe and all those places. They ain't just up here there. How did they, how did they make their way there? The cat, you see what I, I told you. No, 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 fuck all of that. Nigga, you ain't no damn scam this shit. They didn't just see, pop up there. You see how, how did they get there? You see how he talked, because humanity... The Caucasian migrated. <laughs> the, the human being migrated north. The Asian migrated away. The Caucasian and the Asian, they are similar in people. They moved away. They moved north from the equator. Once you move away from the sun, you still have to survive. So the further I ain't heard no away, answer yet because the further he away, <laughs> the further, <laughs> the further. He, because, he has because, to ask a simple question, yeah. because, and this motherfucker done talked about mother. He done told yeah, six stories already, bro. Except they, where did white people come from? Because they want to tell you. They want to talk about because they want to talk about mythology and stuff oh, that they God. think they know. Yeah, look, you heard with that question, know. bro. Yeah. You didn't even you didn't even mean to do it, he, but he he mad at you right now. He like, why that nigga had to ask me that shit? No, because <laughs> because. You Human be beings migrated all over the planet Earth. The further away you get from the sunlight, the lighter you the melanin, the less melanin you produce. So therefore, they are up there. The Caucasian, the, the Caucasian body <laughs> primarily is made up of uh, like a like a small nitrogen to keep them alive because of the blood that stays in their body. So they 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 produce like a small amount of nitrogen in their body to keep them alive. In the colder part of the that's world. Why they, that's why they get sunburned. Big cat. Yeah. The Caucasian is a, a part, just like all of the races. We all were. He didn't ask you what the fuck a white people who said, where did they you come from? It. Caucasian. <laughs> the Caucasus Mountains. Caucasian. Caucasus. Yeah. Let's talk about the Caucasus Mountains. Let's start there. The Caucasus Mountains. That's where they fucking came from. They ain't my name. Oh, Here's the real real thing. So here's the real thing. White people were were created, you know what I'm saying, out of an image of black people. The reason why white people were referred to as devils, right, is because they were created in his presence, in his sight. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, Leo, you, you claim you was a Muslim and you did the 5% thing. That's not so you, true. You that's, said, that's, that's, that's and mythology. You said you had, Sir, and you that's said mythology. You had, oh, that's fuck mythology. All that. that's, that's mythology. And you said you that's claimed you were at 120. That's mythology. And you claimed you were at 120. That's mythology. That's why you didn't want to tell the story. That's mythology. That's why the fuck you didn't want to tell the story. So shut the fuck up. We listen to you. Now it's my turn to talk. Now it's my turn to talk. Mythology. Look, black people didn't just make up the word Calling white people devils. That was the cut that they were breeding from. Because, because they said all people in the world can't be good 
we have to create an evil people. The evil people that was created was Caucasoids. <laughs> and the Caucasus Mountains. Leo, he was trying to tell you about some Europe and all this other shit, Leo, but he's he not telling you about where it originated. Leo, is he lying, Leo? He's telling an absolute lie. That's bro. not a lie. That's right. But be careful, be careful. It's not a lie, bro. But be careful. What I tell you before, be careful. I'm not even gonna try to convince you of that because he's not a lie. Be careful. Be careful. Yeah. Yeah, I up? told you about these pseudo intellectual black. No, 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 this nigga did not want to answer that question, bro. Be careful. He can't. He didn't want to answer it. Be careful. Be careful. He's one of those fake Negroes that read a book when he was little. And now they run with it because that's how they feel pride. You know what? But, but right now, but right now, we're talking about what white people feel pride. You read the bell curve, right? Big cat. Yeah, yeah. You read the bell curve, right? They All they want to do is talk shit about white folk. But as soon as white folk take the hedge of blessing from these niggas, they won't be able to survive. All they do is fucking well, pray. All they do is tear well, each other up and eat. They will, no, they, they will, don't take. They, they don't take nothing. They steal shit. They will what? Get it right. right. They steal shit. If white people didn't help you niggas, y'all wouldn't have shit. Tell me otherwise. White people are a mutation. They are, they are a mutation of the original man, Don't bro. You tell me otherwise. You know what mutations are. But it's just a mutation of the original man. Don't you tell no, me otherwise. No, 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 check this out. It's in their blood to be evil, bro. It's in their blood to be savages. It's in their blood to want to conquer. It's in them, bro. You but think white can. people are just can. fucking crazy can. around the world for no reason? Look here, bro. He sees what's going on. It's in our blood, bro. He don't want to say it. Big cat, big cat. But ask, but ask, ask Twan, the director at his hospital we work at, if that's the, if we, what you tell him, he devil to his face. Ask him that. I'm right here, motherfucker. You can ask me whatever. Big facts, no, 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 no. Leo. Big facts, Leo. Tell, what, what's the facts? Tell the director at your hospital where you work, or wherever you work at, Tell him he the devil. He ain't, gonna do, do he ain't gonna do that. He ain't gonna do it. I know he ain't gonna do it. Hell no, he ain't gonna do it. And, and, and that motherfucker brought that conversation up and he wanna hear the truth? That's what the he, fuck he, I'm gonna uh, tell Big cat, big cat. He 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 do that. Hey, look, that's because your white daddy used to show you. Don't put that on for us. No? Big cat, you think you see how he used to? You see how he used to? No, 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 no. That's because you used to work your white dog. Don't put that shit off on us. Hey, yo, yo, check this out, check this out. Really, a quick history lesson. Now, I do not know where the record came from, but I do know this. In history, 1442, Henry the Navigator came off the coast of Spain and got 20 Africans and took them to the Pope. And the Pope said, these people are not our people, and they should be enslaved and perpetuated. That means forever. And that Pope, back then, Institutes what we call slavery today. And the Europeans went on a conquest to come into Africa and take people out of the African continent and send them overseas into a place called South America, Trinidad, Haiti, Jamaica, and America. Natural. And then Natural. And put them into servitude for the yeah, rest yeah. of their lives. What year did you say that was? No, no, don't read it all off. The Virgin Islands, Marti, Haiti, Puerto Rico, 14, all of them. 1442. 1442. When did Christopher Columbus supposedly discover America? That's 1492. Like I said, 1442. Henry took them to the Pope, not across the sea. Columbus was a child of the navigator, Henry. He was on the same boat at the same time. Nigga got lost. Nigga got lost. Hey, big cat. Are you there, brother? We can say that. But understand this. Once he reached the shores (laughs) of Trinidad. Leo, what's up, brother? That's these, when these, things happen. I'm gonna let him. I'm gonna let him speak. Read but a book these by Nicholas, uh, by the Catholics. They know so much he about, about the history. 
they talk about slavery like, why don't you Negroes do something in the present? Motherfucker, but if we was running that school, we don't have to get the way you was getting fucked in the school. Understand your history. You but I know it back and forth, the but I'm not dwelling on that because I'm going forward. But see, you Negroes don't want to do nothing. Tell me, what do you, 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 how you going okay, forward? Wait, 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 wait. So I guess, I guess one of the brothers is right. You have no kids, right? Big cat, big cat. Just like my point, I told you. The, the, no, 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 Leo, 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 real quick. The you have kids. Let me, let me make this point. Let me make this point real quick, John. So I'm asking you a question. No, 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 no quick question. Let me, let me, let me, do you have any quick? You have any kids? Can I make a point real quick? I'm asking you a question. So you need to say. He's a nobody. Nobody wanted to marry this nigga. Nobody want to have no kids with this nigga. He's fucking nothing. Big cat, are you there, brother? Big cat, are you there, brother? Big cat, are you there, brother? Your kids are history. This nigga is 25 years old and he ain't got nobody. This nigga is up all immeasurable. Big cat. Yeah, what's up, brother? He's a failure. He failed at life. That's why he's so mad, bro. Just like I said. He He lost. Just like I said, just like I said. Hey, the first is that I kids in law school is not even math, but they, they learn history. They won't let me get a, They won't let me say nothing, brother. <laughs> because we don't want to hear no bullshit. You better say. I, I, I want to hear it. Oh, they go crying and shit, baby. Then the the, the they, they won't let me talk. They won't let me say anything. The cat, the, the, cat. the the Spaniards came. No, 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 go ahead, go ahead. You got it, go ahead. Say it. Say it. Oh, 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 bro, he ain't got no, look, this motherfucker ain't got no motherfucking, man. this motherfucker ain't got no fucking green light to talk. Man, fuck man. Leo, man. He don't run shit over here. It's sad, no. it's sad. Now, I'm just saying this. If you want to say something, let's, let's it's hit the dispute. Man, man, fuck him. him. <laughs> Why do you want to keep listening to a motherfucker that don't give a shit about black people? It's sad, it's sad. So I can, fuck him, so bro. I can, so I can bless him. It's really sad. Fuck him. It's really sad. Fuck that nigga. That nigga is that nigga is miserable, bro. His life, he found it life. I know. So <laughs> he found it fucking life. Let's let's enjoy his burn. Let him burn. He found it life. So now, and what, and what have you heard about misery? It loves company. So his goal is to make you miserable. No, 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 no. I, I enjoy I enjoy good conversation. Yeah, he did, Let he him did. talk. I enjoy good conversation. Let him talk. Let him talk. Man, they big cat. They have no control over their emotions. That's why they easily. Hey, cat, what is this? My, hey, what is this fucking? Um, what is this fucking? This this. Ain't that tropical uh, storm poli- coming? The politics. What is that politics show coming? No, it's coming here uh, next week. Oh yeah, that shit gonna hit us tomorrow, bro. What's gonna hit what? That tropical storm. Are y'all gonna get it? No, nah, we good in Charlotte. Nah, they said this shit gonna hit Raleigh. Leo, you very intelligent, brother Leo. I don't know how the hell it's not gonna get y'all. It's gonna hit us. But see, big cat, the reason why because it's hitting on the outskirts. We kind of, you know, Charlotte. The reason, the reason. So what are they? That shit must be it's going in there. Like we're getting rain, yeah. but that's it. That's all we're gonna get is right, right. They said we got. They said we gonna have fucking thunderstorms and large hail. Yeah, what we, we getting not rain tomorrow. Back to the point. Back to what? your point. What we talk to them about how we don't understand our history, Big and cat. the first thing your kids yeah. learn in history is school. Big cat. Yeah, what's up, brother? I'm I don't want to talk about this nigga Leo no more. Oh, let's, sure. like, let's talk about some football, man. But, but yeah, no, I'm like, hey, hey, we're doing football. I'm betting football. Did you, but did y'all know? Leo, did you know Billy Graham house is up for sale here in North Carolina? Want you to go buy it? Big cat, can I just make a point real quick? And I'm, I'm gonna leave it alone. Yeah, go ahead, he can't afford it. He can't afford I'm, shit. I'm gonna leave it alone real quick. <laughs> no, you ain't gonna go ahead, nigga. Big cat, you you hit me when I know. Go library in your house and everything. Big cat, Broke, nigga. Yeah. He ain't got no fucking money. He ain't got no bitch. He got a nigga. He ain't got no money, he ain't got no bitch. The nigga ain't educated. The nigga said he dropped out of the fucking community college. He ain't educated. He ain't shit. Okay, That's why he's so fucking miserable. Okay, you see, you see how I talk to him. Go, motherfucker. He's going hard. He's going hard on you. Yeah. Okay, you he's going to tell me he can't stand black people. We stupid. But at the end of the day, he wants y'all to send him a fucking cash out. Big cat, are you there, brother? Come on, motherfucker. 
<laughs> Big Cap, but you see, let, you see. Let the brother you, talk, though. Let, let him talk. 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 Big Cap, you see how. And he got yeah. daddy issues. And he got daddy issues because he keeps calling fucking Big Cap's name like he pays child support and some shit. Big Cap, but you see how I, I talk. I understand. But let, Big, let him get it out, though. Let him get it out. Big see, Cap. If, if, if you understand your knowledge, you let him get his yeah. whole thing out, and you go back at him. I get my knowledge. I don't want to talk about this nigga no more. Let him say what he got to say. He's talking about the Panthers. Big Cat, you there, brother? Yeah, I'm here, brother. So Big Cat, but you see how I listen to them and, and, I, and I talk very calmly and I let them get their point across and I try to say my why, point. Why do you That's, always need Big Cat to co-sign what you're saying? Just say cat, it, bro. The point, the point, the point is... That is true. Because the point is, the point is, only a a girl, a feminine type figure, is gonna (laughs) always seek a man's opinion on something, bro. TV show, big cat. What I'm trying to show black men is, yeah, bro. You are like you are like you are like you big like you big cat's little girl or some shit. Big cat. I I, I, I don't hear little girls call their daddy's name as much as you call big. Hey, hey, did y'all hear that uh, Kurt Warner coming out with a biopic? Yeah. <laughs> who gonna see? Who cares about that? They gonna show back hey. in the beginning of that <laughs> I guess so. And then whatever yeah, else yeah. happened. Big cat, but you see how the shit they come up. They should. It's the shit they come up with. Though. Man, see, look, I'm gonna be real with y'all. We done try to change subjects like ten times, but this black dumb motherfucker won't let it go. But he's still I'm, trying I'm, to convince I'm, Big. I'm, I'm, he's I'm still trying to convince Big Cat of something, man. But I'm not gonna speak on the number. Just let me just let me just this real quick. Big Cat, you see how I talk, oh. and you see how I respond to him. I never get, I never raise my voice. I just try to talk to him I'm calmly. Him. Well, black men have to learn how to do it. Seven o four. This motherfucker say he don't raise his voice. What, 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 in your play, in your, in your, in your, in your thinking, but can have I, I not been can I finish? Can I finish? Can I finish? Hey, but hey, he said, he said he never raises his voice. Can I finish though? Can I finish? We don't want you to finish. What you go? What you go to a fucking conservative channel and talk that bullshit, man? But big cat, you see how I respond to him? Yeah. You see how calm I talk? You're very calm. You know, you know how they responded to you? They said, "Get your punk ass off our show and go somewhere else." It's that medicine. That's why. Big cat. Bring the those drugs, bro. Big cat. What they have to learn how to do is control their emotions. They they be used by the emotions. That that medication controlling you. Your emotions. That medication controlling you. If you want to get your hey, point Leo, across, Leo, have I been disrespectful? No, no, not at all, sir. I'm just, I'm just speaking in general terms, though. No, yeah, okay. So check this out. Who's supposed to co- who, who's supposed to control their emotions on a fucking debate sports show? Big Cat, but you, 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 you understand my point, though, by the way. Yeah, yes, no, no, no. Yes, who's, who's supposed to control their emotions on a debate sports show? Big Cat, you heard what I, you, heard, you understand my what I'm trying to say, oh, right? Yeah, I understand. Nigga, you gay as fuck, Thank bro. You, brother. I'm telling you, that's it. That so, shit hurts me every time he does it, bro. To all, to all the men and listening audience, just control your emotions, and you and you'll see who's the fool and who's not the fool. Fact, fact, fact. Well, hey, but Leo, I would debate you any time. No, 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 about no, black, no, no, about no, black no. But yeah, Leo no, couldn't I, I, control I, I, his emotions. I, I, he, I, I, he, he was punishing. Twan and Ray on what on what I was doing. So that was a kind yeah, of emotional no. movie. Yeah, yeah. Like I, said, I was emotional I, I, like hell. So I, I have you don't know how to separate shit. I, dis- I disagree with your 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 version because my, my because mm-hmm. the reality is this was he won't hey, he won't even talk to you no more and he talking about oh I'm on, that's, that's good he his emotions <laughs> that is quite well <laughs> the, so, the reality so look, so look, so look. He said he ain't talking to me no more. He said he ain't talking to 704 no more. I never said so, I wasn't talking to you, sir. I, I wasn't talking to you. Oh, no, I'm calling yeah. you Black Karen forever. So you already said you ain't responding to that. No, so you ain't talking to me well, no more. You haven't, you haven't uh, said you ain't, I guess when Ray gonna fuck up, you ain't gonna talk to him no more. No, you know? I, 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 I'm not talking about because but, but, but remember, you said you only scared of right now. the big guy anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so he's gonna beat his ass. No, 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 no. Hey, Leo, I got, a, I got an email about you the other day, bro. Yo, this is my third time watching your videos. <laughs> my first it? time calling in, and this is off the chain. Yeah. What yeah. the hell, man? It's called money. <laughs> That's my money maker right there. That nigga makes me a lot of money. Let me tell you, you how. You got an email, brother? Yeah, I got an email about some white guy. He wants to debate you. And I said, pay me 250 and I'll set it up. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll give you $50 oh. out of it. You want $50 out of it? No, I pay. It had to be free. I'll take it, brother. I'll take it, brother. I can't give you the 200 I can be that's, free. That's for me. No, 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 brother. I, no, whatever you give me is fine, bro. Okay. Just, no, no, brother. No, you just give me the time, and I'll, I'll take it from there. I'll set it up. I'll set it up, man. Yeah, let me know. Bro. I told him give me two fifty and I'll, I'll set the debate up. So this is why this is my nigga right here, Leo, man. We money making. Yeah, but it's, it's it's all it's all. Free. But Leo is going to be for free. I get all. No, I ain't shit gonna be for free. You got to, I, you know, you, <laughs> you can't do that. We don't do that free shit. You send me two hundred dollars. I, cause Leo, he don't come out in public, so you gotta go through me, my G. Send me two hundred dollars. Yeah. I set it up. Because you you hate America. You like two hundred dollars to debate you don't like a nobody. You. You no, this is a this is a this is a soldier of God right here. Wait, 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 hold on. I'm not like saying right now you ain't gonna get that money. I'm an insurance agent. <laughs> I live off commission. So I love capitalism. Don't talk to me that way. Yeah, that's okay, what we're so so why are you talking about America then, brother? I live in America. So why are you talking about it? Why are you talking against America? Mm. Man, fuck America. No, no. No, don't say you that. Don't say that. Me, I should leave. You I told you about my plane ticket, I will leave. Uh, I'll buy you the ticket. Why you don't like it here? That's right. Because I'm like where our people being treated. And I can oh, fix it. But if you being treated. And every but, day sir, I work sir, to fix it. Sir, so the question, question I have for you is this. Leo, what are you doing to fix it? Sir, sir, let me ask you a question, sir. He never sure. asked you. No, 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 don't let him ask you no question until he answers yours. Oh, what you ask me, sir? What you ask me? No, no, I asked him, what are you doing to fix black America? I'm doing nothing because I don't see a problem, sir. That's right. That's, a... that's, that's fine. That's fine. That's well, hold on, hold on, real quick, real quick. I got to ask Leo a question. Leo, what do you think about this uh, juvenile? You see that vaccine song he came out with? Girl, juvenile? you're looking good. Why don't you vax this thing up? This nigga don't watch no did you, see, did, did you see that? He, he, probably, he probably got money for saying it because, you know, yeah. the Negro's always being used. Yeah, they had the nigger singing a, a rap song that was popular in the, in the 90s about, you know, back the thing up, but they made it vax the thing up. Yeah, yeah, he, 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 <laughs> because the Negro is sell his soul for money, man. Give him a good beat that they'll do anything? Yeah, that's easy. <laughs> Give him some chicken and watermelon and some music. Give him a good what's beat. Your to me? <laughs> oh, what's your question to me? My question to you is, sir. Yeah, what's your name again, sir? I'm sorry. Uh, Girl, you're looking good once you back that thing something. up. This is what happened. This is what happened. <laughs> you yeah. benefit from America financially, sir. You have a good oh, money. Shit. You, you are part of the U.S. military, oh, were you not? Shit. Were you a part sorry, of the U.S. military? Oh, pardon me. Yeah. Were you a part of the U.S. United States military? I'm pretty yeah. sure you still get some type of monetary compensation, mm -hmm. possibly. Oh, yeah. That's private. Right. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. But net and still, you're on U.S. soil. Mm -hmm. You have a business, and you are profiting from this business uh, on U.S. soil. Get them, Leo. In the communist countries, oh. they take a part of your, of your, of your income, sir. In socialist countries, too, right? in socialist countries, they take a part of your yeah. income. And, and Leo, and Leo, 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 you, tell, you tell, in Leo, tell, tell the guy in Raleigh you if you, hey, hey, Leo, tell the guy in Raleigh if you say fuck China, they coming to your apartment. <laughs> if, if, you, if you say something, if you, if you say something about vaccines, China. China. Hey, because speaking of, do you remember that? You, you remember that guy that was in the, in, in the mm -hmm. uh, comment section talking? What time? Uh, no, I'm, I'm talking about Big Cat because Big Cat was like, I don't know why people would do that. You know how people after the videos. Oh, yeah, you know yeah, 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 Which one yeah. I was talking about. Yeah, yeah, So yeah. being him was kind of having no, back actually, and forth actually, in the comments. Actually, he said he was over there. But he, got, but, but he got mad when I told him go. Because he, he he started comparing money or some shit, trying to talk about money. So I told him go to work in, in one of them sweatshops over there. The nigga got mad, did never brought back. Damn. So I guess hey, I got I got rid of that part hey, real quick and fast. Hey, hey, hit that motherfucker hey, nerd. I'm gonna ask you a question. See you there? Yeah, I'm here. Hey, did you say uh, did you spend any time in the military? Yeah, six years. So you fought you fought for this country, right? Say again? You fought for this country, right? Yes. And and okay. and, and black and black Karen is telling you to go somewhere else after you fought for this country, right? So he took me to I, yeah. 
Right. He's a country ticket. No, no, no. So I so I asked Black Karen if he loves his country so much, why didn't he join the military? I'll wait. Or or, or just leave. No, at the time when I was younger, no, I was, after yeah. one, didn't he join the military? <laughs> at the time, I was very ignorant. You can still join the Coast Guard. Yeah, he did. You can still join the Coast Guard. Let, let, at the time, let, at the let, time. Let, let, let me preface this. Let me preface this. I was out of control as a Bunch young teenager. Bunch of excuses. So I joined the military to get out that trouble I was in. Well, the reason why I didn't join because when I was younger, I was a, a I was very ignorant to the world, that's and my mind was very closed. Nigga, you still ignorant as fuck. That's why I brought them in. And I was a. Uh, you gonna blame on his mama now? I was still trying to blame on his mama. I know that is right. All y'all motherfuckers, all y'all black motherfuckers that love America so much, why y'all ain't joining the military? I was ignorant. And I didn't join the military for my why own. Did, why didn't y'all join the military? All of y'all love America so much. Why you ain't quite for the country? Because it's not compensatory. So it's not compensatory. Now, Leo, what does compensatory mean, Leo? I about it. I suppose I actually fight. Because it's not compensatory, sir. It's not mandatory. Wait, 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 wait. So, what are we talking about now? Not back then. What? Join no, no, the no, 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 he, he was much rather get into some civil war type situation where he'll fight you and kill a black man <laughs> because he's on the wrong side of whatever, but he didn't join the military to go fight the enemy. Because they like to do that domestic shit. They like to fight here. All them q and I motherfuckers and all that, they want to, very few of them was in the military. They don't want to go fight for the country. They want to fight for mother. They want to kill Americans that live here. We got, well, I, got five, I, got, I, got I will sit right there. here and fight minutes. for my people. <laughs> if he doesn't want to fight for our people, then he should leave the country. Well, I will fight I'm, for my people. My people. Well, let me ask you this. Now you got five minutes. My people are American. Well, Leo, since you got five minutes real quick, let me touch on the topic here. If your people are American, that means they're black also. No doubt, no doubt. Hey, Leo, what? Oh, yeah. Speaking of red, white, and blue, that means... Help your people. My people I'm glad they don't call us African American. I don't want to do that with them. We don't claim this nigga. We don't claim this nigga. My people are American. We don't claim that. We don't claim that. And, and one of the things I keep telling y'all, for all you motherfuckers that ever turn you back on fucking black people, bro, oh, it's going to come back. It's coming back. You ain't got no black people ain't got no. Don't, with don't try to come back to the party. Don't try to come back to the fucking party when it goes. Say it again, Leo. I didn't hear you, brother. Say it again. Leo, say it again. Don't try to come back to the party when it goes down. What you say, Big Cat? What you say? Your mama's going here to sell your souls, and then let white people show you what the time it really is. You know? That's all he do is talk, man. I swear. Yeah. Well, since you say you got five you minutes left, nigga, um, comes out of your mouth, nigga. And, and what do you think about uh this whole um the kill Harry want us to trade out of New England? I can't hear what you say, brother. I can't hear what you say. <laughs> what do you think about the kill Harry wanting to be traded out of New England? Change the biggest tap on that time. Change his tap Get some wipes for this nigga. Put this bitch ass nigga over your fucking shoulder and burp this nigga before he starts talking, man. Okay, I think this dude take birth control pills. I swear to God, I think he does. Damn! For what? Tell, tell me, tell me why. Let's stay, let's stay right here. So, so, so what? What? what all are the nigga do. Who's the one that's so hot and left behind, nigga? Do, all he do is talk, man. I use the one that's so hot and left behind, nigga. What? Talk. What have you shut the fuck up since you've been on this show? All you do is talk. Nobody. What did you ever? What did you ever shut up? Nobody. I told you, nigga. My goal in life on this show is to fucking damage you, nigga. I'm never gonna called, shut up when you talk. The show is called Keep Pounding by Big Cat. He yeah, and, 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 and we're talking about sports. So as long as you keep talking, I'm gonna always have my foot on your damn neck, nigga. But yeah. Big Cat doesn't even get a word in. He can't get a word in because of your estrogen fucking. No, you can't get a word in. <laughs> you can't even get a word in. Like, you won't. You won't get a word in. Big Cat, the nigga drinks. You won't so get a word in. No, don't let Big Cat soup you up to get fucked up, nigga. The nigga don't let Big Cat soup you up to get fucked up. I'm not worried about y'all. Don't let him soup you up to get fucked up. The nigga drinks. So He's like, every time when somebody catch up to your ass, 
You know those old motherfucking snitches talking about Big Cat didn't protect me or some shit. Big Cat, you know, you know how Cheerios be in the milk. Yeah. Just, you know yeah, yeah. He got motherfucking birth controls you know? in the fucking milk, soy milk, eating that shit. That's how much extra. Where, 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 where are we going with this? Where, where are we going with this? Twan, what are we talking about here? Swan is weak as fuck. He's a female. The nigga can't keep his fucking mouth closed. Cal- he talks, he talks, I, I, I talks already told that. So I, 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 I've already explained to everybody why you're a female and why it's true. But if you want to, if you want to come behind me and say, "Nigga, I'm going to keep my foot on your fucking neck," the nigga, I will never let you just sit here and spew bullshit. The nigga talk more than a witness. Fuck you, real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You broke, motherfucker. Yeah, not want to fucking fight. You ain't got no fucking. That's what I'm saying. Like we not gonna do that. We not gonna fight. What are you talking about? You a broke bitch. You a broke motherfucker. You ain't got no money. The nigga talk. The nigga talk more than. Wendy Williams Telethon. Yo, please. This is going nowhere. This is going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> the nigga talk oh, you want? Wendy Williams Telethon. Like, yo, please. <laughs> I'm so funny. Okay. Okay. You okay. a broke yeah. motherfucker, nigga. You ain't got no fucking money. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm going to let y'all have it. Hey, <laughs> big cat, I want to talk about defense. <laughs> for the Panthers. Nah, you got to call back can. tomorrow. Y'all have a good night. You too, man. Y'all be safe. All right, now you too about thinking about it. Big Cat, what you uh, saying? Okay. Yeah, I want to talk about uh, send me fifty dollars. We can go back to the topic, but uh, send me fifty dollars, my G. I'll let you call back in and talk about defense. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but anyway, check your uh, email real quick. All right, the Panther News. Yeah. All right. Hey, I was tr- I wanted to get your thoughts. I on called it the Leo special. No doubt, no doubt. I want to get your thoughts well, on his people's are special. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I want to know. I want to know why I ne- ne- talking to broke people. Yeah, I want to know why Nikhil Harry left yeah, um the pa- the Patriots. He ain't got no fucking money. <laughs> Let me see. But look, big cat, what you got to say, bro? Why, why Nikhil Harry wants to leave New England? <laughs> oh, oh man, shit. Nik- <laughs> Nikhil Harry, man. <laughs> I liked him. In, I liked him in school, though. Um, I think it's. I think it's quarterback play, though. I think it's. I think it's quarterback. Play. Drop his ass just like that, too. I think it's quarterback play. I think he has. Oh, yeah. like a, I think he had his worst year with Tom Brady. So why? Why, why, why does he want to leave? Down. I thought everybody wanted to play no. with Cam Newton. Why? Cam threw two touchdowns. Brady threw him one. <laughs> Lee, I thought everybody wanted to play with Cam Newton, bro. But, but Nikhil Harry, he has talent. If you saw him in school, man, he ran back kicks. He ran back punts. Yeah. He could catch. He dominated on the field. He's kind of slow, but he has the size. I mean, I think it's predicated on the quarterback play. So we're going to see. But they're going to move him, though. They're going to move on from they him. Said the Leo's but but he guess what? Time. He also played with Tom Brady. Big Cat. Right. Nikhil I'm Harry. Say it again. Hey, hey, 704, let me say it again. Nikhil Harry Cam also threw, played with Tom Brady. Cam, Cam threw him two touchdowns in, in, in a small season with no help. Brady only threw him one in a full season and all the help. Big Cat. Yeah. Don't be surprised. Numbers never Falcons. lie, nigga. Don't be surprised if the Falcons pick him up. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I can see that. I can see yeah, that. Don't be surprised. Yeah. Because he, he has talent and ability. Yeah, I can um, see that. I can see that. Yeah. He has talent and ability. Mm-hmm. Damn, Cat, for real? It's what? like that, man. What? The shit, the shit we say don't matter, but if, but if, but if Leo say some shit is righteous. What are you talking about? <laughs> You alright, man? Fuck Leo. This thinking of no shit. Leo's good, man. He's a good guy. Yeah, man. I'm all right, man. I wish you would have told me that you were having a centennial if I, if, park. If I made if I made about two thousand off his ass, I call him a good guy too. I mean, well, you should be having a big cat then. I mean, it is what it is. Hey, big cat don't give a fuck about you, nigga. He's just using he, you to get money. It doesn't, it doesn't matter to me whether he cares or not. We, we just have a conversation. Bitch. It's all He's fun. a stupid bitch. Get on the phone. Get on the phone three fucking hours. He's dude. a dumb bitch. Shit, man. What the He's fuck? He's a dumb fucking bitch. We been on the phone. I've been on the phone three hours talking shit. Man, this is what I'm supposed to This is what we put in the deal. You don't get nothing out of this shit. What's the shit big cat? Ten bucks? This ten bucks, fifteen bucks. It's fun. You know, man, enough to get him a happy meal or some shit with. Okay. It's, now, it's now, fun. Now, Leo, listen, I'm it's planning fun. on going to Barnes and Nobles tomorrow, and the man. Process, he's still managing to get you to send him money. 
Or, or I'm still going to I'm still expecting to go to Barnes and Nobles tomorrow. You know, I like the little tea and brownie they be having. What what else books we got, man? Because I like to read, man. I would I would suggest stay away from the black shit okay. and focus more so on shit that's relevant. Well, seriously, like, I got a question for you. Like, like what books you recommend for making money? You got any books? I like I like those kind of books. You talking about for making money or just yeah. getting knowledge? No, just making money and shit. I like knowledge too. That shit can work too, man. Well, making money, you just man, I I can't really mm-hmm. tell you, brother, because I um money. You don't know no book about making money, bro. Mind. I mean, what I would do about <laughs> it is just what I suggest you could do. To honestly speaking, is mm-hmm. watch oh, videos. You ain't got none. You ain't got no fucking. So you said money's not a you said money's not a concern of yours. Because what I suggest you do is watch videos on stupid ass nigga working the bank ain't got no money. Visit, Watch videos like how I de- how these individuals monetize their YouTube channel. Yeah. Watch videos on how to invest in real estate and stuff like that. Lead him. Call from. T. You ain't even but the kid and mortgage, right? Yeah, I'm looking for a couple books to read tomorrow, man. For some needed little stock guy to invest in. What, what is Big Cat, you pay mortgage, right? No, 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 I don't. Big Cat, check this out, Big Cat. Focus. This nigga pay rent. He's trying to tell you what to get into. No, no, I don't no, pay rent. What, what I suggest you do, Big Cat, is try yeah. to expand this platform and monetize a channel. Like you said, you got, you got the video game shit going on. Yeah. Try to monetize that. Oh, so you've been watching, man. Why you ain't coming in and kicking with us? They've been asking about you in the game room. This show would have probably tripled already if you wasn't on it. I just play Madden, though, Big Cat. I don't play Yeah, Madden hop on like over that. there, brother. Why, why, why are y'all seeing at the game in town? I invest. Oh, if you were to invest, buy the neatest little stock guy to invest in, and that shit will actually help you invest in the stock market. Well, no, nah, I don't, don't want to invest in the stock market. I just want knowledge and shit. Leave the stock market alone, Big Cat. That shit is inflated. Now, why should I leave it alone, Leo? That is, that is, leave that, it alone, you, what, leave oh, it alone, okay, bro. what's your proof? Give me your proof. What is your proof? I got it in your pockets now trying to tell you how to make money. I got my proof. I invested in, I invested in Serious Type Radio. I invested in, um, Navio's Maritime Shipping. I got dividend every fucking month. So you tell me your proof where it doesn't work. Focus on Walmart. expanding your platform. <laughs> <laughs> anywhere. It doesn't hey, work. Seven. Hey, hey, seven on four. channels monetized. Basically. Yo. Now, Lee, are you calling oh, this guy a nigger and a liar? This nigger is so fucking dumb, dumb the man. Dividend. The name is called Dividend. Get your get get dividend. Get your get your get your dividend. 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 They're trying to tell Big Cat how to make money, and Big Cat is making money off of him. Big Cat, what you do is invest in. You don't give me any money. You don't give me any money. You don't give me any money. I give you a book to read. You read the book. You pick your own investments. You pick your own investments. Is that a Batman I see? You don't even know me. Yeah, I don't know you. You read the book. That's my baby right there. And build your own platform. Focus on experience. It's amazing. Wait, 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 what about wisdom, Leo? You got a book about the wisdom? The wisdom is get the book, <laughs> The Alchemist, and it'll teach you about. Now, is that some Muslim stuff, bro? No, 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 okay, no, no. Okay. That's not Muslim. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. I mean, it, it, it's, it has like, you know, the characters are Arab. Arab, Arab yeah, that's cool. But, that's cool. Um, the, the, the premise of the book is, you know, have you lived it? Have you and, done it? And That's the question. Have you lived it? Seven hundred four. I got this. I have invested nah, yeah, my I own see money. It. I see it. I took five hundred dollars, right invested my own money, and I flipped it. Have you done that? Okay. I'm stuck in four. You know, I wrote them telling them to come out liquid. with a Spider Man. Right? Are you liquid? You understand the word liquid means? You said Spider Man. No. Eighteen inch. He does it. He does oh. it. Big cat. Yes, sir. Hey, big cat. Oh. You, hey, look, you really should be getting your 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 your, your economic advice from reliable sources and not this. No, Leo thing. said he's well off, right, Leo? Le- Leo ain't well no, off. No, I don't know. Nigga, you run a you run a fucking pyramid scheme on the way. Leo, you ain't running no pyramid scheme, are you? Read the book and do your own justice. Nah, nah, no sir. Okay. Big cat, get 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 you, you know. 
get you get to that YouTube, get that game shit going on. Yeah. Focus. He on said things like the. He said stocks no ain't nothing. Off YouTube. He said stocks ain't nothing. YouTube okay, channel focus. down. Once they set your YouTube channel down, then you have no income. Big Find K. a way to get dividends. Big K. Get yeah. that YouTube Money shit getting paid. Off. That's called residuals. Big He's K. not talking about yeah. residuals. When you get that I'm YouTube back. Off, I'm going to I'm gonna go back to a very important question the old boy just asked, right? Because any nigga that know anything about money would know this. What, Karen? What the fuck does liquid mean? Big K. Liquid means... I can cash out right no, now. No, no, no. Let me Right let now. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. I can put my hands on money today. Today. If I'm not liquid, that means I got to sell my stock, wait three days for the stock to settle, then no. I get my money. If I'm liquid, let, I get my money right there. You should have let, you should have let that, like, you should have let Black Karen answer that shit since he knows so much about it. Hey, big cat. Yeah. You listen, brother. Yeah, I'm here, brother. Focus on expanding. He ain't sound. got no fucking money. You ain't got no money, Leo. Big he sound yeah. tired. Why the fuck you gonna fix him away from you, nigga? Big cat, upgrade, upgrade the systems that you have. Upgrade. The well, phone okay, line Leo, Leo, Leo. I'm talking about big cat, gentlemen, gentlemen, gentlemen. It's not about we're not we're not measuring money. I'm talking to Big Cat. No, 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 no. I don't know about you, nigga. No, no. I don't know what you're I got a simple question. Take some of that money. Simple question. Take some of your money. Hey, Leo, are you watching the TV right now? I can go get whatever the fuck I want. I'm laying down. Oh, okay. Big Cat, invest money. Invest money. Hold on, I'm going to ask you a question real quick. Big Cat. Invest money in upgrades. Don't you sound tired. Whether, 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 it's, whether, whether it's the microphone. Yeah. And the pack you ain't got no damn money. And on you the, ain't got the, no money. And on the video game shit. Upgrade. You didn't even know what liquid meant. Because so, so, you, so, so the audio can be supreme. So you ain't got to Yeah, I'm about, about to say it. fuck this shit, Leo. I'm gonna, uh, <laughs> You want to uh, say fuck it? Okay, then. Yeah, I'll, I'll probably do the game and shit. I'll be ready. Yeah, yeah, hey, yo, Leo, 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 Leo. Just do the game, bro. Yo, Leo, Leo, Leo. Hey, you ain't making Focus no money. Your hey, money make, that. Ain't making no like, money. Yeah, it's just a couple of dollars. Leo. Here, yeah. But. Hey, yo, Leo, Leo. Focus on Real the TikTok quick. shit, brother. Real quick. Focus on the TikTok. Because TikTok will pay you too, brother. Now, Focus I, I, on how that. How do you get so smart, Leo? Bro? How do you get so smart? I got, I, got, I got a question for you real okay, quick. Real, real quick, gentlemen, real, real quick. Let me talk to the host of the show real quick. What? I'm no, what you think you can You don't want to talk because he's asking you questions, you bitch. They're going to tell me who to talk to. He right now, yeah. he was your deprecate. Now you made him feel important, and now you don't want he to stop. He's important. He's American. What's the rule of 72? He's a fucking American. He's a fucking American. So he can put it online. But I'm serious, a big cat. The TikTok shit and the game shit. Yeah. Man, you upgrade all that, you 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 make money, bro. And that'd be good. Eh? You got Madden on, on Xbox? Nigga, I put Big Cat on TikTok. I'm on the old PS4 system. Oh, okay. No, he's right. He he is right. You can make money off that platform. But do you have residual income after it's gone? After somebody right. else is bigger than you? What right. is your residual income? Big Cat, they giving away. Hey, man, Leo, hey, look, that motherfucker don't know nothing about listening to your income, cat, bro. They giving, they giving away stuff. So big I cat, hope you ask him, Big Cat. He, he yeah, don't know. Big Cat, once you get 100,000 so followers, money. Big Cat, once you get 100,000 subscribers, once you start getting over 100,000 views annually in a week, bro, they give you a check for $10,000. Every month, brother. Yeah, I probably hang this shit up. Lying ass nigga. Lying ass nigga. That's awful. That is not how it works. That is not how it works. Hold on, hold on. No, no, no. The thing's right. The thing's right. No, no, no. He's Leo. He is Leo. Hey, brother Leo, you fucking smart, Leo. Big K. So why you haven't started your own, Leo? Big K. So why you haven't started your own? Why you tell a nigga I'm going to make money and you ain't making it? Big K. No, let's say he's right. You're getting $10,000 a month. But once they set down your stream, or views, what is your dividend after that? Big Cat, Yo, what's you up? get you focus on that game shit and that TikTok shit, and you promote it hard, mm -hmm. and you get the and you get <laughs> you get the system and the audio and everything together. What's wrong with his system and audio now? 
when you get all that shit together, oh, 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 right, right, right. So here's the thing. Big cat, so get the, get what I do is this. You a smart you boy, Leo. I'll tell you that. <laughs> I, I didn't have to do nothing, and I get residual income. I have That's made good. no YouTube videos. That's I do bro. nothing. That's I get bro. a paycheck. That's good for you. You too positive. That's hey, look, look, look. He, Leo, Leo doesn't deal with God. He doesn't deal with successful black men. He likes to talk to dumb motherfuckers, bro. Big cat. Yeah. No, but, but hold on, but hold on for... That's one, why. One, that's one, why. Second. That's why he's not. That's why he's not acknowledging you. Just, just, just one, one quick second. I'm gonna say that's why he's not acknowledging you because he knows you're better than him. So I'm, I'm giving you a jewel, cat. Find this jewel. It's called a neatest little stock market investing book. Find that. Hold book. on, hold on. Let me, let me ask my lawyer here. Leo, is that a good book? Big cat, don't leave that stock market shit alone, brother. Why, brother? Big cat. Big cat, come on, man. This black man. This black man. I'm trying to give you some honest. This black man. Why should you leave the line? Why should you leave the line? When Teppa got, Tepa got, when Tepa got millions off that. It's too Why? volatile, big cat. Oh, Why leave it on when Tepa got his millions off, off the stock market? Now, Carla, I heard they be pumping that. I heard like the big motherfucker be pumping it. This motherfucker is trying to tell you how not to make money. Big cat is some rich dad. What kind of shit is that? Man? What's rich dad poor dad? Tell me about that rich dad poor dad. It's a. Uh, a what's the question again? Rich dad poor dad. A, a, a Asian dude wrote the book. I forgot his name about how. No, it's a white make... dude wrote the book. No, I wish that for everybody. Oh, sorry, the white it's the least little guy that's stock market investing. Yeah, them reality shows. It's a fake, great though. book. Ain't shit fake on keep out on TV. See, I, mean, I made money off the book. Mm -hmm. Matter of fact, before Sirius started, Radio started off, I brought the stock for one dollar, and now it's up to what twenty five, thirty dollars. I brought a shipping company that paid three dollars twenty five cents a share and paid a dividend every daggone month. How long I brought a, um, it's called Osiris. Osiris take, was a body scanning thing they put in the airport. Why are you that. trying to explain this to a how dumb nigga that don't know how to make that? money? Because that's you, something sir? that we don't know what to how do with. No money, bro. That, we need sir. to he invest. Does no, no. He does this. It's not we. He does it. He's a hating motherfucker, bro. You say you cook, right, too, don't you, brother? No, I don't cook, but tell me how to. Oh, I thought you said you. I thought you said you was a chef. My no, no, nah, hell, no, nah, nigga. I know you said you were going to say you was a chef. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you were talking and to me, brother. Your money, but it make, you money. make your money Still like talking about, uh, Your money okay. should work for you. Yeah, he never came up here and said shit about, about him. Make <laughs> your money go to work. Tired, brother? Big cat. Yeah. Big cat. Big cat. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you straight up, brother. <laughs> oh shit, man. Focus on that TikTok and that <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You'd be all right, bro. Oh yeah, yes sir. And be honest, you can do both. Focus on TikTok and invest. Just pass the nigga bitch, huh? He just say anything. Or YouTube, invest your money. <laughs> you said, I your thought you said work. you was the chef. No, no, no. Upgrade the mic. Upgrade the Make microphone. your money work. Oh yeah. Upgrade the audio that you got for the game. Facts. Good, brother. Now let me let me ask the black guy right here. And now Leo, let me ask you when you how you how you find out about the game. No, I heard you mention it, but I got, I got, I got a cousin. He, he, he did that game shit. Big cat, big cat. Check this out. My cousin been doing the game shit since two thousand and like nine. Yeah. This motherfucker got over like five hundred thousand oh, followers. Damn, what's, 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 what's the name of the follower? No, 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 no. Don't ask me nothing about it. Don't ask me nothing. About <laughs> damn. So we can't support him. We can't support him. <laughs> we can't support him. No, 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 shit about it. Don't none of y'all ask brother Leo. Tell the ass, brother Leo. Don't we can't. None of y'all ask you. Nigga it. don't exist. That's why. Cat, 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 little lot ass. That shit don't exist. My cousin. That shit don't exist. Your cousin ain't doing this shit, nigga. Your cousin be playing the room. In the room smoking weed like any other nigga. Stop lying. Let's talk about social Yeah, yeah. Let's talk about about social success. What do you do? How do you make money? What does your portfolio look like? Huh? What does your portfolio? What? No, no. Let's talk about your money. Stop talking about other people's money. What do you do? Yeah, my cousin, thirty-five. What do you do? He ain't broke in seven years. You broke as fuck. You ain't got no money. The cat, my yeah. cousin, thirty-five. He ain't worked seven years. Wow. All he do is flip off that game shit, brother. What he doing? Twitch or stuff, bro? 
you know, he 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 started. It was like Fortnite shit made him. Oh, okay. Big Cat Fortnite had made him over like one fifty a year. God damn. He was making. Money so what is he doing for retirement? Look at his line in Big Cat. Big Cat. Big Cat. Now, now, Leo, you want a lot of me? Would you? Big Cat. I seen the link to his shit one day. Okay, yeah, yeah, send it to me privately. Yeah. I'll send it to you one day. Okay. But look here. One day. Usually he's telling he'll send it to you right away. Now he's saying he'll send it to you one day. Yo, yeah, Leo, why'd you say one day, my G? Game shit, okay. Game shit. Look at the camera. Right now, NXT. Hey, big cat, tell him to send it to you tomorrow, man. Tell him to send it to you tomorrow. 2011. It was eleven dollars a share. Uh -huh. Now it's one hundred ninety-eight dollars a share. Now you made a lot of money. That man. builds in income. You made that a lot of money. Brings that brings in future money. Yeah, that's good. That's so good. I mean, you can make a lot of money doing YouTube. That yeah, is okay. true. But yeah. after it ends, Fuck what are you gonna do with your money? Do you that's have well. to invest. You have to make sure it grows. Treat your money like soldiers. I mean, I, 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 I now, Leo, you make six yeah, figures, don't you, bro? I know you saying Buckhead, right? Yeah, no, 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 block away, like. So you about six figures, huh? You about a hundred k a year? No, 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 sir, no, sir, no, not, no, not at all, brother, not at all. I'm a simple dude living a simple life, brother. I save my money. I take care of my responsibility. Yeah, I'm, and we know. So you're a good, you know you're a good fucking, you're a simple, good American. That's what you are. That's broke, nigga. Talk. So like, you're like a good American, ain't you? Once again, treat your money like soldiers. Put them to work. Yeah, if you if you, if you can That's do that. That's broke nigga talk. Now, now big cat. Yeah. He, he's not. He's, you know, I like you. Need, you know, I like uh, facts and, and stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Now they said um, Fortnite made them, but Fortnite came out in January of two thousand and January <laughs> oh. <laughs> January fifth, two thousand seventeen. Leo. <laughs> and that made them right. So Fortnite made them in two thousand seventeen. It's two thousand twenty one. But he started in what? 2000 and what, nine? He said? Oh, shit. He called him in the number one. Right? <laughs> Leo, Leo, you're not lying, are you, bro? <laughs> so, how, so how did Fortnite start him way in 2017 when you was going in 2009? That nigga keep forgetting niggas got to live at this. Leo. <laughs> Leo, please tell me you're not lying to me, brother. Are you? Yeah. They clown. They clown. They clown. This motherfucker got all lying again. So you wasted your time with a lie. Big cat. Yeah. Like I told you, focus on the game shit. Gotcha. And then TikTok, and make sure if that's what you want to do. Like I said, you oh. could make a lot of money off of that. You sure Grand Theft Auto didn't make them? You know something that been out for a while. Because you could do, you could, you could make it. Now I'm about to get off. Like, listen, 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 bro. Don't ever take advice from a motherfucker who's trying to tell give you advice and some shit he ain't never did. No, Leo, Leo said he's living comfortably. <laughs> well, no, no, I think just said he was living simple. <laughs> Double, look. Simple and, and, and comfortable is not the same thing, bro. He said, I'm just a basic guy living a basic life. Yes, sir. That's me, sir. That's me. That's a, it's, right. like, it's like a good American. So I, why does Big Cat keep trying to make it seem like you got money? Big Cat. Yeah. Everybody different. Just because he's working in a bank. That I nigga just counts some money in the bank. He ain't no bank manager in no I, like I live in my lane. I'm, 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 a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a cool well, dude. Well, living in Florida living and different things, when to live that lifestyle, that ain't simple. I, I yeah, nigga, so I shouldn't even be fucking talking to you. You right. You I shouldn't even be lane. talking to me. I, got, I make too much money to be talking to you. I live in my lane, baby. But ain't nobody yeah. talking about the future. Ain't nobody talking about when you get old. Nigga, my life is going to you. Sit down. <laughs> Your money has to work. Your money I has to work for you. You can't keep doing... Fortnite yeah. the whole time because Fortnite gonna go away to be something else. You gotta actually have that, your man. money work for you. I don't care about that. That's what you want to do. Sir. I, know I don't, don't care about that shit. You, you live for you live for the day. I know you don't know me. That's why you got no money. You don't know me, sir. I live for the future. That's why you got no fucking money, You don't know me, sir. Put him in his place, Leo. We got time. We got time, Leo. Put him. It's all right, everybody. Everybody. Man, fuck that, Leo. Put him in his place. Tell him. No, he's already in his place. He can't put him in his place if you don't know what he's talking. Man, he ain't got no fucking money, bitch. Huh? This is the pay. No, Leo just came back from vacation. I know he got some money. Live for your future, not for your present. 
Mm-hmm. Let me let me ask you this, Leo. You got money saved up, Leo? This nigga ain't got no money saved up. Yeah, I got This nigga ain't got no damn money. I know you got some money oh. saved up, G. All I want to know is what your cousin was doing that 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 the other eight years on Fortnite. What now? Yeah, when that shit wasn't even didn't even appear. When that shit wasn't even made. But like I said, Big Cat, if you focus on that game shit, man, like I said, Big Cat, do it, brother. You gonna send Big Cat a simile or something like that? Yeah, send me, send me, send me a link, bro. I'm knocking, I'm not knocking your Fortnite. Put your money, put your money to work. Your money you're saving, put that money to work. Do your Fortnite. Oh, do your your uh, you. your um test thing. But actually take those extra dollars and put them to work. Man, don't put your money. No so they can double like and triple. <laughs> okay, stop that shit. Man. Lil, you lost some money in the stock market, my chick. Keep it up. Man, I lost some money in that shit. Fuck that shit. Put your money in the stock market. If you get some money, I should buy some real estate. Yeah, yeah. If you get some money, buy some real estate. Maybe you know what the fuck he was doing. Buy some real estate. Put your money on some real estate. Nigga, we're putting a thousand or some shit in there. God damn. Put your money on some real estate. Put your money on some real estate. How, how much? How, how much? How much you lost, bro? Just keep it a buck. <laughs> oh, no, I ain't really, I ain't really lose. You know, it just, it just went down. That's it. Oh, it just went down. <laughs> that shit uh, dropped on his head. Hey, you didn't talk to no this. broker or nothing, bro? Nah, nah, I ain't. I, I was a novice with it. It was just like something to do. I mean, I'm not. I wasn't serious about that shit. I don't have enough money to invest in. Oh, money. okay. You were just gambling. With yeah, yeah. It. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's fucking around. You know, it's fucking All around. Right. Well, Five hundred bucks. You invest. Okay. You make your money double. Hey, it's called one seventy two. You actually you can invest in. your own money. I have to call in. Yeah, but um, I'm about to get my ass on out of here though. Hey, That's why you about to get off. Yeah, go ahead and bounce <laughs> because right, you're giving bad advice. Oh my God! You see how the Negro does, the cat. What a minute, fucking play! You got time, Leo? Stick around. No, 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 no! I got to go. I got to. No, nah, man, you can't I be walking out here yeah, taking no L. You ain't got to do shit, man. Just hang up. As, as soon as they disagree with you, they want to be buying just, all just that. Hang up. Yeah. And as soon and as soon as the blacks really, and as soon as, hang as hang the blacks working up. together, you want to run off. Just hang up. Just hang up. Just hang the fuck up. Leo, what time you got to write about, Leo? When the black star sharing some real knowledge, you want to run off like a little coon ass thing. No, no, no. I got good knowledge. But just hang up. If you want to leave, just hang up. Don't get no speech. Just hang up. You don't know how to do that. You don't know how to do that. Leo, you going to let these motherfuckers park you, bro? He loves us. Like he got to go to sleep. Just hang up, dude. That's all you got to do. Nigga, you got an off day tomorrow. Understand this, I'm my own boss. You work for the man. Damn. So you gotta go you gotta go check in. I ain't yeah, gotta, gotta check in. Damn, no they can't, you just open up my eyes to some more shit though, be cat. I certainly do. You told him to tell the truth about the stock market. He got sensitive about it. Now in the past when we talk about shit and we bring up those topics, he gets sensitive about it. Damn. So it all connects to me. It all connects. It's like connect for. Well, um yeah, I still work for Bobby, yo, this thing up, man. I still, I look, I still, I still say I work for a company. My goal yeah, is yeah, to work for the white man. Hang up, just leave. No, no, my my goal is to, nobody cares. You're gonna say, boss. just leave. You know? <laughs> <laughs> you you you, you <laughs> waste your time. You hear me? I hear him. He popping off on your ass, bro. He popping. He popping off on your ass, Leo. Look at him, bro. Yeah, go to bed. Look at him. Look at him. Yeah, go to bed. Hang up. He popping off on your ass, Leo. Okay, it's all right, big cat. He, he a the American Negro. I ain't surprised. <laughs> yeah, I ain't surprised you a faggot. But hang hey, on. Look, look, there you go. There you go. Look, 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 look. There they go, big cat. Damn. They can't control. Nah, I'm, they can't. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I should. I should, I should, I should, I should call you one of. No, man. No, no, we don't. No, no, no. We don't. No, 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 okay. I got, still, a, I got a fucking damn. Okay, I got a dentist appointment in the morning. I ain't okay, running off to go to sleep. Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. Hey, look. Hey, look, bro. Thank you, brother. Call me a fag, bro. Anytime you're in a historical chat, or financial chat, nigga, you check that game with me. Okay, but I'll do that, brother. Damn, bro. If you want to do that. You talk to me. Okay, but we say your name was T. Yeah, T. T, all right. T, T, where you from? You from, you from North Carolina? T, where you from? Damn, I'm from Wilmington, North Carolina. Good old Wilmington. Hey, Good old Wilmington. Right, right, Leo. 
Hey, T, look, T, T said, T called me a fag. Damn, T, I got to be on. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. 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 I'm s
Damn, it's gonna be raining like hell tomorrow. Mm. Mm. Take my get my ass up and go to the dentist. Shout out to that nigga Foe. You gotta know, you gotta know who to fucking do business with. So when I when I when I purchased it from my nigga, I made sure the packaging was right. I said, let me see how he gonna send it. Is he gonna deal with me treacherously? <laughs> I he... don't even know how I sent it. Nah, I, I got it right here. I, just, I told you the first time he opened it from the rapper. So I was testing you to see if he was gonna send it nigga relief. But uh, you did it. You sent it pure, man. So this is the reason why I want to... Look at this beautiful bitch here. And you know what, 704? What's good? You know what? You know you know this is the... uh. You know this is the variant, right? You know that, right? I guess, uh, I guess yeah. you consider the variant. Because you know, there's one with him not leaping. There's a one on here that's not leaping. Oh, oh no! Nah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know this is the about. one that's leaping. Check that's that true. motherfucker out. That motherfucker beautiful, bro. Now LeBron's a bitch ass nigga and shit, bro. <laughs> he is. He's a bitch ass nigga. But this this Space Jam one. Now that shit fire. Fuck man. So I want the shoe to go with it, man. Facts. Look at that motherfucker. That's a beautiful bitch. Catch that nigga when he leaving out of San Clair somewhere. Get that nigga to sign it. Just, yeah, he might do a sign. No, he'll probably do something out there in Cali. Yeah, it's two different types, though. I want you to know that. There's, oh, no, I know there, it. There's Trust one me, where he's dribbling and there's one where he's in the air. That motherfucker. Nah, I, pay, I paid attention. This is the one I wanted, man. I could have got a, uh, a black light, um, like the rabbit shit. The uh, Alice in the Wonderland. Alice in Wonderland. Right, Hold up. Why the fuck? <laughs> I'm tired of this shit. <laughs> Why the fuck are you collecting Le LeBron James pops and you saying Michael Jordan is the GOAT? He is the GOAT. You gotta understand who I am. Who am I? 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 Seven oh four. What do I like to do? Seven oh four. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I want. I want you to. I'm gonna learn you. I'm gonna learn you. Seven oh four. What I like to do? Oh, hold tight. Hold tight. Hold tight. Goddamn, you hold tight. Seven oh four. <laughs> Tell this nigga what I like to do. I like to make money, right? That's a fact. So I'm gonna hold it. I'm gonna I'm gonna style. I'm gonna profile on y'all asses for a so while. That, so that's not. So that's not. That's not natural. That's not just for you. That's not. Oh, it's for me until the, until the price goes up. When the price goes through the roof, then it's time for it to be somebody else's. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I want. You know, that's why I want the shoes. That's why I want the shoes. You know, there's some kind of there's some kind of red funky ass. Um, uh, what are they called? Yeezy? What are they called? Red Yeezys or something? Them motherfuckers are like <laughs> worth a couple thousand dollars now. What the? Well, uh, I was gonna say I know his Red October shit. So yeah, that's it. That's it right there. That's <laughs> it. What did you say? Red October. Yeah, the Red October. Then when they first came out, they were what? I mean, they were just like retail. Like, now back them, then it was shit. Whatever, like one fifty, two hundred. Now them motherfuckers threw the roof for a couple grand, man. Them Red Octobers. Matter of fact, let's go to eBay right now. Now, I think one of them shit sold in some auction for some millions. I think. Man, that shit crazy. That's why I know when Lee Fag retired, this shit gonna be lit, bro. Hey, you see that shit I posted with with with, uh, with, with, with Mike? Uh, yeah, hell yeah. Hey, he was like, man, shit, niggas, that's how I play. You don't want to play get the fuck on? <laughs> that nigga the goat, bro. Hey bro, I'm in this this pop group, and these motherfuckers are here complaining and crying and saying, "Has anybody else ever ordered from Big Apple Collectibles?" <laughs> <laughs> you said word from Big Apple Collectibles. Big Apple Collectibles. Hey, these motherfuckers gonna learn, bro. <laughs> Never. 
Man, big, big Apple collectibles. You wanted some shit today, man. You won't see that shit until 2023. Yeah, brother. Man. I see you. That should have been shut them people down, man. I they see your cousin your trying to sell they some take shit. Your money immediately. They don't. They don't charge you when it come in. They take your money right away. Hey, hey, settle for you see Rockhead said. Oh. <laughs> about the LeBron. Look at the chat. Oh, bro. yeah. What's up about the LeBron? <laughs> <laughs> nah, man, y'all better snatch that Space Sham up. I know it's going to be a horrible fucking movie. <laughs> I, when I seen the preview, bro, yeah. like... It, Oh, I'm shorter than Kevin Hart. I'm like, God damn that lame as fuck, bro. That shit gonna be I ain't even watched the first one. Man, I'm the, watching the GOAT. I'm watching man. the GOAT movie. Oh, you gotta watch the first one. Nah, I'm watching the GOAT movie on my birthday. What is it, 16, the bro? GOAT movie. But when I get back, I'll be watching the GOAT movie. <laughs> I'm watching that shit, man. Where you going? Nothing but that GOAT. Hey, where you going, bro? Huh? Where you going? Um, Saudi Arabia. What are you doing out there? Mecca, and 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 to be more, you know, specific. So you gonna be living in like huts and shit, bro? I'm living with a family when I get there. I'm talking about like huts and shit. Though. They don't specifically have a lot of furniture. Your boy gonna be on the floor a lot. <laughs> well, well, no, listen, no, no, all jokes aside, bro. Like, I use CPAP. No I use CPAP and shit. So I breathe. See, they got outlets and shit for you. You got CPAP or no? I can't hear you. You got you got CPAP and shit. Yeah, I got CPAP. How you gonna plug that motherfucker in over there? How am I gonna put it in over there? I got a universal cord. What's what's that? I got a universal cord. They gave us a packet of everything that we need when traveling there. Things that are different. Oh, they got outlets and shit. Yeah, that's oh, a okay. universal cord. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. But um, as far as like my cell phone and shit, like I can only like I can only use it like to call back home, um, take pictures outside of the um, of the gym, and um, you know. It's, you know, it's it's just supposed to just be a holy time. You know what I'm saying? It's just now. Prayer. Wait a minute, wait a minute. And, and when you going? Huh? When is your birthday? July 16th. And where you going? I'm leaving that morning. And you just said you gonna watch the movie on your birthday. What? I gotta stop that line, man. <laughs> You niggas gotta stop that lying. Who gotta stop the lying? Hey man, have y'all tried these motherfucking these things called um they call like popcorn, but they be like snick. I, I said I'll watch that movie when I get back. Oh, okay. I will talk <laughs> I mean I I I, I iterated that. <laughs> hey, y'all seen the motherfucking popcorn that got like snicker and then like like crunchy shit? It's new. Nah. It, it's new. They came out with it. It's called like Snicker popcorn. You yeah, seen this shit? Kane, I'm, I'm going to. I'm going to go do Hodge. It's pilgrimage to Mecca. Darren Kincaid, check check your email. I sent you a picture of, of something mine back. I mean, why you got your you email on the audience? You you, what, what you think I'm playing games? You, you try to catch me alive with my with my shit? No, 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 man, no. Nah. You know you're alive. Uh, I'm telling you, bro. Listen, the only thing. I'm and what the fuck you, happened I'll to Chad Zilla? He hopped his ass off I'll here. No, bro. I'm gonna be a much better Muslim, bro. I gotta learn how to stop cursing, bro. Just, nah, I'm, I'm gonna make so sure Leo don't. Stop. Leo ain't gonna, gonna, gonna allow you to do that. Praying for more of over there. So talk to me. So why you, why you why you why you cuss so much? It says I always did not been cussing since was five, bro. <laughs> so what, um, what did it do for you? Yeah, my household accepted it. You know what I'm saying? I mean. My mom was allowing me to curse. I mean, we couldn't say like strong words, you know what I'm saying? Like, but damn shit. She'd just be like, hey, you know what I'm saying? 
you know, we couldn't say the F word or nothing like that or whatever. But made you I feel don't good, like, man. Me and my sisters been cussing each other out did forever. It, did it make you feel good though? What'd you say? Did it make you feel good? I can't hear you, bro. You're talking too low. You're doing it on purpose. No, did it make you feel good? Does it make me feel good to curse? Yeah. It's just emotion, man. All I feel is emotion. It's so Leo was right. You mean tell me Leo was right, man? What about what? <laughs> what about what? Yeah, I had a Karen that was on my car. She's going to try to tell me you use some damn bubble wrap. Oh, really? I don't yeah, know she what thought I was going to buy a damn Chucky. <laughs> Bitch, fuck your Chucky. <laughs> What's wrong with it, man? I don't know. I, th I think she damaged that box. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, it's all good. I got a, another one on another one. Uh, well, I found the box, so it's all good. Let me, let me ask you the 704. You got Carolina Panther autograph stuff in there, right? Yeah, hell yeah. You, you got Cam Newton autograph? No, uh huh. Mm -hmm. Are you planning on getting, a, getting his autograph at some point? I mean, it all depends on like what it is. Mm -hmm. What about, what about, you You got 16 by 20, you don't, or you don't do that? Uh, no, I do. Because I think that's why I, I want to start doing. Yeah, Ray got me into it's, that. It's getting, like, photos and stuff hanging up. That shit beautiful, man. That shit beautiful. Ray, Ray put me onto that. It just depends on what it is, to tell you the truth. That's like that DJ stuff. I think that DJ stuff, they about to start selling. Mm -hmm. I mean, the first go around, you can just kind of get whatever. Yeah, he said he's shipping out Monday. Oh, it's wrong. I'm about to get to go to one of the most beautiful places on earth, bro. Because somebody just posted a Luke Kigley, I think it was, or was it Steve Smith? No, I think it was Luke Kigley. And that shit was nice, the big ass. So, uh, I think that was about 18, about 20. Uh, how much? Uh, shit. Well, they was doing it about, a, you know, about 10 spots, but I think oh, it okay. was, um, okay. I forgot how much they were charging the spot. Oh, okay. But I think it was 100 and something, though, I think. But I think, no, matter of fact, I think somebody fucked around and bought that outright, though. Because that's what some people do. They see it and they just like, hey, take, 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 take this shit down. I'll buy it out, outright. Well, let me ask you, do, do you know when he's having another Christian, man? I want to say something, man. Oh, no. Nah, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a wrap. Fuck. It's probably for us, unless he'll do it sometime during uh, the season. Oh, yeah, that's right. He did say it was it, huh? He gave niggas they, <laughs> gave niggas they last chances. I don't. I don't blame him though, man. Cause you know his daddy said he paid. He paid them niggas up front, bro. Fuck off. Nah, I wish I. W I wish I would have. All right, so I went to. Uh, I don't know. Did you try it? Uh, down there where Chazilla is. It's called uh, Game Day Connect Connection Connection. Game Day Connecting. Uh, it's in Texas. Own... Oh, it's in Texas. Yeah, I sent some shit into them. I mean, it, you know. Gotta be careful, man. Some of these motherfuckers be on that rinky, rinky dink shit when they don't handle your shit with care. You know what I mean? Nah, facts. I think uh, Seven Four Chad was saying something about a company. Mm -hmm. He's like they do signings, but like just to get Steph Curry shit is down. But it's Steph Curry though. Oh, where He's Curry right here. Where Curry at? Oh, uh, hold on. I have to look for it. But you gonna pay a grip though? Uh, shit, I know Christian shit right <laughs> like two plus. I mean, I, so I know I know it gotta be like two plus, huh? Oh, hey, it's more than that. Well, shit, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, man. I, I, two, hey, when you start talking hey, about two and up, man, that's when they start shit like crazy. How much? How much he want though for real, out of curiosity? I, don't see, I, I mean, the shit I seen, it was like three and four. It just oh, depends okay. on what it was. Okay. I'm about to go look for it though. I got another Brian Burns item coming, man. Think about replacing. Think about replacing. Hey, Darren Kincaid, you gonna have to come on the show once we do a Funko Pop show. 
And how long? How long was the trip? How long was the trip? Seventeen hours. Straight. Huh? Straight. Nah, we gotta stop and refuel. Where? Um, I don't know yet. Shit. I ain't, I ain't, I didn't look and see where we stopped. What was, what was your longest trip prior to this? The longest to this? Yeah. Shit. Um. China. You been to China? Hong Kong. Yeah. Really? I went there in, co- in college. Yeah. What, what are you doing over there? Uh, it was a, we had to go to a school over there, uh, when I was at, uh, Marquette and, um, we had to do a presentation, um, on a medication that, um, pe- that the, that was, the college of Marquette was working on with clinical trials and, uh, presented, um, to one of their classes over there that did the same thing. And, um, they were presenting some drug that China had made at the time to us, you know what I'm saying, and it was also, you know, for sightseeing and shit like that or whatever. I can tell you the food, the, the Chinese food that they make over there is good as hell. It's better than, um, it's better than, what's the name, man, uh, what's that, Panda? Well, I mean, Panda they tell you where to go because yeah. you can't eat all that shit. You know, they eat other shit, you know what I'm saying, but like, they got commercialized Chinese eating spots, like, the street food is good, bro. Yeah. I don't even know if I've ever had Panda Express. Now, Fo, you fuck with Panda, don't you? No, I don't even know if I've never had it. You had Panda. You don't know what a Panda Express is? what? Panda Express. I, don't, I mean, I haven't seen it. I don't think I never had it, though. You never had Panda, Panda Express? Panda Express is some... Yeah. Some, uh, can't you say I have? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it ain't shit, but it's, it's good, though, man. You get, get some of that motherfucking Bang Bang shrimp, uh, that peak, uh, the walnut mm-hmm. shrimp, and that orange chicken. You like lo mein nah, noodles and shit, don't you? Uh, yeah, but I got Chinese school, bro. I I got my own little Chinese spot. So I ain't never got hey, it from them, though. You ever um you ever ate a payway? Hell no, I don't even know what that is. <laughs> they got some decent. They got some decent stuff. Is that black on? No. <laughs> oh, thank God. Yeah, 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 no, don't own no damn Chinese shops. <laughs> oh okay. Where where where's it at? Have you ever seen one? No. I don't even know what that shit is. Yeah, and they definitely gonna make sure that don't happen. <laughs> what is it? I mean, I don't know, bro. I mean, I guess black people don't want to own Chinese food places, man. No, I'm saying you don't. What I'm, saying, I'm saying, what is a payway? Payway? Yeah, what the fuck is that? It's like uh, Chinese food and Thai food. Yeah, I ain't never heard no shit like that. It's good. I like I like pad thai. I know you ate some pad thai before. No, I had some Filipino food, man. Pata, beef pata, it's good, bro. You what's that ha- Haitian and shit, bro? Haiti's and shit. Mm-hmm. Thai food. I don't do a lot of Chinese food, though. I mean, like, mm, like you know, the ribs that they, <laughs> them bright ribs that they call ribs or whatever. You know, like back when I was even eating pork. Like, you know, on the buffets and stuff, be looking weird, bro. You know what I'm saying? So, we talking about China, all, I, I know they don't, they place look totally different over there. It's like they don't make that same stuff they make here unless you go to a commercial spot. Hey, man, you supposed to be flying me out to Raleigh, you say? Flying you out to Raleigh? You gonna give me some ass, nigga? <laughs> nah, but I call up a stranger. <laughs> <laughs> Call up a stranger for you. <laughs> Fly me out, man. Put you hang out. I thought, I thought, I thought Muslim was all about brotherly love, bro. Nah, man, you can do that six hours, bro. You can, bro. Six hours. Six. Man, when you move your ass to Charlotte, that's the about as far as I go. If for Charlotte ain't number two hours and six minutes from here, man. I I'll hop in that motherfucker right now and be there by goddamn seven AM before seven AM. Well, that's even quicker then. That means you can just get to Raleigh in five hours. Five, five Fuck hours, no, man. I ain't driving up there. Five, bro. I almost went to school in Greensboro, man, the UNCG. Why you didn't go there? They offered me a scholarship and at the last what moment. Yeah, they offered me a scholarship, but then at the last moment they pulled it back, man. So I was like, "Fuck!" They offered somebody else. Uh, 
Did you turn down the scholarship to UNCG? No, they pulled it. They pulled it back from me. They rescinded oh, it. Oh, they pulled it. Mm-hmm. Why they pull it? Fuck, I know. I guess they found somebody better for their ass. Mm-hmm. Once they grant it to you, they can't pull it. That's a lawsuit. Well, I mean, what is, I'm more like offering. They found on your transcript or something. No, I want not. I ain't signed that like they offered it. You know how they verbal okay, offer it yeah. to you. When you get the offer, as soon as you, whenever you put that pen to it, they yeah. can't rescind it. Yeah, I didn't. I ain't put no pen to it. I just kind of let me yeah. see it. Let me look at it and shit. Yeah, I would ask for that paperwork right away. And then they said, we Nah, we 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 cool. We got somebody else. So I took my ass up to the uh, Mars. Drove up the next day to sign that paperwork. I was mad, bro. I was mad as fuck, man. Damn right. <laughs> I, I really wanted to go to A and T. That's where I wanted to go. Uh. I want. Uh, I wanted to go no to A and T, man. No so I did. I, I was trying to get into A and T, all black school. I really just wanted to fuck on them hoes up there, man. But uh, it didn't happen like that. So it, you know, shit. I had to take my ass to Mars Hill, man. I could have been a fucking Aggie. <laughs> I could have, man. Shit. You just drove the dime and, and went to Central. Nah, see, I didn't want to be the, the only black school I wanted to go to in Carolina was A and T. Seriously, too much. I don't want to be at John C. C. Wells and uh, none other shit up there, man. I, it was either, and at the time, at the time, um, um the Charlotte was the Forty ers They didn't have a football team at the time, cause that would have been the move. They didn't have a fucking team at the time, bro. The Forty Nineers always. I thought they always had a team. Hell nah, man. They didn't have no. Te- they didn't have no fucking team. When did they, when did they start their team? The Charlotte 49ers, they were green, right? Yeah. Shout out to Darren Kincaid. Yeah, man. I should. I wanted to be an Aggie, man. Yep. Uh, I'm trying to find Aggie. that shit. Well, Aggie pride is... I'm not going to write my damn people. message. What do you say? Nah, I'm looking for that Steph Curry son and shit. That shit was right in my messenger. Hey, yo, Davion Nixon got his helmet on. You ain't want to rock with none of the, the um the circus black schools down there in Atlanta? Nah, I, I was trying to get away. Or did you just want to get away? You I, wa- know, I wanted to get away. Get the hell away. Which was crazy because a lot a lot of people went, when I when I came to Carolina were like, why the fuck you don't fuck with Georgia? It was a big thing. Like a lot of people that went to school in Carolina and shit. That were on scholarship. They were, you know, they were, you know, it would kind of be like this thing where Georgia better than Carolina. But when and then when I told them my team were the Panthers. See, you guys don't realize when when I was repping the Panthers and shit, Rodney Pete was the quarterback. <laughs> Fuck it. And I still was still I was still rude for them niggas. I, watching Rodney Pete get his ass blown out. Now, boss, I know no motherfucker can say shit about my fandom because I was still the motherfucker couldn't believe it. If, if you uh, that's why I, that's why I asked you the other day, um, uh, seven or four. Did you know a guy in the Hidden Valley by the name of Deuce? And um, there's another dude. Uh, you say Dukes? Deuce, D U C E. Oh. And there's another guy. Uh, fuck it. Uh, he he was a real big big name quarterback up there. Fuck. Jam- Jamarion, I think Jamarion or Jam. Fuck man, it was a big name quarterback out. I don't know if he ever went anywhere, but um, I, I think it was Myers Park. I think he went to Myers Park or some shit like that. But yeah, man. Yeah. I, yeah. Um. Yeah, I have to send it to your email. Send what? Sports. The shit with Curry. I was talking about. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, sign items. Yeah. So you see, just getting the shit. That, oh. Oh, when you say jerseys, equipment, or shoes, that's alone is gonna cost you five hundred. God damn! Basketballs four hundred. That nigga making money. Why? But why, why, why if I send that nigga a helmet? Three, the cheapest shit is three three forty nine. Well, why if I send him a helmet? He signed that shit. <laughs> For he real? Send that shit back. Why? Say it's the wrong Curry. Nah, tell that nigga to sign. If I send him a helmet to sign, yeah, he just a Panthers fan. That shit ain't gonna be worth shit. Yeah. And they don't play no football. Yeah, that's true. That's true. See, what's crazy is the shit that he's signing now, they're going to put that shit on eBay for twice as much as it. I mean, that's why I say, I mean, as bad as it is, look at this shit here. Motherfucker got a cam. Man, I ain't buying that shit. But uh, <laughs> $600 Cam Newton Carolina Panther photo. Get the fuck out of here. Who the fuck going to pay that? I won't dare pay that shit, man. No. 
So, Big Kai, I got to get my knees ready, too, bro. I'm not to warm up these knees. So nah, bro, I ain't never been to... I didn't never want to go to uh, Clark, Atlanta, or any of this bullshit down here. Yeah, because most people don't want to go nowhere where they live. You know what I'm saying? Or well, I just, Atlanta niggas are goofy, man. Atlanta niggas are goofy, man. Over grill wearing I motherfuckers. You, I bet you if UGA sent you a scholarship, you'd have been God over there. Goddamn right. Wish I could have went there. <laughs> <laughs> I sure would have. I, I'm going to be in Atlanta. I was even hesitant to even, even applying for black school. You would have been over there. Well, I, I, I'll tell you a story one day, man. Uh, what well, we got time? Actually, I had got a, a scholarship down here in Georgia t uh, to a school called Valdosta State, Division Two. Kirby Smart, the University of Georgia head coach now, he was the assistant coach down there. Yeah, he was the assistant coach down there, man. And um, I was a long story short, man. But my uh, my coach didn't like me, so he he held my letter from me, man. And um, when he got fired, he said, "Oh yeah, these came for you." Now, when he said these came for you, the 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 response date was like a fucking month past when they came. So I got my mom trying to get lawyer and get this motherfucker, but he fucked me. He didn't like me, man. Just didn't like my ass. And uh, Arkansas State. Arkansas State was uh, just getting started up. The Red Wolves, Arkansas State, fought also State. So that's how that shit turned out. But life is funny, man. What, whatever, why it didn't happen, it happened, man. It, it is what it is. But uh, yeah, I could have went to Vada also State and they um, Division Two. The year, the year they offered me was the year they won the national championship, Division Two. So that's how that turned out. So. But hey, man, it has, should happen for a reason, man. Hey, but y'all niggas do know we ain't signing no damn Gino. Fuck that. Uh, what you call it? Now, they Tom, you say our, he, uh, they go they they go against our little morals and shit. Yeah, yeah. He said he want young niggas only. <laughs> starting to worry about that nigga. Shut up in here. He says mom is an Aggie. <laughs> Hey, can I just send it to you? That's Steph Curry shit through the email. All right, let me check it out. I think I'm over here in Chef say that. It's a lot of it's a lot of great successful people that went to his store back in the world. Yeah, yeah. Clemson ain't shit. Yeah, fuck Clemson. I told you about Carolina too, Steph. Stop calling him that. They call him foam. Yo, lady. Like that shit, man. I was calling him seven before you was calling him four. Man, call that nigga foam, man. No, nigga. Y'all ain't see. Y'all ain't see we got a black quarterback. So they, they ain't can't be racist. Cause Matt Jones keep bringing in these recruits. Who got a, who got a black no, quarterback? I'm talking, about, I'm talking about the staff, bro. The staff over there. The environment. You see that black? You see Carolina try to apologize. That lady. It's like. Let me see who the Tar Heel football team play. play. Y'all don't play shit yeah, this year. Y'all always got the easy ass schedule. Let me see. Hey, I'm good. I wish we would have run up in y'all motherfucking asses. As long as we winning, I'm cool. I wish y'all play our asses. <laughs> we probably will. We'll show year, you man. some real tar here. Oh, y'all got Georgia State. That's what's up, man. Yeah, we uh, man, we use them for example. Only y'all gonna meet up with somebody is if y'all want to play in the same bowl or something. Right? Has Georgia and Carolina ever yes. played each other? Yes, yes, we beat the fuck out of uh, how? Yeah, we played it. Beat the fuck out of there. The What's that, Mitchell Chabissi? Whoop that motherfucker's ass. Hell, I don't even remember that. And Mitch wasn't even too long ago. In the Georgia Dome. Remember they came out here in the Georgia Dome? Is it Peach no, Peach? I don't remember that. You remember when they, man, you know the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> beat the fuck out of their ass. That's when um I think that's when Chubb went off on the ass. I'm not mistaken. We threw hey we hey, we threw a big victory party that night. <laughs> Speaking of Chubb, I got him coming. Hey, bro, we threw a big f fucking victory party, bro. Chicken as soon wings as that and shit. shit get here, I'm putting this shit up on my car for sale. What are you talking about? Nick Chubb. The pop. Yeah. You better hold that shit. I'm selling the hell out of it. What you got? This shit right up on my car. As soon as I get here. Some of the Cleveland. Yeah. Let me see, let me see who y'all got, man. Let me, hold on, let me see who y'all got. I only man. got it because that shit was cheap in the in the auction. Let's see who y'all got, man. We got to play all the Carolina teams, bro. 
y'all beat Virginia Tech. Y'all beat uh, State, Georgia State. Beat Virginia. Beat Georgia Tech. Y'all beat Duke. Beat Florida State. Bad. Why the hell are we playing UMass? Miami could be <laughs> tough for y'all. Notre Dame could be tough for y'all. I think y'all beat Wake Forest. All I know is 10-9. Beat Pittsburgh. Go over to Chapel Hill. Massacre. Y'all, y'all lose two games this year. I think y'all lose Notre Dame and Miami. Oh, yeah, we definitely ain't losing to Miami. You don't think so? <laughs> Fuck so. You see that dumb nigga come out talking about they're going to beat the shit out of Alabama? I said, now why he over yeah, there Yeah, I seen about? King. He better make sure he's straight and not injured. Bro. Last year fuck. we messed King up. Yeah, last year he got fucked up. Yeah, but I ain't, ain't worried about no Miami. We, we can beat Miami. I, think that Notre Dame I want us to worry good. about just beat Florida State, and we can beat uh, Notre Dame because they ain't got nobody. Because Ian Book's gone, them. and that's the only one that saved them. Y'all ain't beating us. You know, just stay in your lane, bro. Yeah. Uh, we got we good. We got y'all in October, so we got y'all early. Big baby steps. <laughs> y'all niggas playing Georgia State? <laughs> that's what I said. We we'll can use them as, as an example. Georgia State is shitty. Y'all schedule week as hell, man. Y'all got to oh, yeah, play Georgia State, UVA. They lost everybody last year. Georgia Tech is a young team. Duke, come on, man. Hey. Y'all first challenge is when y'all play us, then Miami, then Notre Dame. Wake Forest ain't going to be no problem to y'all. Pitt going to be decent this year. Motherfuckers better not sleep on that team, bro. They play Wofford. And then NC State last year, that rivalry game at the end of the year. Hey, fo- hey, hey, this nigga, ha- they had to schedule goddamn Jacksonville State back because they came close to whooping their ass. They had to they run it back. <laughs> <laughs> run that shit back real quick, though. They, they said run it back. Who won? Shit, had to run that shit back this year. That's some weak shit. Who won? Who won? I mean, you ain't beat nobody. I mean, they came close, but who won? Y'all going to start out 0 2. Y'all lose to Notre Dame, and I think Jacksonville State get y'all. Man, before I get over this song, let me go see who y'all play. <laughs> Let's see who y'all play. Shit, I already know we we going we going to the bank. We going to the bank uh, uh, uh and beat the shit out of Clemson. Y'all ain't going to no bank. Yeah, we is. We playing Clemson in the bank. Yeah, Clemson we, ain't gonna be there. Yeah, it is. Get, is the, it? get the fuck up off field. We're gonna beat the fuck up, guy. We're right, gonna beat the fuck right out of Clemson. Before we play the Jets, they get the fuck up off field. Oh yeah, that's the week before, huh? <laughs> I I'll, I'll tell Kirby take it easy. <laughs> yeah, I hope so. No, no, that's that's the old coach. Ain't ain't one of them sick. I think that's Miami coach though. No, no, that's Mike Rick. Mike Mark Mark Rick sick. Yeah, he he yeah. Nah, he, yeah. Yeah, God bless him, man. I think he got lupus. I'm not lupus, but uh, Parkinson's. Nah, yeah, facts. Yeah. Dumb G's on the I'm debating whether or not I want to go to that game. I know Kevin Kevin been talking shit about it. I'm debating whether or not I want to go to that game. No, nah, I'll be out of town that game. Never mind. I'll be at the beach that game. Oh, yeah, that's in September. Yeah. I'll be out there. That whole week, I'll be up here in Myrtle Beach, y'all. Is it uh, Nigger Bike Week or something that the week? What week is well, that? You won't be too far away. No, I think that's in May. Oh, okay. Uh, White week, I think. Yeah, it's just a nigger black week. Yeah, something like that. You just said black week, so like, why you gotta throw that extra word in? <laughs> you said you ain't gonna be too far from there. Charlotte ain't too far from there, is it? No, I'm just saying Myrtle Beach wasn't for, ain't far from the city. Mm. Yeah. I ain't been that motherfucker since I was a kid, man. Hey, I, I, me either. I ain't been to Myrtle in a while, my damn so. Mm-hmm. Hey, didn't y'all coach quit two seven? I mean, the cat. What do you say? Didn't y'all, didn't y'all damn coach quit? Nah, man. Mark Rick, uh, he he he. Uh, 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 Kirby Smart is our head coach. Oh, okay, so they got to play. So you got to play Clemson right away, first game of the season. Yeah, we're gonna beat the fuck out of them. Loss. <laughs> you know, you know, they got our quarterback at the number fifth quarterback coming out of the draft. Hopefully, you Car- got to play UAB. That's Carolina get him. You got to play South Carolina. Lost. <sighs> Vanderbilt wins. <sighs> Arkansas win. Auburn. I don't know what they look like this year. Man, I'm Auburn ain't shit. Auburn ain't never been shit. We always we swept Auburn the last two years with Derrick yeah, Brown. Florida, with Derrick Brown, Brown, nigga. Y'all you, See, you y'all niggas don't understand. Like too, y'all don't understand, nigga. We beat the shit out of South Carolina with J.C. Horn. 
We beat the shit out of Auburn hey. with Derrick Brown. So it ain't shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> Come on. Hey, 704, look, they died in Alabama. Alabama ain't on their schedule this year. Two, 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 two of our last goddamn picks. Hey, two of our last man. top ten picks. We beat the shit out of them. Two or two oh, of Carolina hey, Panthers yeah. top ten back. We already done whipped yeah, their ass. Alabama removed from their schedule. <laughs> no, they got to play each other in the conference in in, in the championship. If, if and also they make it. Hey, Jake. <laughs> <laughs> hey, seven oh four. This nigga in the chat said George Bulldogs suck. <laughs> George. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Who the fuck is George? The Texas A and M ticket at all. <laughs> I think. The, hey, but that Clemson game gonna be live though, man. Hey man, it's big motherfucking Funko Pop. Yeah, it's a big game in the beginning of the year, man. What y'all gonna do? Y'all got know the y'all got know the game first first game of the year. That's a big game. Yeah, that's a that's a good one. Who's your, who's our quarterback, by the way? Who's our quarterback? Yeah, a dude that was uh, a Heisman Trophy candidate two years ago. Help me out. Yeah, the dude that got the mangled leg, but he back. What's his name? He back. What's, what's the nigger's name? I said he's back. So y'all 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 fixing people again? It sounds familiar. Motherfucker always feel like they can fix fix a, up, fix a motherfucker together. Yeah, I know who's in my neighborhood. Well, hey, these people live over here. Black for the Fourth of July weekend. Oh right, yeah, I gotta get out of here, man. I don't know if y'all remember who DJ Humphreys is. Went to Mallet Creek High School. Play for the uh, Arizona Cardinals. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Defensive lineman. No, uh, the tackle to play for uh, Arizona ta- uh, Office of Arizona tackle, the Arizona Cardinals. DJ Humphreys for the Fourth of July weekend. Um, like he had a big ass cookout over his house. There was a whole bunch of cars in front of people's house. I think that was that Saturday, yeah. Either Saturday or Sunday. No, it was that Sunday, yeah, because I was coming back from Walmart and I seen that he, shit. So, the, yeah, it was Sunday. Uh, I mean, no, nah, I'm just saying he – well, DJ Humphreys is playing for the Cardinals right now. You oh, know, he okay. got a he got a new contract. Was it this all season? I think he did, yeah. Okay, I see him. I see him now. So, I guess he got – you know, niggas came home just to see their peoples and stuff probably before the season started and they had like a big-ass cookout. What, they had Lamborghinis house. and shit out there? Uh huh. No, I seen this drop top. Um, cause I ain't even go down this street, but I just seen a whole bunch of cars that was parked. Not. I did see this little drop top Mercedes though, all but. Hey, you better not go down that goddamn street. Shit. <laughs> they don't live here. I lived in motherfucking uh, live way before they did. Motherfucker, sure. but what the fuck you doing out here, nigga? Shit. Yeah, if anything, I want that Impala that's in the damn daddy damn driveway. That nigga don't move. That shit just sit there. What year? 96, 95? Or... Yeah, exactly. 96 kind. Yeah, them motherfuckers bad, man. Just wasting that shit away. I just got that shit sitting there. Why well, want to get that? Bit. It's, it broke down or something? No, I don't know, but shit. Yeah, your son a taco in the NFL. Way. I mean, he even got to go off his money. Shit. I know he working. Yeah, that that shit just sitting there getting beast, beast mode beat up by the sun. That's one of my favorite years, man, at 95, 96. Yeah, that's, that's my favorite. You got niggas that do, uh, they take the caprice, the bubble caprice, and try to make it like that. And to me, that's bullshit. Yeah, fuck that shit. Yeah, that, you know what I mean? They, they'll, they'll copy the, the decals and everything, man. Nah, that's true. And that shit lame as fuck, man. I take the 96 round body all day. Mm-hmm. If I'm not mistaken, um, what that motherfucker got on there? The, let me think. I think, it's a, I think it got a turbo on it, if I'm not mistaken. Hold on. I think there's a turbo on there. Hold on. Because they just had a car show in Rockingham this past weekend, too. Well, 4th of July weekend, I think. No, it's, a, it's a cold intake. Intake. Hold on. Turbo 96 Impala. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. That motherfucker's so hard to get now, man. Shit, I bet. You know, you got the. Let me ask you this. This is just your personal opinion here. How, how do you how do you like your car? You you like them all rim up and shit. I mean, some some it really depends on the car. 
Some ever, certain cars, you know, you, you can just do a uh, factory. You can just do the stuff. Have you ever have you ever drove car on rim? No, nah, yeah. I mean, especially with the like the something that's sitting up high, mm. you got to drive it a certain type of way. I, I don't like all that shit. It, it's heavy, man. The motherfucker's heavy, bro. Heavy. You mean your fucking car, man? That's why motherfucker transmission be blowing up if you ain't got a big enough transmission. Oh no, nah, you got got to know what you're doing. You can't. Put no big boy and then think you about to have a bullshit engine. Yeah, I had an 87 box Chevy, man. The only thing I had on it was, uh, uh, was it moon disc rallies? That's some moon disc rallies, tinted windows, and I ran, um, some Flowmaster from the manifold. You know, so that was it. That's how I rolled out, man. And, you know, yeah, because my people were well, certain ones, but most of them, I, everybody I know, they're going to do the. Work to the engine, then start working on everything else. Inside, right. out, and whatever else. That's right. If they gonna do it. Fuck them rim, man. Fuck them big 620. Hey, I be seeing these niggas down at 26s and shit. Like, why you fuck up a car like that, man? Ride that motherfucker, put you some... I mean, you could do a little rallies and shit, little racing rallies or whatever, however you want to do it. You know what I mean? I mean, but goddamn, man. The funniest shit to me is when you see a motherfucker catch a flat because they don't flew over a goddamn pothole. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so listen, fo, these niggas got 26-inch rim, but then the rest of the goddamn car got a spare on, on one of them. <laughs> so look at this stupid shit here. Look how fucking stupid that look, man. Yeah, I done seen that one before. Yeah. I had that shit in somebody's driveway jacked the hell up. You know what I'm saying? Shit, fuck up, man. <laughs> Shit, I ain't got nothing now, man. I got a company car now. Nah, that's a fact. It was about to hit five. I'm just sitting here fucking looking, thinking I gotta get my ass up in the morning for the. Oh shit, my what bad. You call it? Yeah, yeah, ain't, ain't shit going on. For here. the dentist. Nah, you good, sure. Uh, I ain't rushing. I'm just trying to think what the hell I'm gonna put on in the what, morning. What time the dentist is? Uh, eleven twenty. Oh, okay. Nah, I ain't got I ain't got no car now. I got a company car. They let they pay for gas and everything. I'm trying to save my oh, money if y'all ain't donating enough. <laughs> I want a, I want an old funky ass truck. You know what I mean? I, I, I listen. My heart is torn because I like it like what I want, and then when I need need like a truck, big boy truck, because I'm a big dude, you know. But I I want a fucking toy too. You know what I mean? Some I told you, bro. Like I want to burn the street. Cause down here on, on 85 and like 400 North and shit, you ever heard of the game Need for Speed? I love that shit. Oh, uh, no, that's a classic, yeah. Mm -hmm. I got a few of them still right here. No, no, I'm talking about when you be down there flying down the goddamn highway. To me, I like doing fucking 90 mile per hour and shit. Like, that shit is a rush to me. I love it. I love it, man. And then when I, like I said, when I used to have my box Chevy and shit, I used to be in and out of traffic and shit. Facts. Get your SUV. Yeah, I, yeah. See that 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 what I'm saying. I need I need something big, but I want a project. You see what I'm saying? Like what you just yeah, said facts. that that '96. Yeah, hell yeah. Now if I can get one of these niggas to steal me one, <laughs> I'm just playing. If I can get one of them motherfuckers, I'm cool. Like I'm cool like that. Slap a ten on it. Yeah. Uh, so I'll get you one of them for the low. It just depends on. What about ten? Oh hi. Uh, shit, could probably be less really, cause my homeboy do the auction thing, the cars with the auctions. Oh, he be getting it from the police. Uh, I mean that one, that one was just kind of just a car auction period. Really, it's not even one with the police, cause she do other shit. But yeah. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been trying to look for some nasty ride there. Uh, yeah. Facts, I think that's how he found his car, I and mean, he just worked on it hell of a year. Yeah, see? That's what I'm saying. So he built it all the way up. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Jay, what did Jamie say? He said, that's some RS big cat. Most niggas would never said that. <laughs> yeah, for real, bro. For real, bro. Yes, sir. I'm for real about that. What'd he say? <laughs> about but tell about getting get a nigga to steal me a <laughs> <laughs> I should have said that shit. <laughs> these still, uh, these niggas down here, man. Hey, goddamn, get you one. Goddamn, had the numbers changed up. 
You got a motherfucker at the DMV working there, you know what I mean? Or get you a little bitch that work at the DMV. Or, you know, like, or, or you got a nigga who fuck, or fucking with a bitch at DMV. Shit, your number, your tab be riding clean down here, bro. <laughs> For real. But, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, my girl work at the DMV. You shoot that nigga some money, then, you know, he gonna make sure his bitch do what she do, you know what I mean? You got clean paperwork, man. On your, on your serial number and shit. So, no, the, facts. you know, when the roller get behind you and shit, you know what I mean? Shit. Yeah, you good to go. You wouldn't care if it is, though. Right, yeah. Pick that shit off, put some other shit on there, and keep riding. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Well, put a stolen chain up. For real. Direct told him, keep it moving. Keep the shit moving, man. Yeah. Wow. All right, man. I'm going to get the fuck out of here, man. Um. Hey, last time I got out this motherfucker, I went to McDonald's. I think I'm going to hit that bitch again. You like McDonald's? I'm a sorry to my damn somebody else getting killed. Um, we'll tell y'all McDonald open up there. Shit, it's fine. It might be open now. Kind of 